Hello, how's it going? Welcome, welcome to this, uh, ghoulish afternoon. How's it going? Hey there, how are you doing? Welcome. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's, uh, you know, you know, today, hold on, let me put on, hell yeah. <laughs> yeah, you, you know, like, um, t t you know, t today's the day, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's the hell out of the ween, I guess, you know, it's, it's a day I... <laughs> It's kind of cool, you know, I guess. Um, that doesn't have to do anything with what it used to be. But still, you know, the skeletons. The skeletons. <laughs> like in can't see. There's also skeletons. So the logical conclusion is that, that we play can't see today. Right? <laughs> this makes sense. Um, yeah, no, I mean... You know, since so this, this, this month, usually I do, I do a lot of uh, themed stuff during October. But this time I just... I just really wasn't feeling it. <laughs> you know, like, like, you know, last time we had Blattober, and then before that we had Shootober, and before that, well, I didn't do anything because I don't think it was streaming. But, uh, still. You know, still do. Uh, th 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 this time around, you know, we're just, we're just gonna be playing Kansi. It's probably gonna be like a one-off thing as well. You know, I, I went ahead and did some light modding. And, you know, we, we, we got a bit of a journey ahead of us. Um, one that we are likely to maybe not survive, and especially the end of it. Um, yeah, you, you'll, you, you'll see, you'll, you'll see once we get to, uh, the goal if, if we do. Um, uh, yeah, pretty much long story short, it's just like a bunch of, uh, a bunch of ghouls and ghasts that I, um, got for this here. And, um... Basically, what I wanted to do was hopefully be able to show off the majority of those, and um, also, you know, uh, you know, just 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 gonna have have a bit of a travel arc there. Alrighty, now now pass the skeletons in the background. Pause them. Uh, there's there's no need for them. No 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 need for them anymore. Let's go. Like I, I did also think of doing a. A Morrowind thing, right? Where, where I get some of Morrowind's horror mods, which, oh boy, they, they are something, man. Morrowind does have some some pretty wacky horror mods, but um, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's oh yeah, right. I, I still have this guy. Yeah, let me get rid of him. You know, unlike. Unlike Quake, Kenshi actually does have game capture, so so that's fine, you know, that's cool. 
But, um... No, from all the game stores. Hold on, it's, it's a little quiet. It's, it's a little... I'll put it up to 50. To a 0.5. Yeah, you know, it was just the usual stones, you know, and, uh... Crane wave test. Yeah, let's ignore those, okay? Um... You know, like, like there's your know, rock bottom, the classic, right? Guy with his legendary step out and millionaire, which literally starts you off with millionaire and the play style is Mr. Money, you know, rich guy. And, you know, nothing, no, no, nothing too crazy. So, you know, we're, we're gonna be going with something equally not crazy. I mean, you know, bad luck, it sucks. <laughs> right, that, that, that's one that has a lot of text to it as well. Mongrel guards, I mean, draw and protect mongrel, I mean, eh, right, kind of hard. How, how many people would you even start with? I, I don't even know. Losing my limbs? <laughs> the adventure begins? What's what's that one? More ways to have never seen the world besides whatever you live but now. The day has come, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's fine. Um, is it the bounty hunters one? No. There's, there's a specific one. Ah, it's the Stranded Bounty Hunters, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You know, because they, they, they start at the very... The very far islands, you know, which I think are a good start. Now, you know, again, we're gonna be going in with, with some spooky, scary skeletons. So, so I hope you guys, you know, you, you don't get spooked too much, right? Like, like we would hate to, to have that now, right? Um... There we go, let me just uh, do some that. But yeah, how are you guys doing? Welcome, welcome. It's about to be done loading, I'm sure. Yeah, did I? I did a little bit of a test run, and um, well, it went ways. So, so we have, we have Guy, with Guy with, with Sword. We have a guy who has a uh, crossbow. And we have a guy who has stick. But it's sharp. No, ob obviously. Obviously, we're gonna change the, the, the race to Bone Man. Now, it's gonna look so scuffed. Yeah, so we're gonna have a Bone Man Hiver because, as you can clearly tell, they are made out of bone. And they are clearly man. <laughs> Um, also hyper because the helmet kind of fits to a hyper, so that's that. Um, let me just slowly zoom in. You know, like if we were to disable the clothes, that's kind of what it looked like. The bone hyver. But we're gonna have them. We're gonna have them on for, for now. Uh, I guess you can see, they, they kind of get boosts to a lot of stuff, but like less strength because they're made out of bone. But, um, yeah, let's make our, our little bone boy. Right, if... Oh yeah, it's cool. That's a cool bone guy. But he's also really big and skinny. Oh. Sir, he he, he does his hip, hip thrust every time. It's like he's about to about to dance. <laughs> yeah, yeah, big big no, short legs. Big torso short legs. And then like no no bulk anywhere because clearly guy here is shooting, right? So so how come he... Except for the pants, dude. I want the pants to be like... <laughs> there we go. Now that's... That's more of a fashion statement than anything here right now. Yeah, you know, there's just, just the guy's face, right? Because you have skeleton. That's also it. Um, we can also change the size, obviously. You know, no, 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 nothing, nothing too unusual. You know, it's just, just your your good old Hiver, Hiver shenanigans, but long neck, long Hiver neck. Hell yeah! Right, next one. Oh yeah, what do we call him? It's not Bounty Hunter. Uh, it's gonna be. Shit, it's the names again. <laughs> I always get stuck on the naming. <laughs> conventions here um Ivor made out of bone let's call him no 
Yeah, I, I was about to go with, like, chitinous bones and stuff, but no, 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 it's, uh... Bone-tin. Yeah. Bone-tin. Then, then we get this one, you know, currently a female Greenlander, now a Shack. Because why not? Well, we got we got the Shack skeleton here, you know, it's gonna be uh, arms crossed, yeah, yeah. Uh, skin tone burned. I want them to be cinched. Um, it's gonna be small but powerful, you know. Bulky frame. Uh, noble posture. Big neck. Uh, short legs, though, st still small. But but everything else is really bulky, right? It's oh God. It's it's oh boy. Oh boy. Let me tell you what, th this is a little power cube. Right there. Little, oh. I I think he has chainmail on. I think that's what we're seeing. The chainmail right there. Big neck. Massive jaw. Yeah, yeah that nah, looks absolutely fine to me. Looks, looks okay. Um... Come spine because it's a shack. <laughs> Some might call it a little race, but I don't think so. Now we go with normal bone human, right? We call him. We call him ribs. Now this this is gonna be good old ribs. Uh, the idle stance. This is ah uh, uh, yeah, yeah. It's, it's gonna be the weird guy you see, but just just for customization's sake. We'll go with this here, right? You know, it's just, it's, it's, it's like your, your average skeleton. No, no, nothing, nothing crazy going on. Nothing, uh, I don't know, no, nothing, nothing too wild. You know, just, 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 just your skeleton, boy. You know, it's very average. Yes. Big hands, though, big hands. Bit of a chest. No stomach, because it's a skeleton after all. Yeah, one is ribs to show. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, you know, it's uh, it's, it's perfectly, perfectly normal skeleton guy, right? With uh, with a average sized head, with an average sized or not so neck, big and wide neck, and it's long. That that's like his thing, you know, is is having a big neck. And then he go, then he like crouches down on all of his force, you know, and then then his posture. <laughs> it's like a little ghoul, you know. Yeah, Rips is a little crazy, you see. But yeah, that's about it. So yeah, yeah, that. Oh boy, <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, yeah, that's Kenshi, all right. That 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 that's a that's a Kenshi right here. Yep. That's, that's, you know, let's go spine here. The game's trying to load in everything. Yep, those are, those are skeletons, quite literally as well, like, um, mechanically speaking, they're all skeletons, you know. I love mega squatting. Yeah, I mean, th that's how I play games, right? This is my posture right now. I, I actually don't even own a table. There's, oh look, it's beep. We could see, let's see, but um, you know, I I I just like squat down. Uh, I only have a monitor on the floor, and uh, my keyboard is somewhere else. Kill beep. I, I honestly don't care about beep. Uh, no, 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 not in this run, absolutely. But um, yeah, let's let's look what our guys are about, right? Like like this guy. Oh, that's tough. That's tough. You know, just wearing off katanas and pretty much any other weapon. Um, what I can tell you is that, well, well, how do you get to minus 14 stealth? Um, their stuff is randomized, right? So, due to it being ra do you have even a katana? Do you even have one? He has a katana, he has a saber, but the guy who's actually kind of good with katanas doesn't have one. Hey, this is, that's, that's a big old 50 right there. 
57 melee attack and oh, and he, he is actually not bad. Then, you know, we got Spine, who, who's not as good with katanas, but good with sabers and hackers and, like, that stuff. This Eid, with, uh, with shooting, actually, he has some melee attack. He has a reasonable amount of toughness. Uh, six strength, this guy's 20. He actually, wait, seven perception? Oh no, he's blind. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> and he has to go with the crossbow. Yeah, but, uh, yeah, it's not too good with Katanas. He might, he might just drink Katanas there. But, uh, yeah, yeah, that's, that's, that's this guy. And then, then, last but not least, we got this guy, who's also not that good with Sabres. But his perception is also arguably absolute shit. You know? And, yeah, like, because the skeletons, they kind of aren't really that strong. Are you good with sabers? You also go with sabers. I honestly think I should give the one guy the saber. 19 crossbow. 17. 24 crossbow. Actually, that small guy is just pretty good at shooting. As uh, actually arguably the best at shooting. You know, and uh, uh, here I thought Spine would be the guy who, who we send in to, to like, uh, murder people. And it's, it's pretty funny. They, they have field medic. Uh, we won't be using that. I'm most certainly played it's hard. But, uh... Yeah, if, if, if Fang Rips is gonna be doing some... Some trading here. Like, you drop this because I forgot how to actually trade. <laughs> okay, you... You pass, you pass. Okay, and then... Can't pick... What, what do you mean you can pick that up? What, what do you mean you can't pick that up? We can pick it up. What do you mean? Why can no one pick it up anymore? No, is it because it's like so massive it actually doesn't fit your inventory? Is that the reason behind it? Wait. No. No, no, no. This is the guy with, with, with the big old chopper, right? So, so we'll give him the big old chopper. And this he, he can keep the katana. Is this guy any good at katanas, ribs? Eh. Eh. Just kinda eh. He is better at melee, though. And at shooting, honestly. This guy's just good with cross... Uh, with turrets. But, uh, not crossbows too much. Precise shooting, you know, that's... That's that's valued. That's valued. He also has some of it. But, uh... Okay, wiki. Wiki idea, though. Wiki idea. So we... Give this guy... The... The prototype spring band. Right. If only I could actually turn items, that, that'd be kind of really cool. Well, something we gotta do is go to, to our local um, engineering shop. Wherever the hell that is here in Mongrel. Um, here. See, because we're, we're skeleton. Made out of bone marrow. Reps is pretty quick though. Gotta give him that much. He, he is quick. What's your athletics like? Um do 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 Athletics 59 39 39 But you know heavy lightweight weight less So you can guess who's probably gonna be uh the runner <laughs> and who we will leave behind in case things go bad I'm sure you can imagine who that is gonna be. A skeleton of a different kind? Anything for sale, buddy? Oh, that's not what I was thinking of. We just need them repair kits, you see, and that that that's really about it. Um we we can we can trade you medicine. You know, we we genuinely don't need medicine, like like we really, really don't. Yeah, yeah, that's this good skeleton repair kit. Authentic. Yeah, I mean, this is authentic, you see. And, you know, the other one is a little more expensive, so, you know. Hmm. Well, we, 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 gotta, we gotta save some, some sort of weapons, right? We got... Oh, beep! Stop following me! Like this, right? Actually, hold up. Let's just just throw all of our medicine at him, right? 
Yeah, you have some ammo, I mean, that's just good and all. I think everyone should have their own repair kit, you see. So they can actually repair kit themselves. I think that's fine for now. So, we're basically already down pretty much all of our money. <laughs> um, if we really do want to, we can we can remove our... You know, our, 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 our crossbow in a shop. You know, yeah, I'd, li I'd like to gear up a little, right? Uh, that's armor. And that's, that's backpacks. That's another mechanic shop, but less fantastic, of course. Um, you know, I'd li like to do it now before nighttime, you know? There's a bar. Any, any, any... Sp that, that's like a weapon. That, that, that's... That's like a weapon right here. And I uh, I think that'll be just fine. Uh Spine. Oh, Spine, you need to be a little, a little better at it. Move a little quicker, perhaps. But really, the only one who kind of needs a weapon is uh, Ribs. Holy fuck. <laughs> How much for this thing? 19,000? What the fuck? Is that a Spine? It's your phobia? An actual spine back there? Um, I mean, a small katana wouldn't be bad, I imagine, you know, but, uh, it's really not about, like, the katanas, it's more like, what can we, f I mean, I'd love to have one of these, right? Um, I'd absolutely love to. Uh, thing is, right? <laughs> See, the thing is, though, I, um... I don't think I have anyone who's actually good at stealth. Wait, no, that's not true. This this guy actually is good at stealth. I mean, he also gets a massive minus due to the equipped armor. Which, frankly, is rather heavy. Like, to be fair, he also has that blackened chainmail, which is pretty good. Right? Like, he, he can hold himself in a fight. Well, that is... If only he wouldn't be using a katana, which he is right now. Right, no, we, 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 need, we need to swap weapons here again. <laughs> so, Spine, if anything, you hold a saber, and you hold a katana. Frankly, you don't care too much about it. So, well, the other one does. God, what a gamer pose. What a, what a gamer pose this guy has here. You know, at least they, they're, they're, they're super chill about, like, you know, having actual skeletons in here. You know? Problem is, like, everyone has a... Actual strength stat. Even B pass. A zero. <laughs> like, our, our, our guys aren't necessarily to be considered strong. You know? But at least they have some toughness. Ah, oh, man, I mean, I... I'd really, I'd really love some weapon... You know, like, like, even if it's like a, a tiny, tiny katana, you know, but, uh... Jesus, you, 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 you're busting my balls up here, man! How good is my guy at martial arts? Eh. I, I, I guess Rips is gonna go in martial arts. You know? I suppose so. He has no weapon. He, he doesn't. Meanwhile, there's just, like, people beating up the Fogman already. You know? It's already... It's already happening. They're already going in. So, yeah, we, we gotta... Um, let me show you the road trip. So, we're here in Mongrel, right? The Fog Islands. Now, we have to go all the way down to Stove Scamble. Like, around here, to be specific. Near the crags. So, get quite away. And then we get quite away. There's Flat Lagoon, there's just the sand in between, there's just the swamp, there's the burning forest, there's the bone fields, Royal Valley, you know, Gracia. It's, it's a few things in the way. You know, the wetlands, maybe the spider's plains, you know, or the, or the stand desert, Orkin, you know. All of all of those psychos, they're around here. So yeah, yeah, you know that's that's it's gonna be it's gonna be a bit of a journey. 
And I also don't imagine like you can sell those blunt weapons here for a lot of money. It's like really, really nothing. It's really nothing. Um, are you good with blunts? But oh yeah, he's actually pretty good with blunts. He's gonna be smoking a blunt now. Then again, you know, it's it's the fog man. Can't really expect them to have something good. It's the rusting blade model. Beep, what the fuck, beep? You follow me all the way out here? Well, it's your lucky day that I actually can attack you just like that now, can I? Completely, I'm... Who the fuck? What's up, Falkman? Oh, look, it's more Falkman. Hey, why don't, why don't we get a bit of a warm-up as well, you know? Peep's just kind of standing there. <laughs> you know, it's just, it's just kind of hanging out. You know, one, one, one word against, you know, we might as well. You know, we might as well get some, some combat expertise up. Well, that one's gone. There's a severed hyper leg. I thought his deck would be a little better. But yeah, you know, the thing with skeletons is they, um, they kind of don't heal. You know, they they kind of gotta, gotta do a bit of the repair kits. Shenanigans. I mean, they, they do heal to some degree, but like not too much. Not a big degree. Deep. Hey, you can't say I didn't warn ya, Beep. You can't say I didn't warn ya. It's more like spine back there should like hurry up a little. Guys being super heavy right now. Okay, are we actually gonna use a crossbow? Don't I know that's <laughs> that's the real question. Are we actually ever gonna use a crossbow? I personally kind of doubt it. So how far do you think Beep's gonna follow me out? Like it's it's Beep. You know, he is just kind of like tagging along without actually being part of the the gang. Imagine this is like a class photo, right? Like like we have we have the squad here and then there's like beep in the background. You know, that's, that's basically what I feel like right now. Oh yeah, also, if we were to go to, to, to the faction, let's rename us to the Rattlers. Yeah, that's us. We rattle. We rattle along. Now, you know, as much as I like starting from absolute scratch in this game, I don't think it's that suitable for, for this here. Like, maybe, maybe in another run I'll, I'll do a fog island thing. We're just starting the fog islands with people that aren't actually just skeletons and actually can be devoured. You know? Just, just to add to detention. And, uh... God damn it, Spine. It's gonna be the death of us. Gotta, gotta level up your... Your everything, really. Especially your strength, man. It sucks. No wonder you're just slow. A again, Beep, are, are you sure you wanna... <laughs> are you sure you wanna do this, Beep? Beep, you can still go back. Uh, th There's still a chance. Wait. Alright, Beep. You chanced. You, you, you got your chance. Oh, seems like these Fogmen actually caught someone. Oh, there goes Beep. Oh, Beep, Beep throwing that left hook. Kind of getting fucked up. And Beep's down. I mean, you're kind of alive. Beep. Oh, Beep's eating himself. Where are they going? You find that one. I think they were all too busy fighting, like, a singular guy. Or, or did they just get reinforcements? Hmm. Hey, you know, at, le at least they don't have to worry about, like, eating. You know? Yeah, yeah, there's a spine aside. Spine got a kill. Come on, Rip. Show me what you got. You, you, you can do this. You can do this. Yeah, we definitely are gonna need a few more repair kits, aren't we? Like, his right arm is about to be, like... Well, alright, it, it is already dysfunctional here. You need, like... You might need, like, a little off-weapon, like, off-hand weapon there, buddy. Come on, guys. Come on, you, you can take on a group of Fogmen at least, surely. Just a little group. 
of nobodies. Not this guy's arm, <laughs> just dangling there. He's about to lose his other arm. He's gonna be unable to do anything. Hey, hold on. Where are you guys going? Where are you guys going? Don't don't go don't don't go chasing spurs in the fogs. I get at least smack smack down on the ones that are like still crawling away. No survivors, you know. And additional training that is. What about what about you there? Who who are you? Escaped servant from the holy nation? Oh no. <laughs> they got a fog count as well. It's uh it's quite the creature actually. But oh well, I mean hey I'm cool if they like pick up that one guy. Oh my god, there's uh, uh, so many fog counts! <laughs> It's the unexpected! <laughs> oh my god. Is, is that a alpha? It's pretty big. Yeah, yeah, that that's that's one of the uh, one of the bigger ones. Hey look, all I can tell you is this guy's not gonna be running away. This is gonna be this is gonna be gaining toughness here. Alright guys, time to reboot while there's one guy in the air and the other guy's being eaten. Yeah, it was going well until like the fog counts appeared. That 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 that's when that's when shit had the fan. But at the very least, what's this guy, bro? At the very least, and we're not gonna be bothered any longer by, by like everyone there. Chest, you know, needs oh well, <laughs> needs some help. Guys, just just play dead. Just just stay down. Play dead a little. Fall counts running off right now. Anywho, right? Do do some do some tender love and care. They're not gonna notice, yeah? They 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 seem pretty busy. Oh, well, at least you need to care about yourself right now. Oh no, it's fine. They they didn't notice. <laughs> they don't notice. Who the hell are you? I like it. It's, it's uh, wait, no, no, it's zombies. Oh no, you know what's also really bad? It's zombies <laughs> from the zombie horde. <laughs> and it comes in, uh, to a Fortnite ad. Ah oh, yes. Well, yeah, yeah. That that's that's like hyper zombies that we have here now. Now, again, they, they, they don't seem to care. Or maybe one cares. Maybe. Yep, yeah, just, just just some zombies. Just your good old zombies. And um, it seems like the zombies are also currently trying to kill the, the fog counts to... No real success. Um, yeah, it's just zombies, you know, like, uh, what really can you expect from these guys? They they barely have stats. That's that's the stuff we're used to, to train, right? You gotta keep spawn protected. Dude, spawn with a skeg. Spine, heal yourself, come on. Don't be a fool. And then, and then you, you kick on that one. Spine on! <laughs> Not the fog out again. Okay, look. Let's let's have let's have uh Bone Ten help you. Oh, one's already down. Two's already down. Come on, Bone Ten. You're like you're like the best fighter, apparently. Blocking all the attacks. Yeah, those things are tough. Oh my god, there's just more of them again! <laughs> The classic bamboozle. The zombies are all crawling away, getting eaten by the fog man and the and, and the hounds. Jeez. There's a zombie and a fogman just, just crawling. Minding their own business. They beat up the zombie at the very least, right? Yeah, I feel like Spy needs some some medical attention here. 
I said, I said, spine may need some medical attention here, because it's really not feeling it. Well, you know, Rips, Rips back here is gonna take care of a handful of zombies, you know. And Falkman, Falkman, zombies. I mean, really, there's just barely a difference. Except for zombies, actually carry items on them. That may hold, that may hold some market value. Maybe. Like this, this here, it's 200 bucks. Right there, you know, some, a, f a few hundred coin. All right, come on, buddy. We, we gotta, we gotta get you fixed up. One more of them foghounds appear. Speaking of, the foghounds fighting a lot of zombies. <laughs> And absolutely wiping the floor with them right now because again they're they're just kinda like just, just zombies. They're not actually good. Well dude, don't don't hit him in the back like this. What the fuck? Kick him. Kick him. He kicked Bonten. He get his friend too. I don't care if you eat the zombie, though. Like, like that's that's you, you. You can go eat all the zombies you want. Well, do 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 some self repair stuff. I can just hit him in the chest. He went down just like that. All right, guys. I mean, we're, we're we're not about to like die and stuff. So, oh no. <laughs> hey, hey, Rebs. Ribs? Ribs? <laughs> you gotta leave, man. We gotta leave. <laughs> they keep getting reinforcements, buddy. Spine and all, you know, they're, they're gonna be okay, you know, they're gonna, they're gonna be just fine. All we gotta do is, uh... Gotta understand, man, you... You got a medical supplies on ya, alright? I don't know, I'm gonna chase you all the way to Mongrel now, are they? I say clearly being chased all the way to Mongrel. Hey, honestly, you're still got a good fight. Uh, it's pulling up a bit of too much of a good fight, honestly. Hey guys, don't worry, I'm here to help. My god, did it just spontaneously manifest back there? What do we have on you? Ball count ahead? Nice. It's money. It's money right there. There's money to be made. Right there. So how's uh, your friend doing? Uh, who's right next to someone who's being eaten alive currently? Let's take them hands. You know? Let's take those fuck out hands and... Uh, gonna hang out a little. Yeah, this guy is not really feeling it right now. Like he 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 sure got beaten up. Now do you think if he tries to crawl away that he'll actually make it? I'd hope so. But um Yeah Nah, nah, I doubt it, I doubt it. You know, it's gonna be laying on the floor, being, being rather, rather in a bit of distress, actually. Meanwhile, I can hear, like, screams from the valley down here, because the zombies apparently still are able of feeling, like, everything while being beaten up by the fog men right now. And the fog counselors are pretty bad. Trust me, there's, there's even worse things in the fog. And then, then some hound. Or, you know, the likes of that. I, I, I just kind of want to, like, wait for those guys to, like, move away so I can actually just, like, recover them. Like, surely. Can't be that hard, right? Pop. We don't catch it today? Yes. We are. We are. We're, we're, we're the bone boys. Some good old bone boys. And I was just totally bone marrow, not much the fuck man actually want here. With this pretty loud droning. Surely it'll it'll be 
it'll be uh, safe to go down here. Let's go. Oh, wait, no, there's, there's Vogue Dogs. They might have seen me. <laughs> All right, let's move away again. Let's wait for them to pass. Little, little doggies. Right then, um... So, buddy. It's... Oh, you can walk, lovely. <laughs> well... <laughs> see you in a bed again, okay? <laughs> yeah, uh... Power counts... One-on-one... -on -one. Probably not gonna happen too well. Uh, this guy, honestly, you should just kind of lay down and uh, just kind of like enjoy uh, while he still has limbs, actually. And just, just enjoy life, relax, relax a little. And it's down again. Now it's expected. You know, there's the occasional zombie walking around as well, but, you know, without <laughs> arms, they're not going to be doing much. You got to understand, those are martial arts zombies that want to eat you. You know, similar to the Fogmen, but not quite. You know, not quite. <laughs> Don't worry, no pressure. No pressure, serrated. Alrighty, is, is the coast actually clear this time around? Uh, I gotta feel like we need to emergency evac uh, spine first. I feel like we'd need to do that. Stealth. Well, he leveled it up, but he's still awful at it. At least he has some stealth, right? Ah, you know, just, just pick him up and run away. Um, I don't know, run, run somewhere slightly more manageable. Like, it, it, it was going well. Until the foghounds appeared. You know, that's 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 where things started going south. You know? But is this modded? I don't know, what do you think? <laughs> well, what, 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 what do you think? <laughs> We're playing literal skeletons. There's zombies and foghounds. <laughs> it's uh, it's not vanilla for sure, yeah. It's, uh, it's really not vanilla. <laughs> I wouldn't be playing just Kenshi, right? A blood spot is still broken? I, I, I don't know, like... <laughs> I haven't played this in a while, I, I haven't come across them, but... I would imagine not. I would imagine it's fixed by now. Alrighty, I'm gonna put you down here because it's actually somewhat more manageable. And, um... Yeah, yeah, just, just step on the zombie. That, that zombie's gonna be dying now. Now you 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 do some you do some lovely self repairs while this guy goes back down again gets uh, boned in. In the meantime, but yeah, you know, um, what's, what's like scream? Who's being eaten alive? Or, or, is it like all those guys down here? Maybe. You know, again, you gotta realize there's there's worse thing in the fog than than just some fog man and uh, and some. Demonic hounds and like bodies that are flying in the air. Yeah, there, there, there's worse things. Okay, well, this is pretty awkward. Again, I I don't think I can take them on one by one, uh, one on one yet. Maybe, like they 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 seem to do a good amount of damage. We're play, replacing limbs with bones. My man, my my limbs are bones. <laughs> My limbs are bones. <laughs> There's no replacing I need to do. They they just are bones. Right. Well, got got this guy. S surely, surely they won't notice too much, right? You know, like like stat wise, yeah, they they are inferior, but like they still do a lot of damage, and and we are a little hurt. We might need to fight this one here. We may, we may. And we'll do just that. Yeah, like, again, good good chunks of pain right there. All, all in the stomach area too, that we still have apparently. And we're done. <laughs> what I mean, right there. <laughs> and there he goes, running off to the wilderness. This guy's still helping out himself. That, that, uh, that, this one, this one zombie just like crawling down the hill. 
At least he's fine. I suppose. At the very least. Yeah, I mean... Oh, guys, back up. Yeah, go, go, go and try and help your comrades down there. In terms of medicine. Uh, but can you just yank bones, uh, bones and sock at them? That's not how the game works. <laughs> I'm afraid that's not how it works. Right then. Gotta do some... Augmenting. Some repairing. This guy's gonna eat a zombie. Can you speak as a scally? Like, what are the rules? It's... Just a skeleton. <laughs> like... Like, there, there, there's, there's nothing incredibly crazy going on. It's, you know, just disguise being skeletons, you know. They're basically like the skeletons in vanilla, except for the ranks with skeletons. And that, that's about it. We, we're, we're just on a little pilgrimage going from here to... To here. And, yeah, I'm just, just gonna want to show off some mods. And that's really it. Just a reskin. Kind of, except for it's its own race, too. Like they have their own thing going on. But yeah, basically just a reskin, yeah. Like, look, look, I, I, I'm just modding the game to be in theme of Halloween. That, that's about it. <laughs> that, that's, that's about all that's going on right now. Like, like don't, don't expect anything super convoluted right now or, you know, um, mind-bending. <laughs> yeah, just, just, you know, a couple of guys being skeletons, like, in the literal sense. And, um, yeah. Well, so I think Beep got eaten. Oh, oh, this is free money right here. Yeah, yeah, you know, like, like, just, just, just Halloween stuff. That's literally it. It's going on. That, that, that thing took off. Yeah, that, 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 that thing just kind of took off there. All right, let's go to our machinist gun. Right, let's see you around. Let's see you around. You take care. No, no, can can I can I just like sit on the bed? Like I know a guy has called Spine. He he kind of would need some repairs. You see, um, you think you can arrange that? Oh my God, three thousand! Like all my money. Hey Spine, you go, buddy. You 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 needed the most. You see, you needed the most. Rips is okay. And, you know, Bonten is, is just getting there. It's fine. You, you really got fucked up in there. I'm gonna be honest. You really did. And, and, and enjoy your, uh, your, your wacky bed, however, okay? You, you, you do enjoy that. Okay, now, now, go ask the man if you can sell the crossbow. Because I really doubt we're gonna be, uh, we're gonna be doing anything with this thing. I, I, I honestly am rather doubtful that we're gonna do anything with that stuff. Uh, this one repair kit is about to be, like, completely used up. Yeah, like, you still have the normal cybernetic limbs, but that, that's, that's nothing I really care about here. It's not really a thing. Like, Karif. But yeah, it's your good old Halloween-themed Genshi. Gonna do some good old Halloween themed shenanigans here. Just us being on a bit of a pilgrimage here. Alright, I'll see you around. I'll see you around. Hey, don't mind me. Just, uh. conglomerating here with uh, my. my buddies. Going in. Sneaking. And, um. Definitely. Oh. And definitely not trying to pick the lock. <laughs> and they won't know. Oh shit. First try, really? What a lucky roll. Um, yeah, you actually got a bonus on stealth. Frankly, I'm rather surprised. Okay, now. Where, where's, the, where's the good stuff, man? Where's the good stuff? It's in the vault, is it not? Oh, it totally is in the vault. Try to secure for the chest, man. Come on. 
Do it for the Scally Gang. Yeah, let me just 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 kind of close the door there. You know, nothing, nothing to be seen, nothing to be had. That's 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 some um, that's masterwork stuff right here. And and as always, we're just gonna save here as bone crime. No, you know, there's, there's a below 50% chance we'll actually be able to yunk stuff here. Okay. We get one. One thing. We get some katanas. We get some katanas in here. Our current katana is... I mean, yeah, it's good at cutting. You know, 98. 0.98 rather. I like them sabers. Uh, don't get me wrong, but you know, just just nothing. No, no, no katana that's like too crazy right now. Why don't you level up your lock picking a little bit on this chest, and hopefully you'll actually get somewhere uh, doing that. You no, know, before the actual owner gets back home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, we're getting there now. We're getting there now. Model Mark Two. Now, those things do have some chop to them. Now, those things sure do have a bit of a chop. They have a bit of a bite. The forked cleaver. Yes, yes. Okay, I mean, I mean this one would be, like, the better choice. Hmm. But he got caught stealing. That's a shame. That's a shame. Well, let's, <laughs> let's try it again, shall we? Got caught stealing. Alright. Three times the charm, right? Uh, hey, there we go. Yeah, I mean, he he, he he got caught. He is already caught, you know? But, you know, if, if you get caught, what you might as well do is steal as much as you can, right? Like, that, that, that is, that is the least you can do. Right? So, you know, the, the, the guards are probably on their way. Or most likely... Oh, it's literally dude sleeping here. No, it's not, not, not for you, it seems. Not for you. Alright, so... How are you doing with them hackers? Not too good, but sabers. Sabers are your thing. And this little saber, you see, it's 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 somewhat better than what you currently have. That is that is a fact. Hey Rips, come in here. Let's do some trading, yeah? Uh you have a leather turtleneck. How about you get this masterwork grade leather armor? How about it? And are you good with hackers? You're also more of a saber guy. Especially heavy weapons is his thing. Heavy weapons and blunt weapons are like his specialities. That's not what I wanted to do. It's, uh, it's rather awkward. Just, just normally trade with him, okay? <laughs> um... Yeah, I mean, it'd be good to have an actual weapon with you. So probably be, be them sabers that you got. Alright, well, that that's already it's already an upgrade. You got right there. Let's let's do some trading. Wait, let's let's do some trading with you. Okay. I mean again 0 0.98, 0 0.24, it's uh just already the hold. Run right here is already an upgrade. It's not as good. So you now let's step outside and uh, close the door. I'm just gonna hang out. Well, he, he he might as well get some more goods, right? He might as well. Now, since I mean, I'm clearly they're not making any effort to stop him, right? So so he might he might as well. He might as well. Some of those are, like, free entries to, like, uh, 
us being able to use the bad, like the, the, the robo treatment facilities, right? Some of them you're just gonna hop into and you're good. How are we doing with fever? God, you're actually that bad at fever, yet you managed to steal that much with your awful fever skill? I'm actually kind of surprised. Yeah, yeah, you got caught stealing. It's okay, man. It's okay. We'll just keep on trying. It's a 66% chance. Like, come on, man. Get a research, too. You get it. Man, I hate when the chest calls me out for stealing from it, right? It's the worst. <laughs> the chest starts screaming like, Hey! Hey, this guy, he is actively stealing from me. Someone catch this culprit here. I'm, I'm just sitting there and like starting to sweat nervously. Give, give Katana, give Katana. We're gonna be making a bit of a skeleton fortune, you see. By, by selling off uh, weapons nobody, clearly nobody wants. I was just trying to pick a lock. M might as well, right? Might as well. Like, we're already criminal skeletons, right? Might as well go all out. Okay. It's failing to pack the lock, but that's fine. It's gonna get there. Like, talking locks are all the rage, baby. Yo! <laughs> Yo! Okay, we got, we got, we got the funny one. The funny weapon. Oh, so how are you doing, Omnifor? How are you doing, man? Yeah, we got we got a skeleton scythe. Um, shit. <laughs> hey, hey, rips, come in here. But yeah, how are you doing, man? We're we're currently doing the um we're currently doing a uh, Halloween themed uh, skeleton run where we are quite literal skeletons. Yeah, you take you take all the katanas, right? And I'm I'm gonna go here and and say, oh fuck, <laughs> um, the oh okay, uh, throw that on the floor. Hey hey, so so you 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 say you ribs, ribs. You say you you're good you're good in uh, using heavy weapons, right? What the fuck is this? <laughs> well, I mean, he sure has a weapon. To me, but feeling positive? That's good, that's good. <laughs> what the fuck? I mean, uh, it's not, it's not, it's, it's canton number three. You know? it's, it's fine, right? It's fine. It's, it's fairly pricey, too. Um, triple times the blood loss. Cutting damage is decent. Um, worse than what it was in this one, right? Heavy weapons class, which he is the best with, right? Heavy weapons, yeah. He kinda knows his way around heavy weapons. Alright, Rebs. I'm sure that the guy we just stole from will not notice a single thing. Alright? I go with pole arms, perhaps? Is anyone actually good with pole arms? Actually... This guy is. It's not half bad with him. But you see, we we gotta we gotta be going through the foglands, and the foglands. Let me tell you that right now, the foglands don't have simply fogmen only. They're just just different horrors now. Oh, there's different ones. So ooh, that one's good. Oh, that's a Mark Three. It's sad. That is a Mark Free. Hey, hey, buddy, want Mark Free right here that I just got? Honestly, you can even have the Mark Two that I have on me, so you can you can have two of those because that that'll make you look fancy. A staff, this was a staff. Doing Goofman only run, my favorite run in Kanshi. <laughs> Goofman. <laughs> ah, the Goofmans. Uh, owning the game for our year, not having spent a minute on it. Man, you gotta play some Kanshi, it's really fun. Osa, Osus, how you doing? How you doing, man? Welcome. Yeah, we're, we're doing, again, um, it's a, you know, like, like, yeah, we got, we got a Fogman in here. 
But, um, you know, we, we are skeleton ourselves, so we're, we're not gonna get cannibalized, obviously. Like, they're not gonna eat us. Now, how, why, why, why would they? But, um, we have a bit of a mission, right? And this Halloween themed, uh, um, stream of Genshin here. Let's just get out of here. Like, they, right? You, not, not, not you. You're still committing crimes, actually. Now we can get out. Hey, nothing to see here. Definitely not just stealing a bunch of items from that Ronin merchant. So we can sell them off in the pawn shop right next to my favorite mechanical shop. Now again. Uh, we get a bit of a journey. And I don't know if I can show you right here. Like we got, we got some new things like you can barely see it, right? The tail here from, from the fog raptor. So we got raptors in the fog. Can she? Can she? <laughs> yeah, like we got so so just new fog creatures. We got the uh, the fog raptor, the fog hounds, and the fog ghouls, and we also have um, the gray raves, but they're, they're not exclusive to the fog lens or anything. The gray raves, the um, like all all the creatures, right? Like I even went uh, like can she did post was like a um, thing themselves. They were like, hey, here's some mods. And, um, like, like some that may fit with the theme. Fancy chins 100%. My man, my man. Let's do some fence. Let's build this fence right now, shall we? So, so we got a few. Holy fuck, music, come down. Jeez, music, go down. <laughs> uh, it's overpowering. As I was saying, <laughs> um, <laughs> as, uh, as I was, as, as I was saying, <laughs> holy fuck, some songs are super loud, I forgot about that. Not spooky enough, it, it'll get spookier. Uh, again, new enemies, you know, all of that stuff, it's pretty cool. And uh, a bit of a personal goal that's gonna lead us into a spooky locale. Holy hell, I forgot how loud it can be sometimes. I also forget, like, that backpacks do actually make you worse at fighting. I forget that that is a whole thing. Um, you can sell some of them katanas that you don't do, actually. Now, I, I can respect you for having a stick, but I don't think you'll actually be using that stick, right? Now, how's the run doing, by the way? Oh, you guys, oh, is he poor? Did I make this guy poor right now? Get fucked. Um, do use this instead of stick. Just putting it out there. Hey, the, honestly, he'll he'll get his money back. Uh, I'm just saying, he'll he'll get his money back. Like, look at this fucking edge lord from some edging anime with his massive spiky super scythe, with like what I can only describe as a mouth, right here. Like, th this is something that he has. And then spiky butt. And of course a katana as the off weapon. Okay, we all good? Are we all right? Uh, all alright? We all doing? Again, I don't know why you would have two negatanas, but hey, there you go, you have two negatanas. Just like me! <laughs> what, like the edgy thing? <laughs> the edge creature. I remember I used to have a mod that allows you to actually replace your limbs without having to use the peeler. I don't have that one, though. He isn't even able to afford a shirt, actually. Well. Well, let's get out to the fog lands once more, shall we? At least Rips is about Spine's speed right now, and Bonten is just like zooming. It's just like running along his head first, going into adventure right now. Here they come. <laughs> Wait for me. Wait for me. Hey, um, I feel like Rips may want to train with you a little here. So he doesn't carry uh, all of this here. You know, at least lesson has a burden a little, right? 
Share the load. You know, we all live together after all, don't we? And, you know, the good thing is, since they're that heavy, they're actually gonna get a bit of strength. Because, you know what's the thing uh, with skeletons? They don't really happen to be the strongest. Because they're just skeletons, right? Like, literal skeletons made out of bone. That's not what you expect to be strong. <laughs> Alright, well, we're gonna be saving the game as autosave too. Like, I, I, by the way, guys, I still have my um, Mushroom Syndicate safe and my Clown, my Clown safe. We did the Clown run. It's been a while. It's been a hot minute we did that. But those were really fun. But yeah, hope you guys are doing all well. Over there, you can already see uh, some fog, man, some fog dogs and... Uh, Another group of fog men. Now, you know, we can't just go in and, like, beat up the ever-loving shit out of those fog men, or we wait. Though I'm not gonna lie, I kinda wanna see that massive, uh, fish scythe thing in action, and guess what? We are gonna do just that. Here it goes, big scythe action! Oh well, or not. Didn't really get a chance to. Unconscious, actually dead. We gotta kill them foghounds. Like this thing back there. It's pretty annoying. Oh, good block, good block. Oh, got him in the back. Oh, you blocked the scythe? My man. Yeah, like we... We gotta be able to somehow leave the foglands, right? Otherwise we're not gonna go anywhere. And again... The, the mist, the mist, um, it harbors creatures that, it, you know, they're, they hit different, all right? What's happening back here? Oh, look, a ritual! They're, they're eating a zombie right now, actually. <laughs> Get fucked, dude. Get absolutely fucked. Um, why are you in combat and no one else is? I mean, hey, it's gonna be fine fighting a singular Falkman, but still. Oof. Got him with that scythe. Yeah, I feel a little more adequately prepared now. Something I should have done, maybe, was get some more repair kits, since, you know, we might have as well, right? We, we, we might have as well. Now, those guys celebrating back there with the Reese. Well, they're gonna have to celebrate a little harder soon, I suppose. You go in. I know, I know you can use your weapons properly. Come on, don't make a fool of yourself. Yeah, let's show them, Fogman, what's up, alright? Let's, let's show them what true rattlers can do. As long as that wacky foghound doesn't appear, we should be good, actually. Like, we really should be good. Uh, after all, it's just fuck, man. I don't know. Like, what are they gonna do? Eat me? Yeah, right. And also, we're, we're getting them levels up right now. Like, we're getting all those levels. Like, he is getting his heavy weapons training, technically. His melee attack, which is in dire need of leveling. Melange Climate hate it. What do you have, like, a lot of fog? And, uh, cannibals. Yeah, I mean, it, it does sound like a pain to deal with, you know. Come on, guys, you can you can do it, you can do it. Don't, don't, don't you fall unconscious on me now. Goddamn cannibals! <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry to hear that you gotta deal with cannibals on the daily. Like, I knew it was rough, but damn. Didn't know it was that rough. Yeah, I mean, Scythe Man is doing pretty well uh, by himself here. The worst is actually this guy, is actually... The best, kind of. Or should be on paper, at least. He really wanted to pick up that corpse. He really wanted to. Um, where's the... Again, it's been a hot minute, right? Uh, you know, just, just, uh, go patch yourselves up. 
Those you guys can can be happy little engineers. Gurgle, re severed hive arm, just rolling down the hill. A frogman in the background, a router running. Typical Malaysia. Typical. Yeah, we're trying to go to Indonesia, by the way. Uh, that's like the goal of this run, too. No, we, 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 we heard legends of the place. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's uh, all the way down here. And Stopes Campbell. Now, are we gonna get ourselves involved in something that we absolutely do not need to get ourselves involved with? Because we could. I mean, no, again, Hiver zombies technically eating actual zombies. And, um, the only thing I actually worry about is the, the hounds. Hey, Sneak, how are you doing? Scroll scramble? <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's Australia, I suppose. Yeah, I think that's where Pink is from. How are you doing, Sneak? How are you doing? No, oh, I'm your biggest fan, Eleven. But are we gonna get ourselves involved with something that we absolutely do not need to get ourselves involved with? Also, there's a lot of severed limbs. Let's do a safe and then let's get ourselves involved with something we don't need to get ourselves involved with. Why not? Might as well. Thanks, I do it for, I do it for the fans, you see. A man of the people. Here comes the hound! Get ready, Bones! Oh, wait, I didn't... Uh, shit. That's really inconvenient, uh, seeing all those guys suddenly pop up behind you. You know, just like that. Um, oh man, that's... Oof, that's... Ah, that's actually really awkward. Sneak attack? I mean, it really was. It really was. Yeah, they already downed one of my guys. Yeah, I... Again, this this hound, like, they, they, they have power. You know, they, they have some power right there. But it's fine. Just like anything, can't see what doesn't kill ya only makes us stronger. Look at him block all those attacks with his 58 melee defense. And then a big swing! Catching a few of them. He does some heavy bleeding with his edge lord scythe, you gotta understand. One man by himself. Resisting the fog people. Blocking and attacking while his friends are every now and then standing up just to fall down flat on their face again And he's going in hitting him blocking and hitting and downing Dude, he he can't use his lag at any moment now But he's going hard honestly for the fact that he is about to literally eat shit. He's going pretty hard right now <laughs> What a legend Look at rips back there going! And I was down. Just bleeding and rebooting. Playing dead. You probably gotta like fix yourself up here. Don't do it. Oh man. Stab him! Stab him! Stab him! <laughs> you can do it! Stab him! Alright, well. We're just gonna wait a hot second apparently. Yeah, you guys, you guys keep playing dead. You should be fine. Like, I mean, yeah, you got your chest wound. Dang, you're incarnate. <laughs> Damn. Go, oh, Dang, you run off that character. He's the best. It's my favorite FromSoft character. Um, yeah, well, that's a shame. Um, yeah, it really is. Yeah, those, those hounds, man. They, they hit differently. I don't know what's up with them, but they, they, they hit differently. You see, we, we got our gang here, but you know, his his chest ain't too good. Like this guy may stand a chance. They're, they're just like gurgling away back here and ringing and eating a, again, a zombie. Hey, what to do, what to do? Well, that, that hound, you know, it kind of needs to get away, you know? Now, for the fact that it is slowly getting worse, it's actually slowly getting uh, better, right? Yeah, 13 points to, uh, of wear damage. This detracts from your maximum health and can be fixed as a skeleton bed. That's fair enough. Yeah, it's, it tests really kind of like um, iffy back there with this one. 
Right, so if he was to, to go suddenly in, right, out of nowhere, going for that sneaking attack with his friend, Bone Tin. Oh, well. <laughs> All I'm saying is, they would get fucked. <laughs> okay, just, just keep playing that, alright? <laughs> I suppose that's for the best. Just let them reboot. Just let them reboot their, their uh, not-so-good stage right now. <laughs> yep. Yep. <laughs> well, that didn't go too well now, did it? What's your toughness at right now? Toughness 49, 58, 55. Well, it showed, it showed. He, he, he went in. He did go in. Okay, different idea. How? Uh, what about we just kind of like, fuck up? Ribs! Crawl away, uh, oh, ribs! Oh, ribs. Okay, now, now you guys. Go on. Wait, but, 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 you, but you need to repair ribs too. Can't just leave ribs on the ground like that, you know? Where are you going? <laughs> okay, and let's be sneaky as well. Alright. Now we, we got our beating. We got our mandatory beating right now. We just gotta make sure that he done he done not die, you know. <laughs> Reading Sand Monster, how you doing? How you doing? Welcome, welcome to the skeleton run where we are quite literal skeletons, and on the run. Look, look at look at those little bony hands trying to fix up his uh, companion after getting brutally attacked by um, hounds of the fog. Okay, let's let's move out. Well, well, there they are. Yeah, we're gonna make a wide berth around those dogs. Repairing, uh, repairing from Halloween. Yeah, you know, just like them scallies here. Just like them scallies that have absolutely been spotted right now. <laughs> now I mean, since uh, stealth is off the table. Oh my god! Don't fight. He has been sent into that stratosphere. There's no point in fighting there. It's fine, he'll make it. He'll be good. He'll be good. Bo Bonton's gonna is gonna be able to do it. No oh no. <laughs> oh no, you thought donks are bad? Have you ever heard of a fog fiend? <laughs> yeah, nasty little things. And you know with a bit of luck the fog fiend will attack the dogs. <laughs> You know, it could happen. Could happen. All right, Bonten, how about you go and uh, and repair a little, yeah? How about that? How about you? You just kind of like meander there. Okay, that's good. That's good actually, because these two, they just managed to recover from their incident. All right. What that means, they're gonna be able to potentially even be able to walk. And, and they're gonna be making it out of here. Meanwhile, the fog fiend is eating the dog. And obviously the dog won because... I mean, I guess the dogs, they, they are built different, you know? You went to a party dressed as the Tiger King? Like, uh, Tiger King in, in terms of like... Um, wait, no, no, that'd be lying. From, uh... Fucking... <laughs> Uh, what was it called? Um, that that one tabletop game we played. Uh, uh, that 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 that's something. Something with death in the name. Kingdom Death, monster. All right, well, rips rips us on the floor. Ryan now is not doing too well, but the hound has been defeated. So exotic. From a new job, signed a contract today. First day at work tomorrow. Nice, nice. Happy to your dad. Can't you space mission? <laughs> I mean, yeah, he, he did kind of get launched into orbit when um, carrying that one dude and just like getting knocked out again and just like entered the stratosphere there. Um, My man here can simply go into the, the robo bat to recover from his wounds. His battle weary wounds. Yeah, there he goes. 
Bon uh, good old spine back there carrying the ribs. It's gonna be gonna be mighty strong soon if he keeps going like that. Yeah, again, the, the, the strength is rather um, tragic, to say the least. It's it's not really up there. So hear me out. There is a bit of a far count, and that far count is most likely gonna knock us out. But you know, gotta remember, yeah, it's gonna be sleeping, it's gonna be doing well. But you gotta remember, we, we have, we have the power of friendship on our side. Yeah. Ouch. Ouch. Oh my god. Oh my, oh my god. Oh god. Yeah, that, that just shows that friendship doesn't actually matter in, in the uh, post-apocalyptic that, um, world of Kanshi. Oh, it's got sand in your, uh, in your <laughs> servos. Yes, it's pretty annoying anyways. He is... Man, that guy got him pains. <laughs> Rebooting. Poor Rips. Poor Rips really, really got a beating there. Well, this little thing is just like devouring a fog man down there. Spiders back up. But I'd rather wait for this guy to, to walk away. Bone turn, you know, is repairing again, recovering from the failed assault. Being a skeleton, can't she imagine the oil clogging up with sand? Imagine, right? That'd be terrible. Uh, at, le at least, you know, it comes with a bunch of other perks, right? With some downsides, but still. But, like, imagine being an actual skeleton. Like, like not one of those robots. Like, like a real skeleton. You know, that, that, that's what we are. We're real skeletons. Now, the oil, is, it's just simply a different word for bone marrow. You know? It's really all it is. Okay, we're gonna be sending Bonetin, who just repaired himself, to find a dog. So these two poor souls, they can't maybe make it out of here. Or actually support him in taking it down. Like he, he he can tank. He can tank some. Like that man's on a mission right now, as you can tell. With his little scruffy arm. <laughs> no, they don't exist. There's no roads. Okay, hurry up. Look at him go. He is ready to fight. He may not look like it, but he is actually the physically strongest member. Of our whole party. And it seems like the bone dog answered his call for combat. Going in with 30 damage. And another 30. And another 30. Taking 27 himself. Oh my god, the counter from the dog. What is he gonna be doing? Hitting him twice. Double whammy. Right there. And he's out. He's, he's out cold. Actually. Ribs? Ribs? Ribs, is your time to be moving? Man, trust me. Yeah, that acts pretty quickly, actually, you see. And it's out again. You know, on the bright side, we managed to move a little. You know? My arm is broken. Oh, well, Ribs. Terribly sorry to hear that. <laughs> I really am. <laughs> but guess what? It's not down yet. Seems we'll play uh, Kenshi. Oh no, no, you're, you're just gonna be worse. Um, oh my god, why did you stand up? <laughs> why did you stand up, buddy? Stop! Just play dead! <laughs> no! He doesn't understand! He's not getting it! Oh. But he, he's moving, he's moving. Yeah, you gotta understand, Kenshi is about getting beat up. A lot of times. Like, you're gonna get beat up a lot. Though I, I, I personally still enjoy the most when it's like uh, one of those runs where you start from the absolute bottom. Right? And like, make your way up. I, I kind of like those the most. You know? Like, it's all about that. Alright, doggy. Follow me. You follow me. Yes, uh, let me introduce you to uh, what I call reinforcements. Emotional support, perhaps, even. 
And then we go in. You know, best case scenario, one of these guys dies as well, you know? He gets knocked down at least, and then we can yonk their stuff. Anyways, I, I take head. Guys, you were supposed to be moving the entire time by now. You were supposed to be heading to the dock. I'm just gonna be able to fix you up in no time. So don't even worry about that. Let's go super speed. While uh, this poor, poor skeleton actually lost his arm. <laughs> he, was, he was so brittle that Rips actually lost his arm forever. It's gone. Arm gone. No, no arm for you. No, no more arm. I also like how we can keep using the bat at least, you know, since we paid 3k taxes for it. The bat taxes. So at least we can, uh, we can go there to, to recover. But, you know, like, it's not all bad. Like, sure, his arm may be gone, but who says he can't have a new arm? Like, the KLR serious arm, you know? It's, uh, is, isn't that the, the really strong arm? You know, the one that makes you all powerful? It is, yeah. Strength and dexterity and unarmed damage, right there. It's price actually reasonable. Uh, specialist, that this is a masterwork right here. I'd love to get that. Uh, sadly, it's a little too expensive, you see. A little too expensive. So, so we can give him head. <laughs> Let's give him head real quick. And sell him some other. Oh, really loud droning incoming, by the way. Really loud droning. There we go, and now we have a new arm for the boy. I heard you got my arm. I require it. Please. Make me a skeleton. A mechanical skeleton. And buddy, just, just slap it on somewhere, right? You gotta... You gotta, you gotta... Oh god, it's a right arm! Fuck! My man, I'm, I'm, I'm terribly sorry to tell you, but like... You gotta calm down for a moment back there, music. You gotta calm down. It's really loud. I was a character for 20 minutes when I played Kenshi at that one time. Like, dual wielding VTuber in a harsh wasteland. How the fuck are you a character in this game? Well, shame to know that I got the wrong arm. Hey man, could you, uh... Think you could cut me another deal, maybe? You got any... Left ah shit. Yeah, well. And that's your left arm. I mean that that that's also a really good one. Thieves arms, but you know. Just normal skeleton arm. I mean yeah, yeah, that's that's when you wanna be just strong. Right? The industrial lifter for the left arm. You say you want a bit of money. Well how about we give you back this arm? You know, mispurchase, lose a bunch of money due to that. Okay, ma uh, what's the... Just making sure, just making sure, okay? Or did you suddenly regrow an arm? Were you able to get a new one? Do you have both arms now? Well, you do not. It's simply not true. Uh, you are clearly missing one, actually. Uh, specifically, actually, the... Uh, the left... No, that's the right arm. It's mirrored, right? It's mirrored, so this is the right arm. Yeah, it's the right arm. Limb's gone. Right arm gone. So for the right arm, why, why do you have only good arms for the left side? Why could you not lose the other arm, man? <laughs> You're looking at his prizes right now. You should have really lost the other one. Right. It's a normal skeleton arm. At least I'll get some dexterity. But you definitely don't want to have economy arms. Trust me. And give you a thief's arm. Oh, that's on the right hand. You want a thief's arm? Gives you some dexterity, I suppose. How about that? Want want to be a thief? That's you can't afford that. How much is that? Twenty-five k. We have barely not enough. Have a staff. 
shit, it's still not enough. It's just a little bit low. It's okay. My guy here is gonna be able to to get you back, okay? He's gonna be able to do that just fine. Hey guys, what you're looking at? <laughs> it's, uh, it is just I. A guy who is stealthing for no apparent reason. Do not worry. Feel free to move away from the armored store. Trust me, I am definitely not up to anything uh, criminal. Do not worry about that. Stealing power. I mean, if uh, the, the thing is just awake non-stop, you know. Unless. Unless. I was to... I wants to engross him in a bit of a conversation. Well. Well. We get our man from the other side. To crack open the box. Yeah. Can I turn off the light too? <laughs> Can I turn it off? So I'm sure you don't need the, the arm back there, eh? Also, 0% to knock him out, by the way. <laughs> just, just in case anyone was curious, there, there's no way we'll actually knock him out. Oh, don't mind me closing the door. Alright. <laughs> I, I guess do mind me closing the door. Hello? My man? What if I sneak behind you? What if I was to... Gain your attention. Because I am kinda suspicious now, aren't I? Are you perhaps more engrossed by ribs, perhaps? Oh, well, well I mean, I, it's a pretty tough lock. I, I guess it's not gonna happen. In the end. But you know where we can go after all? You know where we can actually go? Wait. That guard wasn't there. Oh, well, it's not anymore. Surely if he, if he gets it first try, you know, before that guard gets a chance to come back, he's gonna... Oh. I think he got caught. You know, at least he'll get some toughness, you know, from this and some combat experience. Fucking threw him against the wall, Jesus Christ, dude! Man just like did a wrestling move on poor Bone Tin back there and just like yeeted him against the wall, jeez. Now that 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 was really metal, honestly. Um you know you think I can have some more of those skeleton repair kits, maybe, or, or seven of them. Guess it wasn't seven after all, huh? Well, let's let's do some trading so he he gets them again. Here, have have one and a half of them, and then 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 let's sell another another head, like right there. And this guy, remember, should be bonnet. Well, we gotta find an extra skeleton for that first. <laughs> Ow. Oh, oh god. Oh. Anyways, we're back. So surely this time around, there's not gonna be any guard seeing me. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> as long as they just stand there and observe me from far away, they're not gonna notice what I'm actually doing. How'd you get there? Thief? You're yelling at you, yelling at me. Okay, Bonitus. Is he like stuck in the building? Wait. He's stuck in the door. He got himself stuck in the fucking door. Well, Bone Ten, 
I, I suppose you gotta, um... Wiggle yourself out of this situation here now, huh? And, uh... Yeah, th this guy's gonna be... It's gonna be a bit... Bloody thieves! Yeah, it's gonna be a bit of a situation, huh? Well, don't worry, I have full faith in you. Oh no. Do you think they know? Do you think they do know? Guys, help, I'm stuck in the door. Please, someone. Please. I mean, look, at the very least, he's getting pretty good at lockpicking. If, if nothing else, he is getting good at it. You know? Um, it's just like, uh... Oh, no. It's fine. We'll, we'll get you to the scout and repair bed. You'll be okay, un unless you end up in prison. Uh, then, then you won't. Okay, they, they might just... Oh, uh, yep. Yeah. Oh. So... So what's... What's the plan with him? You're just gonna... Okay. Let's... Go and pick him up real quick, okay? Let's quickly go in and then, like, like pick him up for a moment, you know? 119 hours, the bounty will expire, that's something at least, you know? Oh my god, stop beating him up! <laughs> Here, I got him, I got him, fuck! Yeah, Mon Mongrels just absolutely hates him. So, you know, we were unable to actually obtain the uh, desired amount of coin. Um, I'm very sorry. Um, help me, help me step guard, I'm stuck. Pretty much, right? Pretty much. Alright, buddy. Oh, bad rental, huh? It's fine. I'm, I'm willing to rent this bed if it at least fixes me up, right? And then we can go back to the Falklands. Maybe get out of here, too. So, um... Arms. Preferably right arms. A okay right arm, at the very least. I mean, again, gives you some dexterity. It's about it. Standard. Eh. I don't want standard arms now. No, 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 that, that, that's setting the bar really low. But, you know, we can, we can squeeze out some money bone by selling these goods. And I... I mean, look, you do not need two, two of those, right? So if you were to sell this one... Hmm? If you were to sell that one, we can absolutely get the thief's arm. That is somewhere here. There it is. And actually be able to slot it in. Or... So I hope. Where's the limb screen? Ah, finally. Got both of my arms again. And it's barely a difference. It's just not organic. It's it'll work though, it'll work. You know, it'll 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 get you where you need to be. Um again if I'm not mistaken, it gives you dexterity, fevery, and lockpicking as a boost. Your lockpicking and fevery is rather abysmal, since he is like the man to do that. He's also pretty good at it. But hey, now you're better at it. So, um, just that. Right, guys, let's go back to the Foglands for real. <laughs> this time. No. Oh. oh, no. Oh, Bonten. Oh, I, uh, ooh, I, I kind of, I kind of forgot about the, uh, the whole guards absolutely hate your guts situation there. What about, uh, here's, here's an idea. What if we lead the guards into the, uh, the de- Oh, no. You see this guy? We call those messed horror. Now you can tell by the attack, they are not to be messed with. Guys, fight the uh, the messed horror. Not me, please. There's really bigger threats out here than your boy, uh, Bone Tin. Alright? I'm um, just putting that one out there. You're... <laughs> Your fellow guards are actually getting the shit kicked out of them as we speak. Are you sure you want to focus on this little rattler right here instead of like, 
don't know. The mist horror. The horror of the mist. Hey, we did it. Hey, we did it. Sneak away. As well as you can. Oh, yeah. I'm just saying, man. These guards are absolutely gonna get beaten up. Like, real bad. And if they do kill the missed horror... Now, at the very least... You know, um... Is he gonna care about me? This is gonna be cool. This is gonna be a pain. Are they gonna get eaten? That's how we deal with guards, by the way. Just, just lead them into a really, really tough mob if you don't feel like fighting them, actually, you know? No way they, they will ever see me, right? Well, he might have just gotten spotted right there. How about you repair your... Okay, never mind. Ribs, how about you repair your man? Meanwhile, those guys are, again, absolutely gonna get brutalized by, by these lads back there. Again, mist horrors. Uh, there, there's, I believe, one thing worse than that in the mist. But yeah. Look at it from the bright side, you know? All these, um... Guards and whatnot. Oh, poor, poor mist. <laughs> poor, poor fog, man. They, they didn't see it coming. Get triple teamed. Oh, he he blocked that side somehow. That that guy actually knew how to fight. He knew how to throw down. And meanwhile, I mean, look, don't get me wrong, the guards are competent, right? But uh, the master is uh, a little more competent than they are and stronger. Now, oh, are we fight? Are we in a fight? How about we distance ourselves a little further? Real quick, you know? We're absolutely being spotted by... Maybe the guards. You know what I'm saying is? I kind of want to know what this thing has in terms of items. I also, I also like how if a guard gets downed... All of them go and heal him. <laughs> like, instantly. Not even caring about a missed horror. Okay, so it went down to its martial arts now. That it's gonna be doing, I suppose. Now it's getting its ass kicked. Hey, why don't we... Why don't we send reps in to get some practical combat experience? Since this thing is basically a dummy right now. It's just there to be beaten up. Alright? And and they're not, they're not after reps. So reps can show himself. I can't wait for literally all of them to just run away. And reps is gonna get like murdered by this thing now. Wait, I was kidding. Guys? <laughs> Guys, I was kidding! Guys, please! Oh. Well, my chest imploded. <laughs> they actually left me. <laughs> they actually all fucked up. <laughs> and I went in. <laughs> oh, well, the, the irony. Oh god, it's Naruto running away now. Where the hell is it gonna go? Is it gonna go to Mongrel, you think? Well... I mean... You know? What a fight, huh? Uh, oh, that's a mist... Oh, that's the mist ghoul! How, how did he end up here? Look, stop sneaking, start running. All I'm saying. That ghoul's not gonna stay down forever, and I wanna know what he has. Like, that that ghoul is currently playing dead. So if you don't get there in time, it's, it's probably gonna be pretty bad for you. Okay, take its teeth. Take its ghoul teeth. This, uh, can, can I not... There, there we go. That's the one. Because when I take its teeth, it'll die. It'll actually die. Because it's toothless. Right now. And you know, they, they do sell for a pretty penny. I suppose. Those, uh, those teeth. Well, sadly, uh, sadly, ribs, um, 
lost his ribs. He got, um, so dukened by, by the missed horror. So he is, is not gonna be feeling too well. Um, now, Bone 10, I forgot to give you a repair kit. It's really awkward. So I guess you'll... You'll just kind of like... Wait here. Awkwardly. Oh no. It's a missed fiend. And he is gonna have bone tin for breakfast. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. There's also those guys. Um. Well bone tin. Sorry it came to, to this you know. I'm, I'm sure it's not them. I'm sure he... What do you mean it's two of them? What do you mean it's two of them? What are they after? Attacking enemies? But who who is the enemy? Am I a enemy? Is he a enemy? Yes! That shinobi guard is absolutely gonna get beaten up. And die. Just like us. Okay, Spine, you might need to fight back here a little. Or at least attempt to. It has a massive attack stat, don't, don't get me wrong, but it's also really hurt. You may just be able to. You, you crippled its arm already. And it isn't as good as, uh, as it is with the weapon in, in martial arts, right? So... You got him, tiger. Oh, don't get kicked in the face, though. Okay, you got him. Come on. Get, careful, careful now. Oh, he got kicked in the gut, you know, that, that stunned him for a moment. What's he doing? I don't even know what those moves are. I like how the guards absolutely don't care as long as it doesn't actually affect them, you know? Just like limping along. Oof. Ooh, that was a big hit. Huh? Sneak. Well. Can you do it? Just one hit, man. Oof. It's the wrong hit. Oh. Yeah, try try not to find the entire gang over there. Well, I suppose they're both gonna be recovering now for a hot minute. There's one guy who who may be able to to do it, you know. But he is also wanted at the same time. Look, he needs to go in. Yeah, I, ca I can't wait for the whole stream to basically us being trying to get out of uh, the Fog Islands, but getting, like, stopped pretty much always. <laughs> uh, like, at, uh, at the gates, basically. Hey, uh, <laughs> uh... That was a little clumsy now, wasn't it? Now, that that's a bit clumsy there, buddy. Is that Fogman holding the Fog Fiend? Oh, well, man. That, that is quite something. I like to hold it Fog... Are you mining? That's now is hardly the time to... Don't worry, I'm here to help. Oh no, it's a Fog Fiend now. And it, it, it seems to have recovered somewhat. Well, it's a all-out brawl with all the chaos right now. Well, I sent one of the fiends into the stratosphere right there. Help him! Oh, it's down. Take its teeth. Take its teeth. When, if, if, everyone knows if you take the fog fiend's teeth, it'll die. So you just killed this thing, eh? For good. Any of them alive? We good? We're a few happy campers, right? Oh, no, there's a guy on his way. Hey, you, you, you get, you get a repair kit, okay? Um, you, in the meanwhile, you, you pick up the boy. And you're gonna move all the way back to Mongrel, okay? We need, we need to do some, some maintenance work. You see? Who is she? Caring? Is that a fog fiend who's just like caring to mongrel this guy? What a mad lad right there. 
What a absolute mad... Oh, they're gonna be fighting one another here. Yeah, yeah. Yep, yeah, bounty will expire in... ...a certain amount of time. Uh, suppose you might as well go to the fog fiend and, like, uh... ...get its, um... ...valuables out, you know? So, quickly make your way. Get its teeth. If nothing else, you know, those guys are Steve, they're, okay, they're, gonna, they're gonna fetch some coin. There he goes. Spying carrying the rips yet again. That's just common by now. And, you know, this guy is just sitting outside, not really able to do much except for repairing himself, which, you know, better than nothing. Get his robotics up. Because if there's one thing I can tell you, it's, uh, Argus's robotics aren't really that good. Uh, that's the wrong shop, by the way. Right. So go back here. I also like how how it's usually nighttime. By the time we, we get back somewhere. Right spine. Um feel free to, to sell him the teeth. Wait, well you, you you just go back to sleep. Are you okay? Sleep. Uh, do that do the robo sleep, right? Okay, auto saving the game, that's that's fine. Uh, Most a little wacky. Yeah, we got ourselves like 8k from that. It's a start. It's a start. Okay, that guy's fine. Now you go to sleep. Get your juices flowing. Well, you might as well go back here. And Spine is gonna be on its way right now. Right, guys. Three times the charm, am I right? These are bone fellas. One skeletal hiver, one skeletal human, and one skeletal shack. And that's the team. Well, let's go during night time. It may or may not be better. If we do just that. But yeah, big old, big old spiky fog fiend is really bad news for us. We're probably gonna be escaping through drag at the bottom, like at the south there. Maybe, you know, I I am realizing that this one encounter we had there, you know, where we're like, hey, but like, what if we do get ourselves involved with something we shouldn't be getting ourselves involved with? Or maybe, you know, we matter of fact have not should have gotten involved. Who knows, we might have been out by now. Give me the head. We can sell that somewhere. And, you know, if there's gonna be any, uh, hivers, like... Like these guys down here, we can take them on. L l last time we just kinda happened to be incredibly unlucky. And got also sneak attacked, right? We got a bit of an ambush going there. That didn't, that didn't help whatsoever. I also like how you can hear all the, all the botch flies around the corpses right now. Since there's so many who died at the, uh, at the early parts there. But yeah, this time, we're not gonna attack those guys who are like, Ree! Whoa! Ree! You know, in the background, like right there, well, we're not gonna get involved with that. Not this time, not this time. Again, we, we got a bit of a different go. Yeah, again, like his rips attack stat could be a little higher. Sure could be. Well, guys, it's a fog hound. We gotta take it down, okay? And I am positive that the three of us at full health are gonna be able to murder this thing, okay? So let's not worry about it. Good, good. And all, all that happened was the spine got a little damaged, and that's about it. There we go. That's good. I'm oh, feeling spine, we're feeling better. Okay, one four count, three of us, easy. Some of the other stuff in here against the three of us could be bad. 
They're like the like the mist fiend and stuff. Like those those guys usually are pretty bad news. Huh, pretty pretty foggy. Hmm. At least we got to see some zombies, <laughs> you know? Like at the very least we saw some zombies as well. Fuck Death Yard 4 has been wiped out. Nice. Let's be on our way. And be on our guard. Like again, we can we can take on a whole group of Fogmen, right? As long as there's no actual soldier variants of of them in there, we should be absolutely fine. Or as long as we don't get ambushed by like another group, and and then maybe a fiend with some dogs and some 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 of those raptors and whatnot, and then yeah, we're, we're gonna be absolutely fine. But we are about to leave. About to leave this place. Seems awfully quiet, you know. Till now. Deceptively quiet. And awfully foggy. Yeah, I don't I, I don't see anyone or anything. And we're we're making our way out. You know what's gonna be another fun thing though? <laughs> Dealing, having to deal with uh, with those uh, psycho paladins from, you know, from from the kingdom, whatever they're called. Yeah, yeah. Those guys, they probably also have like a phoenix king, just like in Warhammer DLC, you know, because they're awfully unhinged, you know. So I can't wait having to go through their territory there. Now, why would I why would I go through here? There, there, that's that's a dead end, sir. Quite quite a quite a comfy dead end. Dude, imagine making a home in the foglands. I, I I'm gonna I might do that in my next proper run. I might actually try and live amongst the fog. That would be <laughs> that would be wacky. That would be something. Something else getting invaded by fog men and all day, all day, every day. It'd be like surviving the zombie apocalypse, kinda. Yeah, that could be interesting, actually. There's a camp. It's one of them death yards, probably, isn't it? The skulls. The a symbol of my people. Yeah, I imagine they're just not. Oh, right now. At least not that I can see. But if they're not home, where, where could they be? Where could they be? Wait, is this the way out? No, it's the way to... To the mountain. Hardly the way out. Though, this is hardlier the way out. Uh, I guess... You know, break a bone, am I right? Let's see how it'll go. Again, deceptively quiet right now. Maybe maybe they're hiding in the sand, you know? They're like, they buried into the uh, earth right now, just waiting for some unsuspecting targets to walk in like we are right now. Or not. Like, I remember there was a, um, like... Uh, NPCs like chattering. I think it was the mushroom guys who played us uh, quite a while ago. Barghounds, three of them. Yeah. Haven't seen us yet, though. And yeah, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Let's let's leave those foggy lands behind us. Yeah, like, again, I, I imagine it'd be kind of cool to, to be in the, in the Foglands, like, as a, uh, inhabitant. Guys, we made it out. The fog is behind us. That's step one of the journey. Alright, left. Left, put a smile on. Put a smile on for the camera, come on. Come on, no, no, not the last one. The sack, the hiver, and the human. Yeah. Just a little further. There's just some remnants of the fog, but nothing nothing too serious now. We're basically out. 
So yeah, and then we're in drag. Now it's a whole other place. I also remember having the Starship Trooper mod on that had like those bugs inside of it. And they had some massive swarms. Like, you had a max um, melee character, like, absolutely busted with 100 plus dead. And and they still got absolutely swarmed by the sheer quantity of those bugs. And they, they weren't easy either. They had, like, decent stats with decent attack speeds. Like, there were nothing to scoff at. And there were so many, dude. There were so many... But that, that was, those were like the tales from the Leviathan coast. And it was like in the purple sands, in your berserker country. Like this was heavily infested with those guys. Man, we should have gone to Obedience. Obedience is such a cool place to be in. I really like Obedience. It's absolutely empty. But it's really cool. You know, with the skeletal hands everywhere. I mean, <laughs> while we could loop around... There's really no reason for us to do so. We don't want to go up. We want to go south, sadly. Yeah, but Obedience, I, I really like that place. With those giant mech arms still poking out of the earth. And yeah, it's pretty cool. I, I, th I think the lore was something like, yeah, yeah, just like... Bury yourself or some shit like that. And, and then that's what they did. You All you see is like those massive arms poking out. And that's about it. Now then, uh, we're gonna go up here. Let's speed this up, shall we? There's no need for us to wait for that long. And if we do end up spotting someone, who who are you? Hungry pandas? That's cute. You know what? That, that, that's really cute, actually. Hungry bandits. You hear that, boys? They're hungry. Those guys are actually hungry. How about... How about we rough them up for no real reason whatsoever? How about it? How about we just, like, kill some hungry people just for the, for the fun of it? It's, it's more for sport than, like, you know, actual needs to survive. And then people wonder why they hate skeletons up here. Okay, guys. It's time to fight now. Stop getting hit. We we got it. Like, you guys can be tough, right? But, like, there's just no need to be taking unnecessary hits, right? Also, it's it's training, you know? It'll, it'll train my guys, which they need to be... They need to get training. Oh, well. Second wave, everyone! Second wave! Guys, there's another wave of hungry people. Coming down here. Come on, you can do it. I'm sure you can. I, I kind of want to have revs go in a little harder. Uh, top side. Like, we're, like, it's good for, like, crowds of people, right? But with his massive scythe thing. <laughs> Doing his wide arcs. His wide attacks. Well, well this guy's just going in hard. With his, like, uh, what? Well, with his Nodachi right now? That's going in pretty hard with that stuff. Yeah, and that's, that's how three skeletons speed up a bunch of, uh, bunch of nobodies, really. Okay, do some self-repairs. Now, do, do I actually need something from them? Not really, but odds are they're all gonna bleed out. Or a lot of them are gonna bleed out. Just like this guy's head is, it's gonna, it's gonna explode, right? It's gonna implode, actually. But yeah, and like, <laughs> they're hungry bandits, like, they're not gonna have anything on them that we don't have already. It was simply the thrill of the fight. Yeah, it's just getting there, like, like they're, they're, they're improving, they're improving. You could, you could be better, you know, you could be a little better there. But yeah, yeah that, that, you know, bit of a, bit of a thrill, yeah? Let's move while enjoying the blood red sky, the sunrise in the distance. A new day of our journey to Shobes Gamble.
I want the blood red sky again. It was a little cooler. Wait, am I being attacked by cannibals? Scrawny cannibals. Sure am, I sure am. But how about we, we loop you around? How about we loop you around? So you can fight amongst your people. Alright, sound good, right? More melee training, everyone! Let's show those scrawny humans what true skeletons can do. And when I say true skeleton, I mean literal skeleton, undead beings, matter of fact. Who knows, maybe we've been devoured by cannibals one time. We just don't remember. And now, now we're the ones devouring them. Except for not really, we, we don't need to eat. We're undead, we're skeletons. We're being held together with funny magic. Yeah. As always, scrawny cannibals absolutely getting messed up. What a sight. What a sight to behold. And again, improving your, um, your melee. Like, see? Went up a whole percent right there. And then there's like, that one guy running. It's like, nope. Not having any of this. Sadly, he's a little slower than our uh, spine. Potentially getting hit right there. Oh, oh how's, how's that gonna go? And, oh, that's a head. Oh, that's a big head. And down. Down with them. Yeah. Except we won't need um, all those items right here. Old block, jobs. Yeah, just, just again, go, go ahead and like uh, heal yourselves or not. Do you also not have any? Nah, he does. Nah, that one does. Like, the worst thing to happen would be if we actually were to um, go into the gray too much with our guys. And that'd be actually bad. But yeah, like, scrawny cannibals, like, they're, they're not gonna be doing anything to us, actually. Like, they hardly, <laughs> they hardly would beat one of us. Like, they're, they're absolutely pathetic, is what I'm saying. Alrighty. Let's keep on moving, guys. Who knows, there could be more uh, target practice like that somewhere around here. Well, slowly regenerating ourselves here. Slowly healing. You know, just like skeletons do. Made out of living metal. Discovered... Hiver village. Right there. Do you think do you think those are cool hivers? Do you do you think they're right? Do you think they're more like Hey, you're a scally get out of here? Type of hiver. Very hostile per se. Let's see, let's see. Well, I can see their dung houses already, so <laughs> Ignore Kansas world loading in as as we go. Oh, 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 oh. What are you doing here? A fog fiend alpha. Yeah, I, uh, man, we're so fucked here. If, if they do keep following our, our guy here, Bonetin, he may be able to bring the fog fiend alpha into, into their home. Like the, the, the village there. The Hiver Town. Dude, this is getting absolutely mauled. Yeah, no shot. At least we can take out the juveniles in the meantime, you know, while the Fog Fiend was busy. But yeah, no, that's the alpha we ran into. Um, it's not gonna happen. We're gonna have a good time here. It's like, again, some of the juveniles won't. Like, everything is fine. Then there's the alpha. You know? That is not fine. He he hits you once and you you you're not feeling too well, to say the least. But it's okay, it's okay. We'll be we'll be able to recover. We're gonna move on. We're gonna they're not gonna be too interested in us, right? Since why well, would they? We're just skeletons, right? There's not much they can eat. 
God, he licked him in the face. I mean, at the very least, you know, the Alpha did catch some hurting. But he sure dished some out. Ooh, critical? Ah. Uh. With the grave with her medical attention, that's how it goes, yep. And he's down, ladies and gents. We got murdered by a crowd of fiends that are all also, like, partially dying now and having some severe blood loss. You, you keep playing dead. I want those guys to move out. Did I, did I, like, unbeknownst to me, walk into one of their nests? Like, without realizing it. Could that be it? Like, they, they seem pretty at home back here. That was critical. Rebooting for both of them. No match 20 have been wiped out. Yeah, I mean... Worst case scenario, we need to have Bone 10 move a little faster along, you know, the ground here. I don't care about the small ones, it's really just like the, you know, the Alpha. The Alpha Raptor guy who's kind of a pain in the ass. Yeah. He is, he is the worst one. And we sure must have run into, like, their place. Yeah, by the time he, he wants to stand up, he's gonna get down again. Critical. Buddy, you shouldn't be, you shouldn't be standing here. Hobble away, hobble away! They, they, they didn't notice you yet. They haven't noticed you. Hobble, hobble, hobble! Oh, oh god, he got hit in the back. <laughs> so much for his hobbling. Run, Bone 10, run! To the Hyper Village! Don't worry, there's only a small one after you. Okay, there's the really big one after you now. Buddy. It's gonna be fine, don't worry about it. He lost his leg. He, he just lost his leg right there. <laughs> just when the safe happened to you. Yep. Yeah, that's him getting rid of one of his legs. I mean, took out a few of them. It's really just like... Are the alpha this kind of a situation, you know? Do you have the means to heal yourself? Because I really think you should be. Doesn't seem like it's noticing you right now. And I at least have that lump somewhat healed up, right? So so he doesn't like die. Some so may see. Now, having lost a leg is not good. <laughs> I, I can tell you that much. It's it's not good. The limb's gone forever. We should have bought a leg before we left uh, the Fog Islands. Now, we also don't have anyone who's like really, really speedy. They can just simply go in and out of the Fog Islands. You know, go in, get a limb, and get out again real quick. Right, man. All you need to do is crawl. To you people. And I have absolute faith that you can do that. All you need is to make it there and you're gonna be fine. Alright? That's all you need to do. <laughs> now, I get it. I get it. It is kinda really annoying to not have both legs that you can walk on. But I'm Mr. Branks. I'm sorry, guy. Damn the brakes. Yeah, just normal fog fiend. Where's the alpha? The alpha's right here. And the, the alpha, honestly, he doesn't really care. His forelegs is a little scraped. And that's about it. Our heroes, however, are somewhat in a predicament right now. Like, they're, they're not actively dying, except for him. He is. Um, and he is too. Can he move down? No. No. <laughs> no, by the time he would do anything, that guy's gonna be like, Hey! Hey, how about we, uh... How about we, uh, murder? How about that? Ooh, did I scare you? Absolutely, yeah. You're the scary thing here. Not, not that thing. <laughs> Anyways, how, how, how's our boy doing back here? 
is getting to the village. <laughs> now let's let, let's see them hivers, right? Let, let's see them. They 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 they're part of the is Western Hive. Too easy for yeah, you. Thank you for thank thank you for the sub. Appreciate it, man. <laughs> yeah, it's more like these guys are at risk of absolutely eating shit and dying right now because we just. Might have happened to... Oh, who are those guys? Holy Nation Outlaws? Well, you guys are just dead. Welcome to the club. We also happen to run into this hive, probably. Or nest, I should say. Now, if there's a time to move away, it's now. It's now. Clearly, they're distracted. They are clearly distracted with humans and... And ribs. Oh, poor ribs. Run, Spine, run! Run! Oh, Rips is actually dying right now. His head and his uh, rest of the body is not really doing too well. Just like you are, my man. Not too good as well. Oh, man, we kind of have to go back for Rips, though. We kind of have to go back for him, though. <laughs> We're doing absolutely terribly ourselves. And 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 he is rebooting now. Someone gave him a menacing stare, made him reboot. Yes, that alpha man. That that alpha really got me. Really got me real bad. Don't think he is gonna be able to survive that. Oh my god! Guys! It's the fiends! It's the fiends that just walked into the hybrid town! Hey guys, please help. There's a lot of hivers. Look, hiver. Ah, ah, tee hee hee, ah, ah. Flop, flop. Flop, flop, flop. Hey, hey, hey. They're bullying me. <laughs> Unhinged. Oh, well, there he goes. He, 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 got, he got a menacing stare his way. So basically, while... The hypers are bullying Bonten for not having a leg. Uh, the rest of the party is dying. Um, yeah, because we, we happen to run into a rapture nest with a alpha variant in there. And and I don't think there's much we can do. Well, Rips is gone. I don't think there's much we can do about that. I think I'm gonna hit that reload. <laughs> yeah, auto save one, I believe, is the better one. Yeah, we're gonna, like, it was fine until we ran into, well, actually, what's the autosave two like? What's, what's that one like? I, I believe that's already one we were eating active shit right there. Yes, we're currently eating poop. Okay. That's fine. I'm sure it is. Okay, buddy. And you start... You start crawling away now. Hastily. Now, yes. Yes, they may be right after you. They may be doing just that. No, well, that's... It's okay. It's playing that. It's fine. Yeah, like... We gotta wait for a... Beautiful distraction just like this one right here. Where the hungry bandits, for some reason, decide to go after the fiends right here. And maybe not. Maybe the baby? Maybe they maybe they kill baby? Maybe they will kill a baby. Would you kill a baby to feed yourself? Okay, is that the alpha right there? No, this is a normal fog fiend. How about we just, like, start moving away? Come on, that's, that's just a distraction we needed. Come on, guys. Hurry the hell up. I mean, again, there, there, there's, some, there's some evildoers coming, but they what they do not realize... No, no, just, just move. Just keep moving. Keep moving. Keep moving. Spine will be fine. Don't worry about him. He is not what you should worry about. It's more like that fog feed alpha you should. Buddy, could you stop bothering me? 
Yep. Again, just a distraction we needed to get away from there. At least now. You know, now we can at least uh, heal up a little. And recover somewhat from those terrible wounds we've been su sustaining there. Come on, Spine! You can do it, Spine! Spine, come on! Let him die, I say. Let him die back there. Let him get torn apart by this alpha fiend. I think, I think Spine actually made it out. Th those cannibals might have showed up just in time too for us. Okay. You okay? You're... You know, you're missing your leg, but that's that's fine. That's fine. That's okay. You'll 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 manage. You'll manage. Repair, please. It's quiet. It really is quiet. Okay, now now repair him so it's not gonna be critical anymore. You know, like like get it get his head in order, get his chest in order, maybe fix his leg up so you know that doesn't fall off when we're just kinda meandering about. Look at him with his powerful pose again. Alright, current counter, we lost two limbs. <laughs> one leg and one arm. It's a one-off thing. Yeah, it's a one-off. I, again, there, there's... We, 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 got, we got our goal, and uh, with these guys here, we won't be doing that much more. Otherwise, I would have packed a way different start. Again, just just meant to be like the, the Halloween one. Yeah, fix his leg up a little. There you go, there you go. Getting better robotics. Eh, it's, it's getting there, it's getting there now. We can fix up his leg somewhat now. So we can go to the hivers without him bullying us. Yeah, I mean, Kenshi's can, a lot of fun. Um, But I... <laughs> it's usually like, well, what do you do? Like, what, what, what's your goal? Like, if, if I was to do a proper playthrough of this again, again, uh, it, it might most likely be me going into the, um, the Fog Islands. Also, graphics, what are you set to? Out of curiosity, what are you set to right now? Why are shadows disabled? Huh. I must have run into some issue <laughs> that, that the shadows were disabled. Give me, give me some shadows, man. So this doesn't look so weird. I'd love to increase the render distance too, but hey, alas. Alas, we made it to the uh, to the hivers now, didn't we? Ah, uh, limps. Just what I lost. Just the thing I need. Hi. Human! Not quite human. Not quite human, actually. But we, we might have used to be human, actually. So, uh, you, you win some, you lose some. So we're looking for our left leg. Here, have head. Have some head. There you go. Knock yourself out. Yeah, just just a left leg, okay? Something that doesn't make me absolutely abysmal. Then again, we're looking at hyper limbs, so you're only gonna get abysmal things, <laughs> really. You can, however, pick something less abysmal. You know. You always have the option to pick the the best of the worst. Like, like I, I guess this one for like 3k is gonna be good enough. So we install you the leg so we can actually walk. Um so you can actually you can actually you walk. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, um, anything else you got? Like, anyf anything else I can get from you, rather? We can get some some of these. Oh, uh, they're, they're always handy to have. How much can I afford another one? Yeah, one more. We got one more on us. How many hivers are... Guys. I guess, uh, I mean, yeah, you're hivers, you're, you're like a whole hive, but how many people realistically fit into one workshop? You guys gotta chill! There's a lot of them. Jesus. Okay, guys, let's go out. Flop, flop, flop. What do you mean? Stop flopping on me. Okay, got, got him. Got him high for... You, you're just like Beep, aren't you? You're gonna be just like Beep. 
All right, well, kind of a kind, but they are treated as slaves by everyone. Yeah, I am aware of that, yeah. But sometimes they are absolutely unhinged psychos, so, you know, that's fair. Can I get our weird queen things going on? Well, let's do a little save here, right? As is bone crime. And move along. What happened to the music? Like, any audio, really. Should be playing. Still. Oh, look, acid rain. Which I believe we do not care about because of us being the skeleton variety. So, yeah, I think we're, I think we're okay for the most part. Dead and, uh, dead and hivers. I know, I know they're doing fine as well in terms of, like, raining. Right. So, what, 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 what path do we take? Hey, those here, man. Yeah, acid rains, dude. Acid rains are the worst. Swear to God. <laughs> and we can go down to the desert and then maybe through the swamp. Because that's a funny place. The grid. Honestly, I remember fighting Onis in here. As the clown. And absolutely uh, getting my ass kicked. But also getting like a godlike weapon. So there's that. I suppose we can go through... Through there, yeah? We can go through... The classic border zone. You know? Familiar territory. No, is it not? Or also known as... The bone zone. Yes! Alright guys, I'd like however you to do some, uh, some repairs. And on yourself too. Gotta, gotta have you guys be good at robotics now. Don't I? Bye guys! Discovered Hive Village. Lovely. Lovely. Yeah, you know, if you, if you want to replace your limbs with some mechanical ones, as a fleshy, as a squishy, um, look no further than Acid Rain. Like, you can do a tribal ritual where you just sit in here, sit in a bathtub full of acid, and just kind of wait it out. You can also go uh, get a sunburn, you know, in a different place. Uh, get a bit of a tan. So intense, in fact, that you'll lose limbs. Oh, you know, you'll, you'll, you'll be classic. You, you know, you'll be a little classy. And, um, do the, uh, do the thing where you're just gonna, like, peel your limbs off. Like, you can always do that. That's just a classic, too. A uh, good old limb peeler. Whee! Let's run in circles. Well, this guy's on his way. What's this? It's, uh... Well, they're not psychos, that's for sure. They're just some simple dust bandits. Hanging out, staying around. Yep, there's them. And one of them you could even talk to. This time. That's Bandit Bowman. Not a special, you see, because they have a bow. Of course. Well, guys. You know, if you don't want any trouble, then just, just don't piss us off. Easy, right? Cool. Well, I guess they didn't all get the memo. They were doing pretty well until they actually pissed us off. Suppose we have to fight now. Don't forget prayer day. Oh, we don't have to worry about prayer day in here. I never had to worry about prayer day. Frankly, prayer day is gonna be us, so... I, I never settle anywhere near prayer day area. Prayer day zone. Here we go, we got some guys that, that, that would like to, to shoot us from afar, that's fair. That's fair. We're probably gonna go up and close and personal about those. Once we gotta deal with them. Yeah, I know, I know, but uh, just, I just don't bother. <laughs> I just never bother with brain day. Yeah, like, I... I, I like the Leviathan Coast, honestly. Like, living in the Leviathan Coast is so chill. No no one there to piss you off. Maybe some cannibals, but, like, what about it, right? And then, you know, you got the Leviathans that if, if they do die, you can take, like, a uh, nice pearl out of them. You know, get, get, like, absolutely bonkers rich. Get some massive 
uh, bunker buster like weapons. Yeah, it's, it's just like a cool place overall. Like, I really like living there with the mushroom people. Yeah, it was like really chill. Like, that place itself was incredibly chill. And I'll maybe make a trip to Berserker Country every now and then and find Berserkers. Because why the hell not? Dust Bandit Camp 95 has been wiped out. Yeah, I wonder why. I mean, I did tell them to not piss me off. And what do they do? They piss on me. And that gets me off. <laughs> Wait, no. Um, but they pissed me off. Yeah. He done did it. And they're all bleeding out right now. Or are dying in other ways. So, hey, they had it coming. Hey, you know, they just took the... They, they just picked the wrong targets, you know. Like the least in exp uh, as an exploring, not settling. Uh... The most boring place to explore. Um, let's have a look. Uh, I think. I mean, Drake's kind of lame. <laughs> um, I'm not too fond of Drake. It's kind of like just there. This place is kind of cool. Like, I like those. You know, like, obviously, Southeast is always kind of cool. They have all the wacky stuff. God's cool too. DI, I don't know about DI. DI has like a massive satellite. Um, or the Orkan stuff, the like Orkan scarf and, and that rebirth. I mean, rebirth, rebirth's fine. Rebirth's actually fine. Like Orkan's uh, golf is kind of lame. Like like anything from from those guys really. <laughs> Raptor Island, yeah, it's it's yeah, it's just that border zone can be kind of lame, but uh, it's it's okay for the most part. It's aight, it's aight. I know. It's pretty aight. Little metal, metal helmet there. Little tin helmet they got. Anything that may be considered worth selling, actually. Or stealing. Probably not. Again, they're just dust bandits. Eh. Getting beamed into someone exploring, how about you? I don't mind. So like, uh, again, I, I don't really need to worry about that. Especially not in this run. Right, let's go guys, let's move out. Discovered, squeen. Right. Smoke lights down there, a bit of a town. Is that the shack setting? I forgot if it is. It may be. But, on the way, there may be some more, uh, Vagabonds and a Dust Bandit boss. Well, you know, for good old time's sake, why, why don't we just go in and, like, rough them up, you know? We all know they're gonna do it anyways. Let's, let's rattle their bones, shall we, boys? Just the three of us. Alright, guys. Hello. Would you like to do a bit of a scruffle? Would you like to get your bones rattled? Because we're here to rattle, you know, it's kind of a thing. Uh, it's like a jump scare out of nowhere, three skeletons appear and beat you up. <laughs> rattle them, boys. Let's get him. Anyway, to be, be friends with bandits, I don't know, since I never tried. I mean, probably, but again, I never tried as well, and I... I mean, I mean, you can talk to their bosses if if you manage to do that. They're, they're, they may have a um, somewhat classy response, maybe to that, and then be like, "Yeah, I, I guess you can be with us." I know in the swamp you can. Also, look at this guy being fully impaled with like various uh, projectiles. Now they're hostile to me, right? Now, now I absolutely won't be able to be friends with them <laughs> in any easy fashion. That is. Like, you can always, like, murder one of their rivals, most likely, and they're gonna be like, Hey, you know what? Thanks for that, by the way. Yeah, just, just ping-pong between uh, between these two, you know, so they don't shoot, actually, anyone. It's just like Rimworld, you know? Keep them keep keep busy, so they can't do range. Dude, we turned into pen cushions right here. <laughs> Look at that. But for the fact that we are pen cushions, we barely took damage, which is, a, which is a really good sign, right? We don't want to be pen cushions and not be able to take it. 
That's the last thing I want to do. Also, man, those guys are going to have some severe case of anemia once they wake up. Let's roll. Jump skin, yeah. A car set out on the road by skeletons. Yeah, it sure would be. Are usually chill for, good, for a good reason. There are tons of dangerous fauna there, yeah. Uh, speaking of swamp, we might be going there. Like right now, actually. Let's move in, boys. How's your flat looking by now? 60? Yeah, it's getting there, it's getting there. And I actually see you guys got some strength now. So that's, that's, that's always good. Actually having some bone marrow behind your bones, that's always a nice one. Now, there is a new big thing in town, by the way. Um, do I have no idea if we'll run into it, like, ever, or not. Uh. But yeah, there's just a new beaked foe in here. And anyone who may or may not have capped out with the Kenshi, um... More like feed, I suppose, like, uh, their, their updates, kinda. Where they threw down a bunch of suggestions for mods for, for like, Halloween, which is mostly what I'm using here. Y you may know about the Hydra, you know? That's all I'm saying. That's all I'll say. We never know. There may be some Hydra action that we're gonna come across. We'll see. Alright, lads. This is Swamp County. I'm really surprised we haven't seen many zombies yet. Like, usually, usually there's just like... Should be a bunch of zombies here and there. Like, all over the place. What are we doing, Swamp Brothers? Let's keep going, yeah? So, Mike, is this still Malaysia? <laughs> uh, just a different part of it? Nice and dark, very wet. Reminds me of uh, that one level from Unreal 2. Dead or Halo, when, when they introduce you to the Flood? Eh, I mean, we, we are just like skimming through the swamp right now, aren't we? But hey, it's, it's what appears to be a path to me, at least, so here we go. And people turn you into... Uh, corn skeleton spaghetti. No! Oh, don't say that! Not skeleton spaghetti. They're gonna turn into bone marrow so their plants can grow better in this fertile land. But again, you know. There's still zombies out and about somewhere. Just gotta wonder where exactly they may be. Where could. Zombies possibly be gathering here. I know they're in the swamps and mainly the desert. Uh, like a lot of zombies in the desert. Desert? You know the desert? Like especially this one? Uh, the great one? It's full of zombies. <laughs> like, it should be at least. Don't dance cow. Alright, alright. Well... That's fine, like, I'll just assume you grinded up some person and, like, fed them to your plants. <laughs> it's okay, you know, we, we, we'll still accept you here, you know, we'll still accept you at Twitching HQ. It's, it's gonna be fine. I'm gonna judge you. Give back to nature? Yeah, it's, yeah, like, that's fine. You can, you can be like a boss, man, you know, it's fine. You know, take everything from the hunt and just, like, reuse it somehow, right? And, and don't you hurt plants, you know? Better not. The green pack's gonna hate you for that. Did a bone? Is that a massive bone right here? Or is that like a wanky plant? It might just be a wanky plant, actually. I discovered rot. My tongue begins to start bleeding. The Filipinos are the bosmers. I see. <laughs> I see. Tons and tons of plants. You know, you know, you know, boss for Filipinos. I gotta ask Cap about that one. <laughs> like, how are you doing, a little bossmer? So how many people have you killed yet, huh? And in the name of the Green Pact, that is. Alright, guys, let's wait for the spine. Dubious little bossmer. So just moving there. 
I'm gonna show you guys another way. You got a good skeleton orientation senses here. Dude, I'm, I'm really happy we got to see the incredibly edgy spine um, scythe weapon thingy that we got here. Like, it's so extra. Like, it's so incredibly extra. And I love it. <laughs> it's... Oh boy. Yeah, it's, it's, it's sure is a thing. We be using. Awfully quiet again. The swamps. Awfully, awfully quiet like in here. Probably because it's night time. Everyone and everything is sleeping, you know. Even the mosquitoes and the blood spiders just napping right now. Yeah, that must be it. Just taking a bit of a nap. Hey, ribs, wait. We're losing our spine right now. Let's just run in a circle so we can get some athletics up nonetheless. Right. Yeah, I mean, again, like, we're not gonna be inside of, you know, the swamps too much. We're gonna go to Shen. And, um... Then probably Flat Lagoon, and for Flat Lagoon we'll go to Soap's Gamble and we're there. At least that's, uh... That's a route, you know? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, like, you, you gotta continue running so you can get your athletics up. So you can move faster, right? Uh, you can also be completely over-cucumbered <laughs> to, to get your strength up, right? Because you're gonna be hauling a bunch of weight with you. Best case, you pick someone up who has also a lot of weight on him. Just like, go power walk through the whole place until you're like Hulk Hogan. Well then. Day's starting to shine. You can also go swim. If you want to be a fast swimmer. But swimming doesn't usually have too much of a usage. Unless you live on some island, I guess. And like, swim back and forth between places. Like, I could see that, maybe. But yeah, no, like... Yeah, you, you do technically level athletics the way you'd level athletics in, uh, in Morrowind. Yeah, absolutely. There we go. Yeah, just, just follow the road. You know, let's, like, regroup back there so... So the spine can catch up again while running in a little bit of a circle here. Badass, I'll take notes. Yeah, like, you, you can also power level your stealth. If you are at, like, someone's gates, and there's, like, a bunch of guards in front of the gates, and, and you just, like, stealth around them the entire time, just power level stealth that way. Like, you can also use training dummies for, for all of those things, because for stealth, I don't know how you would level stealth with a training dummy. But, um, you know, you just, like, do dummies. But dummies only get you that far, right? You just need to get some of that practical experience in. Oh. As dead. A person. Of the swamp ninjas. Behind you, fool. Yeah, his spine's a little uh, held up, you see. Yeah, mess him up, boys. Rattle him! Rattle him! Come on, reps, you can rattle him better. I've seen you rattle more. And I was complimenting the swarms about how quiet they be. Well then. You gonna be done here with this one? Like, come on, wrap up. Wrap up with that one. They're, they're turning our people into pen cushions again. Good head. Good, good opener, definitely. All right. That's thing, yes. Yeah. yeah, it's them. The swamp ninja. Look at them leveling once again up their their defense and their attacks, which trust me, we'll very much need where we're going. Like, there's a actual start for the Bone Man, like a proper default start, but it, 
It starts them off with almost no stats. And that, 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 that's no good for a one-off now, is it? Hey, help our guy here. He seems to be in a, in a bit of a... In a bit of trouble. He can handle these. Oh, now that was a nice multi-head right there. Spine him. There we go. Now what you what you got on you there, huh? What you got? Swamp Ninja Mask? I mean, I actually like it. Aesthetically, you know? Do we already have a fog mask? Good reason. You know, fog lens and whatnot. Police helmet? I mean, this is gonna stay on. And I, I, I like his little straw hat. So... They all got their fashion already. Okay. And you... Help yourself out too. Ah, uh, nothing better than some rattling in the morning, you know? And I'd like to think that those guys, they, they mistakenly assume that the people they just saw, like those three people on the road, that they were just like some some generic humans, right? And then they get closer and they, they see like this guy's face, right? Because it's the only one not hiding it. And they're like, wait, wait, th that's quite a lot of reps actually. Like an unusual amount for, for humans to be poking out of their clothing. Hmm. Mayhaps, mayhaps not. Oh, well, it's too late. We're, we're committing now. Here, get, get repaired. Get repaired by your friend. Yeah, they're most likely all going to be playing that by the time they even wake up. And even then, and even then, they're going to be in a lot of hurt by the time they get up. So... Let's move on, boys. Let's move on. Good old reps back here. Yeah, I mean, again, it's getting there. Like, I, uh, preferably, I'd like to see him with more melee attack. But we have no time to actually build up a dummy or, like, make a makeshift dummy by cutting off people's limbs and using that human um, blob the human nugget as like um a training dummy which by the way are pretty effective just make sure to not break them too much like put them in the peeler i know make, make, make sure they're they're not gonna get out anytime soon right but uh don't don't break them you know like it's gonna be pretty hard to train on a corpse right i say as a walking corpse there we go let's move on Good old shit. I was expecting to be running into... Into some... Spiders, actually. But Swamp Ninjas, I suppose they'll do. I suppose they'll do. Alright, let's keep on going. Slowing quite a bit of terrain. Is that the sand proper? The outside of the Swamp Sand? With the rivers. Pretty wanky plants they got, actually, in the swamp, you know. Settled nomads. Well, then they're hardly nomads if they settled now, aren't they? Jesus. <laughs> Skeleton Jesus. Like, can you believe that? Settled nomads, my ass, man. Hardly can call yourself a nomad, then. Who the hell... Do you think you are to be attacking us? Get fucked. Who the hell does this one guy think he is? Like, he's already gonna be bleeding out. Oof. Right in the stomach with the scythe. I like how he's looking at him. I like the look. You know what it reminds me of? Hold on. See? They're just looking at him. There we go. <laughs> That's the bit. <laughs> That's the bit right there. Um, <laughs> who the hell does this one guy think he was? 
Yeah, like, like if, if I mess up someone, like, dude, imagine actually having a bunch of those skeletons just, like, playing that song. <laughs> like, oh god, it's beak things. Here they are. There they are. The beakers. And we've been spotted by one of them. Or have we? If we can fight just one, I'd, I'd like to fight just one. But I'd rather avoid fighting all. Let's play chicken, let's play chicken with the beak. Through the water. My god. Okay, okay, we pissed off one of them, we pissed off one. Let's beak him. Rattle him, boys! Rattle this beak thing! That's some good combat training, I'm just saying. Yeah, yeah. Gotta protect yourself from that uh, hungry giraffe, you see. Absolutely demolish that thing. Absolutely. Give me your ladder. Not like I need it, but just give me your ladder, though. I'm gonna skin you. Was that a person that just, like, ran across the plane stair, or, like, am I imagining things? Huh, <laughs> must have been the wind. Alright, back to the boys. Running across the desert. Probably fairly athletic at this point, right? Like, um... Running for days now to complete their journey. All the way from the Foglands to, um... Wherever they may be heading to, which is a mystery. Matter of fact, they, they may not even know themselves, you know? They may not even know themselves. All that I know is, however, that there is some... Starving bandits. Okay, why is my spine inside of water? Spine? Why are you like this? But I suppose you may keep... You, you might as well keep swimming. Um, we're about to join you, actually. And in, inside of the body of water here. Dude, we're like skeleton pirates. Look at us. We're, we're just running at the bottom of it. <laughs> like, It's... it's it, Davy Jones is coming out to rattle your bones now. Where the bandits at? They just leave in the meantime. I was underwater. Is that them? Can I still rattle? I mean, look, look. It's quite the quantity of them, right? Like, it's, it's a lot. It's a lot. But you gotta keep in mind, they're absolutely pathetic. You, you gotta keep in mind, they're absolutely pathetic. Yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. It's just like that scene. It's just like it. Okay, we messed up one of you guys. And the rest is coming down like a tidal wave now. Now, this is straight up from um, World War Z right here. Where, like, all of those guys are coming down except for they're not zombies, but they're starving still. <gasps> rattle them! Come on, rattle them, boys! Rattle them! And even if you do get beat up by some skinny people... We got new knowledge that we can use, you know, against it. Keep rattling. Never stop rattling, eh? We may be outnumbered, but that makes it fun, now doesn't it? See? Barely know how to block. Like, this guy almost lost his entire chest by that. Like, some of them do hurt, right? Some of them do some... Some decent damage. And they keep bopping him on the head as well, which is rather rude, actually. The good thing is, because they're like a whole crowd, we, we can't hit multiple at once. Like, see? Like that. Two of them at once. Bam, hit. Especially with this guy's his weapon. Like, he just hit three of them at once. Like, it's really fun if you have a melee weapon that is, like, really girthy. Oh, God, it's... Bone fiends this time. They're trying to steal our kill. Someone multi hit option on. Yeah, exactly. Basically that. But yeah, it's it's like it's like that. It's if you have someone who's like a absolutely bonkers weapon, you can absolutely like mess them up, right? Like you you just do one swing and kill like ten people at once, with, like your bravest warrior. It seems like the bone fiends are kind of chill with us, actually. They're just killing the starving bandits right now. 
Hey, I'm cool with that. Yeah, I'm absolutely cool with it. Oh, well, never mind. It seems like Bonetin had different ideas there. But it's fine. Just a bit more more of a fight. And there goes my there go my ribs. Ribs got hit on the hands a little too much. On the hands? On the head. Only has one. He lost the second head a while ago. Oh, nice hits, man. Nice hits with your Nagitana. Solid. Yeah, bully this one. Bully this fog fiend. I mean, bone fiend. Close enough. Gift ladder. So, they're absolutely dead, actually. They're not gonna come back. See if you skin a animal. Like, if someone's playing dead. Like, if a animal's playing dead. But, um... Bonk fiend? Exactly. Like, if, if an animal's playing dead, for example. And, and you happen to have a, um... Person at hand there. Like, what I can do is just, like, go rip out one tooth and kill them in one go, basically. Hey, see this guy? How about you get him? Rips is gonna take care of this here. No, Rips is gonna take care of this here. Okay, Rips, now you need to hit him. Beautiful. Unconscious, they see. Now, th th you know, it, it is considered overkill by many, but um, I view it as additional training opportunities. Do you have no repair kit on? We can repair. Hey, why don't you exactly? Oh, good block. Oh, good block. Ooh, running leg, running leg again. And the arm. Oh, you're not doing too well now. Okay, here, come, here comes the rest of the gang. Auto-saving just with the final blow there. Okay, you need some repairing too. Let's repair you. Should be fairly decent at robotics at this point. Ah, uh, Dragon. Yeah, that one's absolutely dying. Yeah, you know, Hungry Bandits, they got their ass kicked. That's a sp I swear I saw one of them walk around right now. But it seems good. It seems fun. Wait. There's one. Trying to get the, uh, the, f the bonk fiend's flesh, huh? Get riddled. Alright. That's good. Again, practice. Practice, practice, practice. <laughs> And then, you know, again, they're kind of getting there. Like, yeah, it takes a while, but again, at least the strength's getting places too, right? Now then, let's continue our way through shit. Yeah, at this point, we could use our, um, our skeleton bat because we're showing signs of wear and tear. So if there would be, like, another town on the way, that'd be cool. Well, a town on the way that... Also, fulfills the criteria of having a um, skeleton bed. Or any robotics, really. Now, that would be awfully convenient. Poor Spines was the last one. Carrying a huge uh, weight there. Massive burden. Well, let's see. I mean, Flat Lagoon must have something. Isn't that where, like, uh, Clown Steady is? I think so, right? That's where Flat Lagoon is. Clown Steady? At least I thought so. Um, if nothing else, there's the, there's the Royal Valley with the Hive. Um, which I know, they're, they're actually kind of more on the pissed side of things. Just keep on going, guys. Keep on moving. Load. Ah, there it is. Hell yeah. And you know what? Just in time as well because it's night. So what you might have just seen is all that you may see of this. Uh, we just gotta not go into Sniper Valley. Which is way back there, so it's fine. 
Yeah, Vance. Vance. Vance is a wanky place. Vance is really wanky. It's not safe to be. Don't worry. It's fine. It's fine. And again, just in nighttime as well. Just for nighttime to be here. <laughs> it's fine. Don't worry about it. We're skeletons anyway, so we're fine, right? Like, what? Well, are, uh, are we gonna get bone bleached? Are our bones gonna get bleached? You know, I don't think so. We'll be fine. Come on. Huh. It's not like we're not heading towards Flat Lagoon anyways. At least, you know. At the very least, we got to sing the beams. Hard come by. People don't tend to come back to life. They find skinless corpses in the pits. Say that the mist ghouls are flaying and eat you. Mist ghouls. Guys, we got a bit of a canine situation. You see, they're called bone dogs for a reason, and they, they sure want our bones. Or boneyard wolves, rather. Which sure take a beating, holy hell. Take your teeth. Uh, same with this one, just to make sure, you know. Can have him strolling around now. It's boning time. That and we are out on uh, healing supplies now. Mm -mm. That's rather uh, inconvenient, now is it not? Strange town. Strange. Wait, no, actually, isn't Clown Static more like... I remember being in the crater. Is it not in the hook? Is it more is it not like the hook? Where it is actually? Yeah, this this place isn't really too inhabited now, is it? Traders. A trading caravan. But who's the merchant? Like, seriously, who is the merchant? Who do I talk to? Please. <laughs> I'm just a bone man on the lookout for some bone friends. Yeah, you guys don't 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 leave him alone, okay? <laughs> also do be moving there. Hey Do I need to feed him? Show me what you have. Ah, animals. Just Just animals, sadly. Y you sure they don't have any other words? I don't know, it's, uh, is it? Oh, well. Sit! <laughs> Guys, they actually don't have anything that good. Not even a bone repair kit. Like, bone mold. But, at the very least, a town do be here. The good old town of Strange Town. My beloved. We can always go to Black Desert, by the way. Uh, if we were to go to wherever the fuck Black Desert is. Ray Self. Sonorous Dark. Which would be cool, by the way. And. I know Black Desert City somewhere. Just like the MMO. Hey, guys. Tag Hunters. Ah, yes. Yeah, they're gonna be fine. Hey, guys. How's it going, my fellow flesh wearers? Am I right? No mind me going in here. And don't mind me going in here. Because I see a sign I very much do like. Is it is it is it the upstairs? Yeah, it's the upstairs I want. Sorry, I don't care about you. Matter of fact, it is only the upstairs I want. Can afford eight hundred Rental. Shit. That's right, I can't afford it. Alright guys, let's go down, let's go down, talk to this guy. We, 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 we do need to browse in the end. Show me what you got. No. Um, care for some animal pelt? Mayhaps? Mayhaps you care for some more animal pelt? Just like that. Mayhaps you care for animal teeth, which should be able to get sold one by one. Uh, not by one. Bleh. Not one by one, but, you know, multiple at once. 
Oh yeah, what 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 were, what were those limbs you you said you you offer here? Scout lag, scout lag. That's a good one. All right, that's the scout lag. Scout lag is looking mighty fine. Sally, we're kind of broken right now. Well, you see, gotta go up here. Up into that skeleton bed. So we don't need to waste our resources, you see. We'll be just fine. We'll be just fine. Also far far cheaper than um it was in Mongrel. That was 3k, man. That was 3k a day. We're only 800 in here. It's way cheaper. Way more economic. Yep. Let's just all get repaired here. And you too. It's at full working capacity. It seems like Spine's the only one who actually has the, the repair kit, so let us do go ahead and change that. Also, I like how Spine's weight changed to moderate now. Alright, yeah, we, we are good. We're good, we can move on. Since we're almost there, as well. We're almost there. Almost where we want to be. Traveling during daily. Yep. Stove scamble. That's the, that's, that's the place. That's the place, alright? That's the place we want to be at. Still somewhat disappointed we couldn't see any gray wraiths. But maybe... Maybe if we were to go to gray shelf... Which... Um, hold up. Ribs. Ribs. Did you get yourself in a bit of, of a kerfuffle with the drone guards here? Ah, man. Now we need to find them hivers. Well, that's gonna be probably uh, a bit worse for us. Because they actually know how to fight. Leaving him into real life. It's really catchy out there. Yeah, it's 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 hard to tell what, what is catchy and what isn't. Is that a whole whole less prince back here? Jeez. Gonna just, just just a prince rolling out here, huh? Well, I mean, they got very capable guards, you see. So we're Fucking hell, we knocked out the prince. Steal his clothing. Steal his clothing? So when the prince wakes up, he's gonna be naked? And it's gonna be an epic prank, bro. It's gonna be so epic. Dude, the prince is gonna wake up and it's gonna be like all naked. <laughs> Actually, you know what? This fucking gear here, matter of fact, is an upgrade to us. Like in, in both ways. They won't even recognize me being a skeleton now. My god, he he blocked without even blocking. Well this guy he He He's down. <laughs> Dude, Bonten is actually going hard at it right now. Bonten's actually going pretty hard. Come on, Bowden! Don't let yourself be bullied! At least give him a what for. Hey, I mean, again, this is toughness. It's going up, you know? And that's ours! Well, it's mine now. The so fuck you. <laughs> ah. Hey, that didn't undress me necessarily. King will suck on it! King will suck it dry! Man, that just left reps inside of the murky water there, huh? So, so... Who's gonna get sucked now? What? Ah, yes, the prince. Get pranked, dude! Get fucking pranked, boy! Get pranked! Yo! We got him, boys. We got him good. So, um... 
So the tech hunter town, yeah? <laughs> we, um... We may need to go back to the tech hunters and get repairs again. We already paid for it for today, so we're gonna be fine. And even then, we can afford it again, so... 61 toughness is pretty, pretty neat on him. Now, our lad here... You may need a little bit of a better helmet, you know, like the iron head is, is all good and whatnot, but it's not gonna cut it, sadly, I'm afraid. Alright guys, let's go, let's go back to, to Flats Lagoon, shall we? Before we get, like, attacked by more hivers. Guys, Flats Lagoon, yeah? You get a deal? Zombie Nest 143 has been wiped out! So there are still zombies, huh? Yeah, I've also never done a tag hunter playthrough. Where I'd be just like a singular tag hunter trying to do some tag hunting. Oh, for, for a moment I thought those were some wacky pigs. But no, those are those are actually wacky wacky um wacky bats. Surely we can beat these up, right? Surely we can beat up a bat. Or two. Tag Hunt uh, run, my first Kenshi run. Yeah, Tag Hunters is pretty cool. Like that, that, you know. It's fun. It's fun. Like I... Uh, I probably will do it at some point. Perhaps. Uh, let's get some ladder. And let's get some of the funny teeth. And let's also get this one. I already fucked this thing up, huh? <laughs> sure is gone. Alrighty, let's keep going. Flats Lagoon style, yeah? It's right there. Right here, actually. Right there. Gotta go for uh, realsies. Have fun talking. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. Don't get spooked too much today, okay? Unless you want to. Then get real spooked. Yeah, hope you had fun with the bone rattlers rattling the bones. Alright, let's go inside. Second story. Gotta, um, gotta do some repairs, you see. And there he goes. Repairing oh so slowly, but for free, basically, at this point. Like, we don't need to spend extra kits to do that. Okay, I have this guy. Oof. Yeah, fuck. His head was really bad on it. Like, he, 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 was, he was really not feeling it there. Now we're gonna keep repairing yourself. Well, uh... Ribs. Yeah, ribs. Ribs could be doing better. Anyways, run around, get some athletics up in the meantime, you know. Alright, still the head. He, got, he, he, he must have gotten hit hard on the head. That does also offer decent sharp protection, like for cutting, but not so good blunt. Like if, if he gets hit by them blunt attacks, it's uh, not that good. Alrighty. Yeah, I mean, again, since since we're in the area, since we're near an actual skeleton bed, might as well use it, right? Like, might as well go for it. And there they go. There goes the gang again. The three bone rattlers. Going off on their journey once more. Preferably not getting their asses kicked by the southern hive this time. Because that would be kind of cool. Fountain, what's up? What's what's the hold up? Hmm. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Um. Yeah, right. Uh, we we might want to actually sell all of that ladder. So let's run back again. Yeah, let's let's run back all the way again. At least it's getting some strength up, you see. Like the rest of the crew is. Yeah, you know, we kinda, we kinda gotta, 
gotta sell you some things, you know? Um, this, 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 this. Honestly, get those. The, the Hiver armor is a little better, actually. So, I'm not gonna be missing it. We can have them teeth and, and that ladder. Don't think there's anything else we need. Garu backpack. I mean, again, the scout lag is somewhat tempting, right? Since he only has a economy hive with him. So he would be better. But then again, he does not. He, he does not have enough money for the scout lag. We need... We need 9.7k, we have 6.2k. Selling this shoddy thing is going to give us 1.6k, so it, it'll not be enough. We'd need to we need to sell some extra stuff, right? Uh, no, that wouldn't be that better. You could use some pants though, buddy. Sure could use some of those. Got buyback, at the very least, so... 8% blunt, not that good. But it's better than cutting. On, on both fronts. Yeah, some more cloth pants, cargo, sneaky chain. Sneaky chain cargo pants. I think they're gonna be a little better on you. It looks good. Now there's always this thing, right? But it's whatever. We don't we don't need to sell that. Yeah, yeah, if, if we if we had more of those hyper things we could sell them for a light price. But alas, we are likely not to be getting the stuff that we wanna be getting here. Unless, you know, we go in here and we like rob this store blind by the time night arrives properly. Which we may just do. You know, we may just do that. We may get some last ditch money in here from the tag hunters. We're gonna be running inside of a circle here to get our flatics up, you know, and um, just kind of, kind of wait. We're just kind of gonna wait for the time to be right to strike. Like, what is it? Like, may maybe around midnight is when uh, when people definitely gonna be closing the stores. Like, probably like 10, 10 p.m. probably already. As you can see, night passes quickly. Right now, so... Yeah, let's give it like another hour. They may be closing the shops soon then. Not a bar though, but the shops. Unless, you know, they're open 24-7, which would kind of suck. Come on. Come on. Close your shop now. It's pretty late now, isn't it? I... So, by the way... When I when I loaded this mod pack earlier, like I had a mod on that was like darker nights, which I still think is good. But matter of fact, the nights were so dark I was barely able to see anything at all. Now that that kinda sucks. You know, that kinda kinda wouldn't be it. Also, I'm gonna be honest right now. Oh, they closed the store, that's good. I have to take a little pee break. <laughs> So, uh, I'll be back real quick, like, all right?
I'm back. How's it going? Did I miss something? Because we're about to go in crime style. We're gonna be doing the stuff we've been doing the entire time in, in Mongrel. Except for with far, far, far less guards around, you see? Like, seriously. No one's around. They just trust you, you know? They just trust you to be a good person. And, you know, they're manning the gates. Not too many guards here, actually. Like, at all. Prime time for us, you see. Unless, you know, the shopkeep was to be around here. But clearly, that's not the case now, is it? Okay, let's see what's inside chest number one. Well, having these two just kind of here and kind of closing the door. Just in case. A Hachigane. Unironically, it's actually way better than the um, metal armor. Good old rips ass here. Hey. Can I have that Hachigane, please? Can I stand the Rudo running with that? Yeah, it's just better. It's simply better. Can I actually wear it? Hold on. You, you, you wear it? Can't wear the item. No! Ronin head trailer, yeah, yeah. Uh, metal plate, yes, yes. Head, yes. Yes, head. Head. What do you mean, can't wear it? Um. Or, uh, is, is, is it because um, I'm a skelly boy? Is it maybe because of that? Hey man, can you wear the Hachigane? Is that, is that like a hyper thing? No. Well, that's that's just outright a shame then. Wait, he didn't even lock his chest? Well, because there's nothing to be, to be locked away, I suppose. The vault. Not skilled enough. That's fair. It, it is it is a pretty tough lock. It's it's way tougher than anything we have. Oh, there's just some um, fighting happening. Yeah, a bunch of bats down there. Right then. Anything here? A red bandana? My god! <laughs> Jackpot. Red bandana time, baby. Let's go. 90% and yet he failed on his first attempt. Can you believe that guide? Rattan heart. Yeah, well, we don't need that either. Some building mats, but, you know, obviously we don't need those either. Anything on the second floor? Yeah, the person was sleeping. How'd you get here? How, how'd you notice me? How'd you notice me, man? We need to help a man. I'm, our, our comrades, we need to rattle them. Illegally. Illegal rattling happening right now. Ooh, you really got this one there. But you see, the ninja guard actually knows a trick or two. Actually giving us a little bit of a tougher time. But you see, it's no crime if no one's there to see it or report it, you see. We need to take out a ninja guard, everyone! Rattle them! Good rattling, good rattling. Good rattle. Unrattled bones, yeah, well, we, we just rattle them thoroughly. Uh, katana wasn't that good, actually. But we'll still take them. We'll still take your katanas. You see? Um, 32, 49, 90. 14, 19, I mean, yeah, that's better. We can, we can, we can swap, we can swap that. Uh, what about your boots? 11, 17, 60? No. No, they're gonna be sold off. Same with you, sure, that's gonna be get, that's gonna get sold. Even your mad kid. It's ours now. It's in the rattle zone. Again, it's, it's not a crime if no one sees you doing it. Or no one's there to report it, rather. You really didn't have anything good on you, didn't you? I'll just take the mad kit and sell it later, maybe. 
I mean, of all the guys, it's it's uh, Rips who got the biggest damage there. Wasn't even worth it, man. Do we only have a bounty of 100 on us right now? That's like, that's like nothing, by the way. It's like actually nothing. And they're both unconscious right now and uh, not doing too well. Let me kidnap them for, for absolutely no reason. Like, actually no reason at all. Just except for the sake of simply doing it. Spine. Can you use your sheer strength to open it? Hey, hey, can you open the whole safe with your strength? If you can't use this, can you use tools? But we don't have any, is the thing. Well, this place is really kind of a bust, huh? There's absolutely nothing actually good that I can wear, that is. Or isn't, like, hidden away behind a locked level 1000. Yeah, yeah, old key. I mean, there's just nothing I want to steal like this. It's like a ranch, I suppose. Like, the biggest loot we got is maybe this here, the Straw Hat Research. Oh, that, that, that's kind of, kind of, uh... We got him back. Don't let the kidnappers escape. Oh, yeah, I mean, I suppose so. All right, again, it's not a crime if there's no one to report it, right? So let's get Gurgle. Let's make Gurgle Gurgle. Eh, Gurgle, Gurgle, Gurgle is not bad at defense. That's for sure, but, but it's it's three of us against one of them, right? D Gurgle. Gurgle me bones. Yeah, yeah, they're solid, they're solid. We're getting a few hits here and there, but they're, they're, doing, they're doing pretty well. Oh, it's Gurgle's friends. Like Shaku. Yeah. Seems like <laughs> you know, maybe walking out with some people on our back wasn't the best idea. They're supposed to do a jump attack on me. What the fuck? Yeah, well, again, if nothing else, we get some training in, <laughs> you know? Hey, you can't say I didn't know my sketchy out there, Gurgle. Can't say I didn't. Did you just lose a limb? Yep, he lost his leg. Just there. Just give in, man. Just give in. Fuck. He just lost both of his feet. By the way. <gasps> he just lost both of his arm, uh, arms, legs. And there. Uh, so, uh, the explosion zero hours is like, it's like right away, isn't it? The bounty's still there, clearly. Yeah, so it's going down, he lost both legs, you know. Poor, poor spine is legless now. Can't wear their, their plated leg boots anymore. Yeah, actually feetless. Oh man, it's still not cool to stand up. It's just a bounty of 100. Come on, man. <laughs> just a bounty of 100, dude. Okay. So, so you're actually gonna throw him into prison this time, please? Or just gonna... Hold on. Okay. <laughs> that works. Well. What are you? Western Hive. Hmm, fair. Some hivers sitting here. So let's let's go to the uh, to the uh, wars of the the, the the factions, right? Attack uh, hunters. That's a minus five. Not necessarily hostile. Okay, now now the bounty may be five hundred. Nineteen hours to expire, but he doesn't have a bounty, right? So if only he gets up. Apparently he's committing a crime by waking up. What's his crime? What is he being accused of? What is he being accused of? Bullshit. 
<laughs> they have no solid evidence except for me walking out with some people on my back. Except for that, I have nothing. Look at this man's skull, too. You picked up a bad time to get lost. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Like, like he didn't have a bounty before. Well, you know, it's fine. It's fine, you see. Because, I mean, yeah, he has a limp trauma because, you know, kind of, kind of lost his legs there. But it, we won't die. So we can, like, lay down here for as long as we want to. That's the thing if you're a scouting. You can't play dead for a pretty long time, you see? <laughs> like, how are they gonna know you're actually alive out of the sun? You're, you're dead to them. Clearly. So, you know, maybe, maybe there's gonna be some, some wacky distraction. I'm just gonna, like, get her attention there. Good old, good old lung rot. God, I love that person. Yeah, some of them have a big attack stat, right? Like, they... Dogs? Like, they, 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 they have nothing to scoff at. But I reckon I'll have better chances during the night time again. Simply do, you know... When it's dark, you know, they don't really see ya, and then, and then like, uh, we can actually stand up in peace and not have our bones broken repeatedly. Yeah, that sounds like an idea to me. Because apparently waking up is a crime. We also have to wait 15 hours for the bounty to expire, except for him. He, he has a bit of a bigger bounty. It's also not like they have a police station now, is it? They're just gonna, like, drop you on the floor. They're like, alright, we beat him up. We're waking up again, let's beat him up once more. And that's it. Ah, uh, Fletch Lagoon, my beloved. You always tickle me, right? Like, you know, the one time you cut off both of my legs right there and uh, give me severe limb trauma. God, I love those. Those are the best times. Man. That's good. Well, now, now, now we gotta get our spine some new legs, you see. And I, I know that the guy in here does possess some leggies, right? And, you know, they, they were dumb enough to actually not take away the items we stole being well, barely anything, but still, they did not. I like how... Oh? You guys go cool standing up? Are we legal citizens now? Are we allowed to do that? Okay. Well, clearly they're not attacking us inside right now, so I suppose so. I suppose we're not committing a crime anymore by standing up. Right? Seems to be the case. Well, well, my favorite customer. Yeah, that's so? You sure? God. How did you get those clothes? What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Because I stole from someone, maybe, once. Is that what? Is that, is that what you're on about, man? Come on, dude. Tell me some slack. So you say that 7 came for that one, huh? No, is it because of the... Colored armor here, like the, the chest armor? Yeah, yeah, it's stolen from the ninja heart from the tech hunter faction. Yeah, yeah, I can see. I can see that. Well... I don't know what you're referring to, dude. Um, I'm clearly innocent of whatever crime you're accusing me. So, whatever fucked up shit you're planning on doing here, I'm, I'm not taking kindly to it. It's actually pretty rude, you see. C clearly, clearly, he, he, he is innocent, clearly. Alarm raised. I was not the aggressor, by the way. I knocked one of them out. Or, no, not quite. I am clearly not the aggressor in this case, Yuri, right? Every Everyone watching the stream can agree with that, I'm sure. Poor ribs. I mean, poor spine, look at this. 
Okay, let's hurry it up. Crawl a little faster, buddy. Come on. Pick up. P pick him up. Uh, I don't know how it works when you're crawling, but pick him up. You aggressed him. Oh, man, I mean, I did not aggress him. He was clearly the one that peeved me off first. All right, just just crawl your way up to the bed, and get some repairs done. Okay, don't don't worry, we'll be with you at any moment now. All right, you just you just lay down and enjoy yourself a little. Uh, thing is okay. So, you think if I was to wake up now, they would be pissed about it? As I kind of need to, you know, we're, we're kind of critical here, you know? We kind of need to get access to that band that we, by the way, legally purchased now. Uh, this time for real. Okay, out of the way, crippled boy. It's time for uh, this guy to, to lay down. Is a little more in the critical state. Yes, mercenaries. I, I can take on the mercenary, alright? Like that guy's no problem. I can take him on. You think that's where they keep the loot? The metal chest? That's where the bionic limbs may be? You know, that's actually the, the canonical lore of how the Kanshi skeletons um, first appeared. Like, they used to be perfectly normal human skeletons. Before they they lost all their limbs and got more bionic replacements, and and that's why the skeletons are called skeletons because that's what they used to be, right? It's it's pretty convoluted. Right? I'm I'm not gonna pretend it's not, but um, yeah, yeah, it's 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 what it is. It's what it is. Okay, they're they're moving around. That's that's fair. That's fine. Let's go to normal speed. I'm just gonna, like, hide inside of this shady corner there, right? Apparently they don't see me. <laughs> now, he on the other hand is being seen by literally everyone. But not in there. Yes. I know you're crippled, but don't worry, we're working on it. We're working on it, alright? Mm, there's another safe... But I could attempt it. I could attempt the lockpicks. <laughs> How good do you think he is at sneaking with his full plate ar- Okay. Stealth. Stealth. First- Face first in the dirt. Stealth, ladies and gentlemen, right there. So, how long do you think these guys are gonna be, um... Hanging out back here? We have a 15% chance of knocking one of them down, and a 18% chance of knocking down the other one. Clearly, their toughness is nothing compared to our skeletal toughness. I'm just waiting for them to potentially start moving somewhere, because yeah, 10 p.m. is when when slides out from most places. So I don't know if they are gonna leave as well and go to sleep. Um, I, I do hope so, so we can maybe take a look at whatever is in here. So we'll see soon. Safe, successful. Lovely, lovely. That's good to know. It's good to know. Some for a little bounty that we got. 10 p.m., they're still standing there. Ever watching the static guard. Thing is as well, if we were to try and beat him up, um, the alarm would be raised. And that would not go too well. Now what I can do, however, is break into these chests and see what is in there. Since it's too dark and it's obscured so they won't notice. Uh, splint. Book. Which can sell for a pretty penny. Ancient book. And save the game before the, the chest's gonna rat on me. As bone crime. Every country playing through has its own version of some crime, you see. It's everyone. Every single playing through. Get out, thief! Hey. Ribs. You think you can do me a solid? <laughs> Not in this town! Yeah, and there's everyone else coming in right now. 
Rips is panicking. Rips is panicking. Yeah, they're probably gonna kick me out. Most likely. Yeah, that's a shame. Yeah, yeah, they're beating him up. But not without being beat up themselves partially. You know? They, 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 they felt a bit of the pain, you know? Just a little. But, you know, they do outnumber us, sadly. Guy here is barely able to keep up with those moves. Going for his arms and whatnot, too. Stun locked! Yeah, I see they're, they're patching one another up. What about Bonton? You're just gonna leave Bonton in here? Perfect. They did not know the spine laying around on the floor. <laughs> They're fools! They did not even notice that spine was just like laying there. And then Bonton. No, you can you can go for that lock back there. Yes, according to plan, you see. Oh, oh, oh it's a economy standard lag and a bunch of repair p pits. Repair pits, yes. Kits that we could very much utilize. Okay, this one, this one. The fools, the absolute buffoons. Those foolish guards not even realizing that they forgot about half of the skeleton crew that we have. Like, literal skeleton crew. And the fools, the absolute idiots. And I'm even getting repaired. And here, while stealing from them. Right here. Now, we're not too successful doing that, but... We're getting there. And yeah, please don't lose your arm. Again. Kind of a pain to get those back. Oh. Oh, we got the... We got the safe open. Yeah, that's the good stuff. Oh, that's the good stuff, Rohi. I mean, yes, I will yoink those limbs. Matter of fact. Yes, the alarm has been raised. But what are they gonna do? Knock me out again? Huh? So, so, so what if they do? Right? So what? Steady arm, skeleton arm. Steady arm sounds better. We'll, we'll take that as well. Right? So it's now all, all nicely tucked into my backpack there. Um, and here, we're gonna take some of those repair kits. Um, because they're being nicely donated to us right now by Tag Hunter Incorporated. So so we don't have to worry about getting hit too much in the future anymore. Yeah. We could even get a big backpack. Currently it's 95, 85, 85, which you know just gonna reduce your dodge and stealth quite a bit. But it's gonna keep the combat effect. It's, it's ninety percent effectiveness actually. We'll take one of those. No, no, don't get involved. Don't get involved. Absolute fools! No, they they did go back for bone ten. But still, absolute flatheads that they are. They do not realize that Spine is still at it. <laughs> they do not. They, they're literally in the same room as he is. And they do not realize. And those dummies. How can one be so stupid to not realize that a chest is still being lockpicked? For, for, for quite some time, actually. Like, it's just been at it for a, for a while now. Still, they're, they're not realizing, though. Hey, at this point, he has like a 10% chance to actually succeed with it. 
And as you can tell, they, they didn't even bother removing my, my items there. Uh, let's let's do some casual trading here. Hey, okay. every not a repair kit. It's on the house. Quite literally, it is on the house. Oh, the sound of success, yeah. Ah, uh, yes, the better repair kits. How about you get one of them, Lex? Installed right here. Alarm raised. I mean, it's okay. It's okay. Actually, it's not okay. It's just not really that good at stealing and thievery. So what we're gonna do is we'll, we'll drop off some of the skeletal limbs on this guy. So we can actually carry some more again. And it's just gonna be a little less painful if, if we try with this guy because he actually has training in stealing. He's a, he's a trained thief by now. Come on. Like what? It's not like they're gonna increase the bounty. I paid for this room, sir, and I'd like to kindly continue keeping it. No room for the item? Arrange. Let's make some room. Yeah, yeah, the alarm's being raised. I mean, it, it absolutely does suck, right? Terrible, terrible those things. But... But if I get knocked out, I'll get knocked out happy. I'm happy to be knocked out like this here, you know? I can go down with a smile. You see? And that's what I'll do while, while Rip's back here standing on top of the safe. Fucking mad lad, am I right? He was getting his toughness up again, you know? It's gonna be reaching 60 soon. Also getting the absolute shit kicked out of him. Oh look, 60. 63 defense, 40 attack. Yeah, it's getting there, it's getting there. <laughs> but those absolute bimbos don't even realize what I'm up to. Truly! Yes. Lay down in the bed again. I mean, what are they gonna do? They're just gonna kick me out of the room again, you know? You, you absolute flamingos, you. Yes. Clueless. Absolutely clueless. And I can just go back and repair again. <laughs> you know? I'll, I'll be actually just fine. I am gonna be absolutely okay. You see? See, I, I, I get free toughness training in here. And get to repair in here. <laughs> you know? It's perfect. <laughs> Yeah, you know, we just leveled up our melee defense. That's getting there. Toughness also, you know. Easy, dude. Easy. Absolutely. And we also just got the mother load. What well added. So... I, I think that's GG's right there. I really think so. So, your limbs. Uh, we got you one skeleton leg. Do I think he has the better ones. No, he just has more skeleton legs for you. Well, and congratulations, you got yourself some better legs now. Though, we still were not able to find wherever that guy is keeping uh, his, um, his really good stuff. Oh, well, at least we can all walk now. Well, or partially bionic limbs. And that right. So, yeah, we cleared that safe out. ka -ching. We cleared that out. I mean, might have been something down here. Could have absolutely been that. Like, you know, the safe back here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's that's uh, that's a tough safe to... Why are we fighting? Why are we auto-saving? Why, why are we fighting? Why are we in a fight? Why are we fighting? Why are we currently in combat here? Why is the ninja girl getting involved? Okay, I, I kind of—I actually missed what we just did. Like, well, what is the crime we're being accused of right now? <laughs> I'm 
I'm genuinely a little lost on what we just did. But I'm sure it has a good reason. I'm, I'm sure it has a good reason. 100%. They wouldn't just attack me for no reason. You gotta think like this, right? If we're able to take them out to, st to skinny, maybe. Maybe we were too skinny, you're not wrong. Some of us are pretty skinny. Very skeletal. Man, Bonten's going hard at it. So hard, in fact, they need to, to send reinforcements against them. Because it's just, like, so unstoppable. Look, we even knocked one of them down. Skeletal racists. Yeah, I guess so, yeah. Well, they are getting their shit kicked in right now, so... Yeah. <laughs> Let me just unequip that. Right there. Samurai armor. Now, that's gonna come in actually pretty handy later. Later, I mean, actually, pretty soon. Yeah, Rips, sadly, is pretty lightly armored, you see. Like, he, he could be doing a little better there. Oh, Bone Tin's down. We lost Bone Tin. Hey, hey. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. Spine, hey. Spine. Go to this guy and, like, take their equipment and put it away. Sound good, right? 90, 25, 13, 21, this is better. It's actually, this, his is actually better. Now I'm gonna pretend. Okay, two against one. Surely. Ah, surely, spine now! Snap him! Again, I don't know what crime we're being accused of, but we will fight for our right to be free, skeleton undead. All right, now you boy, you're the last one, it seems. Yeah. You dare take down our beloved Bone Ten back there, who, who just stood up again? Spine, no! Bone Ten, just in time. I like nice repair kits. Well then, hmm, hmm. What a shame, it's actually pretty good, you know, it's, this sword is actually pretty, pretty juicy, you know. Can't, yeah, they, they can't catch a break because they keep getting broken. Look at this. Well, the very least what we can do is take their weapons away. That's like, the minimum that we are able to do here. Like, take, take their, take their weapons, you know, do all that stuff. Make him, make him, make him feel it, you know? Make him be very aware of, of whom's, whom's place this is. Wait, if I, if I change weapons like this and, and then, then throw that on the ground, can I not? Hold on, I, I heat that away so it's on the floor, so they're very unlikely to actually touch it. Yes, this is us being victorious here. Your your armor, I'm gonna put it gently back into your inventory so you don't have it on you. Poor spine. Poor misunderstood spine. Uh, same story here. Just take his armor and just like put it somewhere else. Where he'll be completely and utterly confused about where, where it might have gone off to. I don't know what I just did, but I don't see the shirt, so I'm happy. <laughs> you absolute Bethoons. Oh, actually, the armored hood might be pretty good, actually. 21, 45, 70. 21, 45, 80. It's not that good, actually. <laughs> Skeleton pranks are going wild. You know it. You know we're going wild. We're going as wild as we need to. Those skeletal badges up here, we claim them in the Rattler's name. This is our crib now. This is our place, you see. Mm-hmm. Now, yeah, they're all unconscious, but none of them are dying. 
per se. Like, yeah, some are, some are doing worse than others. And I still pay rent, so... Can't say I'm a criminal. Ig ignoring the bounty that I have to this. But tech hunters may not like us after we're done here, okay? <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. They may not actually like us too much once we're done. There you go, buddy. Yeah. No, like, go, go, go for a bit of a walk with your new legs. How about it? And you can... You can hop in, there you go. What a unit bone in us, though. He is not to be trifled with. How about we check if they uh, resupplied in the time we were gone? Well, maybe level up your lockpicking, too. We're just gonna be laying here in stasis. Okay. Oh, he just managed to open it. You work on that safe, yeah? Hey, stealth leg prototype! Meaning it's pretty bad, actually. <laughs> but still, hey, you stealth leg. Look, I'm gonna be honest. And I'm just gonna say we're not actually gonna be using a lot of these here. So I'm just gonna put them on the ground. Uh, they, they have little value to me. But you know what has value to me? Repair kits. Repair kits have value. Oh look, the guards are st stationed here again. Everyone point and laugh at this loser. <laughs> you got some freakishly long limbs, by the way. Holy fuck. Damn. You better hold yourself in that hand. And just dead bats littering the floor there. Like I like how those guards on the outside and they're absolutely clueless to what we're actually doing in here like they have not the slightest clue on what even is going on standard steady arm what do you have again you have the uh, thieves arm masterwork edition yeah that's pretty good now yeah i would always appreciate being able to um get some monetary value out of this but a fencing ch uh, chance here is gonna be rather low you see since we're gonna be um, selling back to the guy we literally just stole from. Dude, so many repair kits. <laughs> it's so many. I mean, yeah, I'd like them. Alarm raised. You say like I should be caring. But I'm pretty sure I don't have to care. Also, we have big backpack. We, we, we do have big backpack. Oh man, for a moment I was hoping I could actually um uh do do a wacky and put a filled backpack into the backpack to have to create like a mini black hole in there. Now that would have been fun. That would have been pod racing. Alright, let's let's move all the repairs down here. <laughs> there we go. I'll just move that down, move move the bugs down, you know, you know how it is, you know how it is. You know, you know the rules. Uh, c c can I not, like, quickly move them in? Well, not while the thing on the side there is open. Okay, skeleton repair kits. I'd like to think we got a few skeleton repair kits. I'd like to think so. Yes. Gif. Sustain me. I want to be able to do some field medicine. And damn it, I will be doing some of that field medicine, right? We, we're gonna be quite the roboticists by the time we're done here. And I'm, I'm low-key kind of hoping that even though the the vault downstairs is god damn it just give me that one piece all right <laughs> it's like a coin toss and i keep failing it i keep saying hats and there's always tails there we go no no finally we got head okay the one person just got beat up so it's like we're taking the fight downstairs and beat up this one yep 
You don't understand, do you? This is the bone zone. Officially now. We own this place, you gotta realize. Economy leg, backpack, a arm, like a really, really bad one. Take Hunter's map. Still no shot. Can't do that. I got some reach, dude. I got quite some reach. Yeah, heavy, moderate, heavy. You know that that is that is fair. Yeah, this is the place where the skeletons dwell now. You understand that flashbacks? What the fuck? Are you? Who the? Jesus, come down, Sonic. Who are you? Are you hostile? Are are you trying to pick a fight here? Yeah, this is a bad message right there, by the way. Putting that out. That's not good. But. But. But you must understand. We have all the repair kits in the land. You must realize that. Stealing chance 100% now. That's good. Get rid of the pants. Well, that's good. <laughs> um, you know what's not good though? Uh, again, the the, the whole uh, tag hunters are low key hostile now. Just a little. You know, it is it's, it's kind of not good, yeah, man. Because yeah, while well, well, we can wipe the floor with the guys in here, the gate guards are gonna be a little tough. And by a little, I mean a lot. So yeah, there, there's always the chance we can sneak past them while they're currently distracted with some... Something. Don't even know what exactly, but something. Uh, if we were in the bed, healing up. This isn't mine. When? Since when do you care? If this is yours or not. It's because they're hostile, I'm telling you. We can't use the bed no, no more. Okay, our skeleton buddies got themselves into quite a bit of a situation. One that warrants a safe on bone crime. Yeah, because, you know, it's, it's one thing. Uh, stealing from them having a sizable bounty. It's another thing if the gate is being guarded by... One, two, three, four, five guys with decent stats, especially this one. Yeah, Yag longer here. He actually knows how to wield that weapon. The rest is pretty capable too. But in a 1v1 we can take him. That's the thing if it's gonna be an actual 1v1. Which I doubt. And you know, there's the occasional person on, on the on the cross poster, so... You know, we're gonna like, hang out until it's night time again. You know? Can like beat up those guys repeatedly? Alarm raised. Gonna be a problem. I hope not. Hey, dudes. Down here, yeah? This naked man's not gonna be able to do too much. But this guy here, he has a, he has a chop. The scowl rather. Well, just, just, just f wrap up with this guy. Come on, put Sonic down. Put him down. There you go. Yeah, yeah. And on, on this little battle here. Where we hopefully are gonna be bullying this one. Yeah, I mean. Oh, it's Gurgle again. I remember you, Gurgle. I remember you quite well, actually. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you, you're what we call kind of annoying, um, you know? Yeah, yeah, that's, that's what you are. Annoying. And actually kind of kicking our asses right now. Hey, can we close this door real quick so no one comes? No one gets in here? Tries to mess with us? Well, uh, we're kind of busy here. 
Yeah, I mean... Oh. I, I guess my guy kind of managed to glitch outside there. Yeah, punch, punch him back inside of the building, yeah? Fight him back in here. Yeah, it's usually when they get the, um, the AoEs in. Which can be pretty bad for us. Ouch. Yeah, this, this, this is like entering dangerous territory here. Okay, let's just casually walk back inside. <laughs> yeah, I mean, again, again, sol solid damage we're dealing here. This right leg is not doing too well either. Uh, that's what I was hoping would not happen. Getting, getting Shaku is back up too. Mm -mm. That's not good, man. Oh god, and another one. At least we were able to cripple their arm. You know? At the very least, we did that. And how we crippled their arm, and how we did. That arm's gonna be crippled for a while now. Yeah, the real problem, though, is gonna be like. Uh, we can't use the bat anymore. So, yep, yeah, that's gonna be gonna be not pleasant. Look pretty bad. Oh yeah, that's the bad guy himself. I was gonna heal her a little. And then they're kindly gonna move away. Unconscious, unconscious, but... Very hurt. Oh, he's taking them out. Okay, maybe, maybe we move inside now. Maybe we go in. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't, don't, don't be dumb, don't be dumb. Guys, don't be dumb. Be smart. Be skeleton. Be bones. Yeah, I, th I think that's gonna go poorly here. They get lung rot in here. <laughs> Yeah, there's a two-on-one. Again, capable two-on-one here. So if we were to just kind of hang out... Yeah, we're not gonna die, but we're just gonna be hanging out for a while now. Yet again. At least we have this house for ourselves, you know? But it really is gonna be like... How do we get out? That one has currently... Some, some broken limbs. Where are you moving? Why are you going outside? You don't need to wonder why you get your asses kicked if you just move outside like you just did. Oh yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's the people. Hey, how about we repair ourselves real quick? Hey guys. So, uh... Like all that fun, yeah? <laughs> yeah, I mean, you guys already hate us anyways, right? So, might, might as well, right? Might as well finish, uh, wrap up a few loose ends here. Alarm raised? Not in this town, they say. Yeah, they're like the guys that are easily bullied. <laughs> And then there's the guys who are not easily bullied. That's the ones that suck. Alright, let's let's rearrange their armor so they can absolutely not wear it for reasons. Like they they, they don't look into their backpacks, type of reason. Yes, this will be negatively affected. Yeah. Yeah, attack is pretty low in here. Comparatively. Shame we can't really use the bat now. Like, that'd be... That'd be amazing if we could. Like, it's so silly, right? Like, I do not own this. Yeah, I mean, at this point, you're hostile with them. You, you, you might as well, right? You, you might as well just hop in. You know? But yeah, it's, um... Factions, uh... Yeah, the tie counters are up there. With not liking us. They're up there. 
Now again, you see, the Scallies got themselves in quite a situation here. You know? Gray Self? I don't know about Gray Self. But maybe? Maybe we're gonna go to Gray Self first? I don't know if I can go to Stobes Gamble right away. Because the thing is, right? No matter where we go, we're gonna be fairly hurt. Since there's only one way in and out, then <laughs> no boy. It's gonna be a rough one. Yeah, there's the source like that, dude. Back there. Which is kind of like speed running the whole place here. Yeah. Hey, hey. hey, do you think we're welcome in the in the bar? Do you think they're gonna be cool? There's something powerful in the Ashlands. Uh, no, you know, judging by the fact that they're all glowing red, I may not be as welcome here. Now let's move out again. <laughs> now was it worth it? No, that's that's the real question. Was it worth it? No. <laughs> and like, okay, buddy, I'm, I'm gonna have to pack you up. You're you're a little too slow there on your little ten feet. It's the guy who likes to speed run around the whole place. I don't know what the hell he is doing. He's a little panicked. I don't know what he is doing. Uh, it seems like it seems like they noticed. We're just gonna be our moment where we're just gonna like try and run out of here while actively being shot, mind you. But you know, the, the the farther we make it, the less likely it is we have to deal with them again, right? In terms of aggro range. Now down goes ribs. Uh, spine spines a powerful warrior. Was able to walk quite the distance, you see. And it's gonna be definitely outside of the aggro range there. Ironically, right next to some ribs. Auto saving, thank you for that game. Thank you for all the auto save. Might as well get some melee defense out of this here. Good old long rod. Oof, they hit him pretty hard on the head. Poor guy. Oh well, look, it's Gurgle, huh? If it ain't Gurgle again. Yep. Yeah. Down we go. Over here, this ends now. I mean, yeah, it's not going too well. Oh boy. Move up, move up, move up. And then quickly, yeah? Be fast about it. Hurry. Bonten is buying you all the time that you need. So you can move out. Out of the way and save them both, yeah? So first repair yourself. It works like a charm. They've been like beating up this one ninja guard. Or trying to. Before everyone else showed up again. You see, he was actually doing pretty well. No, his leg is gone. No. Not another one. It's okay. It's okay. We'll just have our one guy there patch himself up. Maybe, maybe Spine's gonna dare patch himself up too. Like all the way back here. Wait, let's do a little loop around, yeah? Okay, Bonten, I, I know. I know how this looks. I know how this looks. But, uh... Not like our guys don't have some spare limbs here. And just wait. It's, it's all gonna be the wrong limb. Just you wait. That is what's gonna happen. Like we're, we're gonna be like, oh yeah, you know, this is, uh, it's whatever. We, we, we just stole a bunch, right? And that, that's when we realize, oh yeah, well, we did steal a bunch, but we didn't steal the proper one. You know, the, the correct one. 
So, uh, you, you're, you're the guy with uh, absolutely no limbs right now. That's concerning. <laughs> oh no, we only have Norm. Oh no. Well, shit. You can't have that now. <laughs> I'm probably gonna do a little reload there. Where, where was the auto save? Yeah, uh, I'd rather, uh, rather not have him uh, lose his feet like that. Because foot is already sitting at a uh, half T zero here. Yeah, you just you just walk away a little further, yeah. I know, I know, I know. It's terrible to be beat up like that. Bone ten, honestly, don't even fuck with me. Okay, bone ten, defend yourself, <laughs> and don't have your uh, you know leg exploded, please. And Rips just moves away. Don't have... Don't, de, don't do the lag. Don't do the lag. Okay, they did not do the lag. He still has both of them. In some bad condition, but they have both of them. And they threw him against a cactus. That's good. That's excellent. Well, he is in a bit of a critical state here. But nothing he can't fix himself. Hey buddy, come on. Gotta patch yourself up. Who the fuck? A ninja guard right now, really? Fuck's sake, dude. At least hit him anywhere but in the leg, okay? No, oh, no, here's, here's a really tough one. Hey, you know what? Repair yourself. In the meantime, it'll, it'll be quite a doozy. <laughs> it'll, it'll be a doozy. My fucking random ass ninja guard is just popping in and just being uh, spooky. A little jump scare, some may even call him. <laughs> Alrighty. Now, this should be okay. Let's just sneak to make sure this is gonna be okay. Um, and do equip their armor just to just respect them a little further. Okay, let's repair him. Repair the boy. So he doesn't go down. He'll be fine too, that's good. You you, you go repair yourself too. And you, you also go repair him. If you can get there in time. So we made it out of the town. At the very least. At the very least, we made it out. Now we just need to fix our lads here. And be back on the way. There we go. That's lovely, lovely. Alrighty, see? It's, it's not too bad. His chest is a little permanently damaged. His leg is a little permanently damaged. And his chest. But, um... Yeah, 8 points of wear damage to track through max health. And can be fixed as a skeletal band. Yeah, 10 points right there. Yeah, he got he got messed up. He got messed up in the lag there. So um let me check something, yeah. Um Let's see. Where is Black Desert City? It is in the Badlands. Mm-hmm. Lovely. Lovely good old Badlands. The Deadlands, for comparison, are Ashlands, those lands, Bonefields lands, Sun, Stopes Gamble, Stopes Garden, Crags, Pits, Pits East, Outlands, the Unwanted Zone, because no one actually wants to work on that one, Unnamed Area, wait, no, Storm Gap Coast is what that is. Forbidden Isle. Gut. Because of all the... Uh, things that can gut you in there. Where the hell are the Deadlands? You mean Grey Self? Do you, do, do you maybe mean Grey Self there, buddy? Is Grey Self what you mean? Maybe? I don't... I don't... I don't... Oh, Deadlands! There it is. And the Black Desert. Right there. 
Well, we'd need to go through vents to go to the Deadlands. So suppose let's let's get to it. Man, you gotta love that Spine is the one who actually moves the fastest now. You know? After all of this uh, uh, stuff, right? He is the one who's the speediest. Arguably the speediest. Hey, Spine. Hey, Spine. Mind, mind maybe taking a bit of the weight from us? You know, just, just like a little. We're gonna put you down, you know, in terms of weight. Like, like they're both heavy slash moderate. Yeah, they're both heavy. Yeah, take take the take the tiny backpack with you. Take the uh the books. You know, put them in here. I don't know, maybe maybe the occasional repair kit. See the thing is, spine worked out, you know? Spine spine is no doozy, no stranger to uh having equipped a bunch of items. Oh yeah, maybe maybe you can talk to Rips a little. Rips may have a few things too. Like the arm. Now we're heavy too. Good. Now we're all heavy. Should be about the same speed in this case. Now, we're gonna be doing the most lovely thing about of uh, going through vents. Autosave. Let's save over the autosave. So we at least have this here. So, so we're gonna be going through vents. That's gonna be quite something. Um, I mean, they are slowly healing up again, right? It's not like they're not. Eh, we may, we may actually be fine. We may actually be just fine. Looking at this, like, his, his lag is ordering 30. Yeah, I think we're fine. We actually don't need to go to the Black Desert. Online. I like Leviathans. Just, just a Leviathan hanging out in there. Where's the best Kanshi region for settlement? I mean, I personally, again, I'm, I'm a big simp for the Leviathan Coast. I'm very happy with Leviathan Coast, honestly. No one's gonna bother you up here. Except for some big-ass Leviathans. There's also a mod that adds more towns, so there's actually a town you can trade with then. Otherwise, it is actually the Void. Islands themselves can be pretty wacky too, because your enemy has to approach you from the water, so you can just snipe them with towers. Um... Yeah, I mean, that, that's that's some good ones. There's probably some other decent regions, but like if you're anywhere near here, you have to deal with Prayer Day. If you're here, you need to deal with taxes. If you're here, you need to deal with taxes and maybe Prayer Day. To make Kanshi essentially like Banner Lord. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's not too far from it, like really. Like, Kanshi can be either a game where you have a group of people that you kind of like adventure around with, which is what I like more. Or you turn Kanshi into basically a um, city builder, which is the part I'm, I'm not the fondest of. It's, it's not, it's not necessarily, like, I like it, don't get me wrong, I like it, it's cool. But I, I'd rather adventure, you know, I'd rather adventure around the area and just like beat up people and get loot. City builder. Yeah, I mean, it definitely has some appeal, don't get me wrong. And I'm, I am going to be doing some city building in my proper playthrough. And we're just going to be more about the Foglands, as I want to do more in that place. Instead of just traveling through and being like, yo, spooky, spooky cannibal hive or zombies, you know? And with that said, it's not recommended you actually live there, but, you know. It's a thing, it's a thing. Alright guys, really getting close now. Ribs. You might wanna unload a... Why is this song so loud? No matter what, it's always really, really loud. Ah, a ash storm. Truly. Rather a tornado. My ears are gone. I... Uh, the funny thing is, I keep turning down the music. Like, some songs 
are just really loud. Like this one. And some other songs I barely hear. And they kind of slap, you know? I know, you know, that, that might just explain why I had the music turned off when I reinstalled Kanshi. Because I played my own uh, stuff. Oh, look, it's the acid pits of Stubbs Campbell. <laughs> yeah, man. And again, if you want to have some new limbs, sit in there and uh, just just wait a little. You'll feel the burn. Secret drug farm. Yo? Yeah, that is a drug farm and that is pretty secret, all right? Well, let's move around. Again, it's it's more of a Halloween, um, Halloweeny type of um, mod list I feel right now, right? It's the, oh, oh, it's sneaking. Yeah, that may do it. That may explain why I was so fucking slow. Yeah, yeah, I was stealthing. That's why. <laughs> uh, do I actually bother with a drug farm, or do I go into the funny green water? <laughs> Out of the funny green. Yes. Okay, now now it's spine. Now not spine again. Who's the slowest here? Oh man, I I could talk to the skin people too. You know the guys, the man, the, the myths, the legends. I want to skin everyone. The the people that are totally humans, by the way, hundred percent human. Absolutely human, mind you. Okay, Bonten. We need to do trading. Get this back ass sword off of me. And maybe this too. Because I'd like my guy here to, to not be heavy. Preferably I'd like to have him on like... Why are you still heavy? Oh, no, no, it's, it's heavy because of... Mm, my bad. You can take those back. Heavy because of the heavy armor, I imagine. Not not because of what he's carrying. Like, see, he's, he's speedy now. He is pretty speedy. See? That's good. Yeah, by the way, this is acid. Let me demonstrate you by putting my ribs inside of the acid. We're not gonna be too happy of it. Maybe they actually don't mind too much because they're also um, skeletons. They really don't lose too much health, if any at all. Yeah, so if you want to level up toughness in a really cheap way, take an acid bath. Uh, that, that's arguably the easiest way you'll ever be able to level up your toughness. Go into acid. Minimum risk for um, well, small but still pretty solid rewards actually in terms of your toughness overall. So if you do want to get your toughness up, <laughs> acid bath, man, acid bath. It's the way, man, I'm telling you, it's crazy. Yeah, so again, it's pretty volcanic here. And if you are a, uh, f you know, guy who wears flesh, you're gonna not have the best time here, as you may be able to imagine. So... You know, acid, volcanic ash, crabs. You got fucking crabs. Crabs. Life eggs? Yeah, I mean, you need a mask. You need a mask for that stuff. But, like, here's the thing. If you're a skeleton or robot, in this case, you, um, you really don't need to deal with a lot of BS. Right? You can get laser blasted from the sky that you saw in Virtue. You can, you can get, like, um... Acidify, not care. You can breathe ash and get ash lung and not care because you are a robot. Um, you know, a lot of a lot of shit that's hostile down here, like in the sonorous dark, there's like guys who like to peel potatoes. And um, except for you are the potato. Uh, you know, they, they, they're, they're going to be chill with you because you're a robot. There's not much skin to be um, peeled. You know? Um, yeah, it's, it's that stuff. Stuff like that, really. Uh, it's, it's pretty chill down here. It's pretty chill. I'm gonna lie. See, like this guy, Spine, is just going through the acid right now. Also, I think over here, if I'm not mistaken, there's a pretty big bad... Yeah, there's, there's a boss. 
called uh, King Gorillo. With some, you know, some some items here and there, you know, but but nothing nothing too crazy. Some good katanas, but um, yeah, it's it's uh, for the thrill. If you want to kill them, you can do it. Like there's a lot of tough enemies you can try and take care of, and see how you do against them. Like there, there there's some absolutely busted bosses too, like one here. And the Ashlands, absolutely bonkers. So if you really want to try your cunning, you can go and do it there. Now I'm pretty sure they should be a town somewhere around here. Unless the intel is wrong, which I don't think it is. Just wait, it was actually Stokes Garden where I needed to go. It was there all along. It was the bone fields actually. The bone fields is the place I needed to go to. No, not, not, not this place. And then, uh, it should be right down the road. Should be right down the road. Can't miss it. I'm pretty sure at least. Now you, you discover this big old thing, a outpost of someone, like right there. The, 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 the thing, the things I'm looking for should be, should be around like right here, shouldn't it? Should be like right here, if I'm not mistaken. Holy fuck, dude. That music sometimes, man. Yeah, it's really loud, man. It's really, it's really getting to me. Are we heavy again? How about we just drop this one? There you go. Just gonna, like leave the backpack down there. Discover the camp, but that's all the way in the cracks. Hmm. Yeah, I'll be honest, it might be in the wrong place. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna be pretty honest here. I think that ain't it, Chief. If we go down further towards Sniper Valley, just don't go into Sniper Valley itself, and you'll be okay. Um. Pretty sure you can guess why you don't want to be in Sniper Valley. It's pretty on the nose, actually. Ruin? Is it D Ruin? Is it the place? Perhaps? Game, I know you're trying to load it, but I I I I wanna I wanna go there. No, game. I very much would like to. We have here escaped slaves. Not so. Holy fuck, what the hell are those slaves even doing here? Where, where are you escaping to? This is... This is a pretty bad place to be in. Clearly. Yeah, Chief, uh, I, I don't think that it... I don't think that's the one. Uh-huh. Right, well, that's... Expedition 5. That's the rune? This is D Expedition 5? Oh my god. Yeah, like that's the stuff you want to do as a tag hunter. You want to go and grab those books and electrical components like AI cores and stuff like that. That's, that's what you want to be doing as the tag hunter. That's the tag hunter lifestyle. Um, I'm gonna be honest though. I'm a little lost. I'm a little, little, little lost. Uh, let's see. Let's let's do a quick save, yeah. Don't let auto save one. All right. Now let's do a new game, <laughs> okay? Uh, because there's one. Where's the um? The bone start, right? Oh, it's a bright screen all of the sudden. Jeez. All right, right. We're gonna use this as navigational aid. Right. There's a place I want to go to, and this here starts like right next to it, basically. And I, I'd like, I'd like to see how lost I am. If if I really walk the wrong way for longer than I'd like to admit, then then that'd be a little awkward. So surely, surely this can't be that bad. Confirm. Yes. 
No, it's just a little further down. No, just a little further down the road, guys. It's fine. Just a little further down. Yeah, we're basically actually there. So, so I'm not actually that wrong. Yeah, Expedition 5 was actually, like, right next to them, too. Whew. All right. Yeah, yeah. That's like a little cheat sheet I just used there. So we were the right place after. And th there I was, like, starting to doubt myself, you see? Like, genuinely. <laughs> I was like, mm, uh, I don't remember it being this dark. You're like, yeah, it's nighttime, but still. <laughs> yeah, you know, you know, man? Uh, I remember it being a little more purple. Purple sand, you know? Like, and if you want to have a challenge in terms of city building... Um, Second Hound was one of the monsters said to dwell in the Forbidden Zone. Good. Like, what you want to be doing is go settle in the Ashlands. Like, that place is fucking rough. You won't have almost no natural resources. Like, you, you'll, you'll, be, you'll be very much on your own. And there. Uh, and very far from any trade. That's like, yes, I am settling in the... In the fucking Ashlands because I want to have Dunmer RP. Or something like that. You know, some, something masochistic like that. Yes. Ah. The ancient graveyard. We discovered it finally. I was looking forward to it. Oh, it's the Hivers again, though. The drone guard. Is it still the na- Is it gonna be the same prince? Is it gonna be the naked guy? If he is with them? Well, the Hivers are currently fighting these guys. And, well, if they come for us, then I guess so be it. So the world are built on shitty swamplands. This is a great tale to tell. Godspeed. <laughs> Godspeed, my man. There it is. In the most ancient of the graveyards, let a blaze by a beacon from far away. All this traveling here, our earthly remains to return to where we belong, the graveyard. Finally, we can, quite literally, rest in peace. Also, we're gonna gank the shit out of this hive prince. Like, on a side note, I'm gonna beat the ever-loving crap out of this Hive Prince. It seems like I'm not the only one. Plant is attacking him as well with his buddies. Man, that that Hive Prince really has not a good day right now. He he really is really not having a good time here. I'm not even hostile with those outlaws, apparently. But we're still kicking them around here and there. Occasionally. Well, we fucked him up. Good job. Tag teaming with outlaws. We did it. Now why we do it? I don't know. This just happened to be here. Um. I'll be taking that. Shirley. 24, 39, 90. Yeah, I'm gonna yoink your pants. You can have my pants. 32, 49, 90. 21, 45. Yeah, that's worse. Yeah, yeah. Get pranked, dude. Yeah. Those aren't even your pants now. You poor, poor, poor fucko. Okay, let's both start healing this guy. Yeah, otherwise we're good. I mean, yeah, we could always throw him into a vat of acid, but that's hardly gonna help now, is it? Right. Let's go home, shall we? Home at last. At long last. I'm gonna save as bone crime final act after a long journey our bony brethren made it to the ancient graveyard what are they gonna encounter in there truly what no one knows please tell me now I can tell you what there's gonna be more on that in there there's gonna be some undead here. And with some undead, I mean quite a few undead actually. 
Undead using undead weapons like stick made out of bone, but it's slightly pointy. And it's a lot of them too. Some of them even wielding shovels as a weapon of choice. And no, they are not friendly. And yes, we are very likely to get our shit kicked in by so many of them. That's why we wouldn't find all of them, right? Let's pick the lock carefully. One of us is bound to actually uh, get it. Yeah, tis our home, tis our home. With all the undead, as you can tell in here. Holy fuck, what is this thing? <laughs> Why is a black gorilla suddenly here? Um, alright. Well, I was just picking the lock. Suddenly a black gorilla appears. Actually, that might, that might work in our favor. You know, uh, that, that might be good. Um, move away. Don't fight a black gorilla. We're not the one fighting the black gorilla. They are fighting the black gorilla. Not us, but they are. Alright? Let all the undead fight the black gorilla while we fight the other undead. It's, it's, it's the fight of the necropolis right here. Life. Black gorilla, I, I believe in you. Yeah, they do some blood damage with their shovel surge they're kicking you with every now and then. Lots of bone boys everywhere. So, yeah, yeah, circle of life, another prank, yeah. It's like a black gorilla showing up out of nowhere. Ah, oh, fuck, yeah, they, they, they do, they do hit. And they do it hard. We, we, we also do some decent damage, but it's too many decent combatants. Like, they're not bad, they're not good, they're just aight. Like, we can definitely take them on, but they, it's a lot of them, right? Like, it's a lot of them right now. Yeah, they already crippled one of my arms here. It's down, it's only, it's only the spine remaining. And obviously the black gorilla. But even that one's kind of struggling. Look at the black gorilla just out of nowhere. Well. And they're just like mass repairing now. Everyone who may even be slightly hurt. And I know it looks weird. I know it looks weird. Don't worry, it's not. Think the black gorilla's gonna be fine? Uh, the thing is, right? There's barely anyone inside of the graveyard now. I mean, I guess these guys just ran in. But other than that, there's barely anyone inside. And, I mean, yeah, there's these guys too. But, hey, at least all those guys are not inside, right? So there's that saving grace. Fucking skeletons everywhere. Literal skeletons. Healing up to full. And now we wait. The good thing is, the gate has been opened. The gate is now open, meaning the skeletons are gonna be walking in and out. Instead of just like staying inside, like this fight, this right here. For all I know, this uh, land bed fighting Hugh from the vagrants might have as well been a skeleton. Like they're kind of heading towards Skeleton County right now. Yeah, like we're, we're no imminent danger right now. The worst thing we oh my, that's a lot of bats. Jeez, that's a lot of bats. Again, we, we won't stand up just yet. We'll, we'll wait. We'll wait a little for all those land bats to, to, to walk past and, and deal with some of the scallies, right? We, we, we can stand up right now and uh, go places, but let's, let's let them fight it out, yeah? With that, I mean, let's move. Now, there's one guy... There's one guy coming for us and then knocking us all out right away, kind of. Grown. The Bone King. So you're the man, huh? You're the guy who, who owns all the bones, yeah? Well, shit. 
I had him. I had him. I, I done did damage. He's rattling. He's rattling. Impossible. But I'm the one who rattles. What are you using? Arm bones? I mean, it's a weapon that is genuinely terrible. But, um, I want them to have it. You see? I don't even want him to have clothing, right? So I'm just gonna, like, float it. I'm gonna prank this guy. And if I, if, if I can make it a little easier for myself, I will. And s holy fuck, he hurts a lot. Poor Bonton. What's this backpack? Oh, yo, skulls and bones and stuff. Cool. <laughs> Very Halloweeny. And the bats, you know, all of that stuff. Who rattles the one who rattles? Oh, no, man, there's a lot of rattling in here, though. A lot of bats, too. At least he came out. You know, he, he showed himself. With his massive scythe. And his frankly kind of badass looking spiky armor. But you know, it's, it's not like he didn't get hurt. You know, he did take damage. He did take it. I guess we're rebooting. He... Still has his right arm. Oh, 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 the king doing. Oh, his head is quite damaged, too. The yeah, power of pranks is strong with this one. Yeah, I can't walk away just yet, however. Yeah, he doesn't have permanent damage, though. Like, he is gonna be healing that up pretty much instantly. I just hope that a lot of that can't be said for their companions, but sadly it can't be said for pretty much all the companions here. Yeah, it seems like they're about to be done. With the bats. And he... is the last one of its kind. Getting beat up with pointy bones and, and shovels every now and then. And then there's like one motherfucker with like a super pristine power saw. On, on, on top of a scythe. Yeah, your right arm, you know, it's, it's not looking the best, but hey, you'll get there, I'm sure. Oh no, did they kill the gorilla? No, he's just unconscious right now. Big guy's just out. Yeah, so, so what's, what's his deal? Is, is he not gonna go and heal himself? Or, uh, or what now? I know everyone else is healing one another. Oh, look, it's the naked guy. It's the guy I pranked. Look. It's like he's about to sing the anthem. What about you, Bone King? You're just gonna stare at the gorilla there? Better be careful. It's gonna spring back to life at any moment now. No! Don't heal him, you, you peasant! No! That damage should have stayed! Damn it! Hey, at least that was naked, you know? Oh, well, they just knocked him out right away. They gave him a menacing stare. Sucking at his toes. They can't even suck, that's the thing, right? That, that, that's the thing, right? They're incapable of it. They don't have lips. Or lungs. Or a tongue. Anything, really. Well, I mean, again, quite quite a fight back here, but I'm just gonna lay low. I'm just gonna lay low with my guys here. Until either night time, or, um... You know, they just kind of move further away from me. Standing there. Just standing there menacingly every now and then getting pissed at some land pants and just, like, observing them. What a man. I mean, 64 attack. Not that crazy, really. Like, we're, we're like, about that level, too. 50 toughness? Everyone here has more. Like, for the Bone King, it's not that crazy. It just has somewhat good gear and, like, people who keep touching his feet. You know? Aggressively touching his feet. Mind you. I guess it's simply that they have numbers, right? With like all 40-ish attack. Like around that category, I'd say. The hybrids are gonna be easier to deal with because they're like, you know, not armored. 
You know, those, those, those guys, you know. They, let's fast forward, yeah? See how that'll develop. We're just gonna, like, standing on there. Okay, the bone can got his toes fully sucked now. But uh, they, they, they can really do so many field repairs in the end, you see. And now... Now they're, um... Taking a walk. Oh. Oh, the gorilla. And taking a walk again. Yeah, them bats. Keeping them somewhat busy, but... The moment I stand up, they're all gonna swarm me and beat me up, right? So, um... Ain't much I can do right now. Just gonna lay low. Have, um... Have some of my limbs slightly healed. Or, or not. Like the head, for example. It's getting worse. Or is it? No, it's actually getting better. It's actually healing his head. Yeah, I just need to wait for the coast to be clear. Which may take a bit. And also, again, they, they only have so many medicinal supplies, right? Like, they, they can only prepare for so much. So surely, surely the War of Attrition is something we can win, right? <laughs> surely! Dude, they're running all the way off over here to fight yet another Black Gorilla. Man, those guys are nutty. Look at that. Look at that black gorilla speeding around. Eating all of those hivers. And yeah, dealing some permanent damage in the process too. The Bone King, you know, just kind of standing there menacingly. We have a few guys here to deal with, but um... You probably can't stand up. They're, they're already here to like beat me down. Yeah. It's a bit of a, a bit of a pickle. Another they're going back to group hugging. Don't camp, man! Stop camping! That's lame! Stop it! I wonder what they would be doing if I was a uh, an organic. Like what I can tell you right now is if you die you will end up in one of those graves, which I think is a pretty neat touch. Uh, you know, maybe not this one. But they're only playing that, you see? They're in the same boat as we are. However, they are gonna be starving. I'm not. I'm just gonna be chilling here. I'll be eventually fine. I'll be eventually fine, or... Who knows what'll happen. Look who came crawling back to Kanshi. I mean, not, not really. <laughs> not really. But, uh, yeah, how are you doing, Rift? How are you doing? Yeah, we're just doing the, the Halloween stream with our with our skeleton fellas here, which are actual skeletons, right? With uh, edgy as fuck scythes and and whatnot. And me just kinda waiting for, for the coast to be somewhat clearer. Like maybe now? Or maybe 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 now is good. So we can uh regroup, regroup. Regroup like somewhere back here. Yeah, yeah. Group hug one another. Yeah, yeah. Now, now you're getting it. But yeah, how you doing, man? Welcome, welcome. You're you're like in the uh, in the last act. We went from the Falklands all the way to Stokes Gamble to 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 go to a graveyard. Which frankly we did, since we are at the graveyard right now. You was there another batch of bats? So. Where is the Bone King? Yeah, as you can tell, there's a lot of them, and I don't have a lot of them. I have a few of them. A few of my guys. Like, if if I was to able... If I was to be able to see the Bone King here... And, and get him... While just out fighting the bats... As everyone else is busy out fighting the bats... I might, I might be able to just take him out. Which I definitely would be able to. This is happening on Star Wars 6. Got no goofy stories? I see, I see. Hmm, Bone King. Bone King. Hmm, alright, he's hanging out with his posse here. Hmm. 
He is going to hang out with these guys. Still a lot. It's still quite a lot. Everyone else is down there fighting them bats. It's like his personal cohort right now. Okay, walk a little faster maybe. Okay, I stop sneaking and I, I say, Alright! Okay, that's good, that's good. I can I can aggro him like this. And he'll 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 get closer and closer to me. He's all by himself, isolated. It's crackling, groaning, and rattling. But who is gonna rattle whom in the end of the day? Who's gonna have the last rattle today? I mean he already did quite a number on one of my guys. But we're doing a number on him as well. Yeah, he, he has a lot of damage there. A lot of output. I hope I can keep up, you know. At the very least, if we do fall here, uh, it's somewhere where we can easily heal up and then regroup. It's groaning and rattling, taking out ribs. Careful, spine! Careful! Spine! No! It's rattling, man. It's rattling. But we're about... Uh, bone tin! Rips, quickly! Spine can only hold him up for... Oh, no! Oh, well. At least he feels it in his leg. Oh, he's feeling it. It's not fair. He has a better weapon. Uh. <laughs> right. Well, let's start fixing ourselves up. Maybe that'll piss him off. Maybe it'll piss him off enough to, to come back. I could absolutely piss him off right now. I'd kind of like to be... All in terms of numbers. Let's not lose visuals on him, though. I kind of, I kind of want to keep him, keep him near me. You know, keep pranking this guy, like as if he'll be actually able to uh, outrun me. If I had someone who actually would be able to shoot, this guy would be done for. Nice try. <laughs> hey, nice try, buddy. Okay, just just both heal heal your one friend there. Spine. I said heal. Let ribs handle the kiting, okay? Let him handle it. We'll be the ones who will rattle the last rattle, okay? Don't worry about it. Ribs can handle it. Ribs was made to handle it. Now Ribs can also heal himself somewhat. Just a little. See, but, but that prevented him from healing as well. Mm hmm Hey, West Wishing, have a great spooky stream. Oh, we're about, we're about to, to get the spooks here, right? See, the rest of our gang is about to attack the Bone King. And now we're going in. Now we're gonna beat up his ass, for real. Unless he like hits all of us with like one fatal blow and like knocks us all down again. Yep. <laughs> yep, that, that's the stuff I'm on about. Careful spine. I mean, we're, 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 we got him. We got him. The bone king is down with his bone bag. And his scythe. Decent cutting damage. Uh, originally used to reap metro crops in a farm field. Uh, this scythe has been sharpened and honed for battle. And it's a me too. You know, unlike my itchyophobia. I like the itchyophobia one though. It's pretty cool, but that's it. That's just pretty cool. We're pretty good with heavy weapons. Pole arms, not so much. But you know who is good with pole arms? The spine. Spine is. 
And I think Spine would be a worthy successor to this. To this lovely weapon here. Uh, also, he needs to throw this down. He, need, he needs to throw in the Nagitana. Unless... Unless he wants to... Um, to move these out. He arrange them. Move these out further. Um, fucking... Trade. <laughs> Here. Joy. And then he'll wear the bone bag. The bone backpack. Oh yeah, also a specialist grade armor. Which I'm honest, I think this guy could use it. Most likely. Like he is not the sturdiest, you see. Here, get pranked, Bone King. Get, get fucking pranked, dude. Hell yeah. Alright, no, 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 don't give him that stuff. No, silly. Put it inside a bone backpack, right? That's why you have it in the end, right? Shrimp. Anything else we want from the... From the... Bone lad? Oh yeah, probably this, right? Um... 32, 49, 90, 33, 63. I mean, yeah, it's not even close, right? That's fine. You, you, you can have this clothing on you. Here, we, we'll even arrange it for you. Dude, look at this. Look at those little bones there. Now he is the one who's rebooting. Now he is the one to reboot. Slayer of the Bone King. Or soon to be, rather. We did it. We dealt with him. Bone King no more. And even then, when he wakes up, when he dares to wake up, his level 1 martial arts, what's he gonna be doing, right? Like, what is that guy gonna do? Gonna, like, push me? Or something? Uh, I don't think so. Dude, if only I could attack him. If only I could attack him while he's down, you know? Kick him while they're down. I should be able to kill him instead of having them just be like, Oh, yeah, you're playing dead. I don't know. Okay, let's have him walk away so he thinks we're gone. And then let's return and, like, beat him up. Just making sure, just making sure you're, you're actually uh, still laying on the ground. I know you're fine, but you're... S oh, wait, he's not fine, he's dying. He's actively dying, actually. Okay, well, there's some of his boys. Which we may just want to deal with here. Like, if, if we can get him one by one, that'd be absolutely lovely. But I doubt it. Like, once the fighting ensues, they're gonna be like, Huh, what's that? Dude, get, get destroyed. Get out of here, man. Get out of here, little hive or skeleton, man. See, that, that's how much one guy takes. Right there. Just one single dude. Getting his shit absolutely kicked in. And it's still just like, fine. How about four of them at once? Or five, rather. I, I'm i optimistic. I'm optimistic they can do. Like, again, they're, they're not the toughest fighters. They're capable, but not the toughest. And they're still a critical gorilla. Meandering about. I also like how, how they're probably not gonna question why we suddenly have the bone backpack with all the bones in there and the, and the Me Too scythe. You know? Come on, bone ten. Beat up the other hiver there. Show them true superiority. Yeah, mess them up, guys. Come on. Give them hell. Oh. My, my. Kick him water down. That's what I get for trying to to wake up. Alright, so rebooting had us pretty bad. Chest is pretty bad. Everything's really bad on them. Now we're gonna be the ones healing on top of them, you see? The tables have turned. 
Yes. And I'm just gonna make sure that they will not be able to offer any um, medical help to one another. Once they are to wake up. Also, how good is a shovel, really? <laughs> it's kind of decent, actually. For, for the fact that it's simply just a shovel, it ain't that bad. It really ain't. Now, what are these guys using? Lagbone? Get out of here. I, I think they might be just better off just, like, not using any weapon. I move to f killing this thing for sure. Yep. Yeah. No, I mean, they're they're dying. They're all dying, alright? Even if they're rebooting, they're, they're most likely gonna be dying. Like, this guy here as well, like, he is gonna be dying. See? Slowly. Systematically. Taking over the graveyard again. This one guy, with his little lag bone? Yeah, right. What is that? 22 damage, all of a sudden. Jesus. Okay, you take this one, you take this one, and uh, you take this one. Everyone has their one foe. Their one target. Yeah, we're, we're draining their numbers. Slowly, but surely. And, and being pretty tough. We're, we're, we're getting up there. Really are. And no healing for you. Absolutely none. Seeing them get healed is the last thing I want to see. Yep. That's mine now. You you go check this one out. See if you deny them their heals. You deny them their, their unlife. Okay. Now we are being... See, now, now, now we are the ones on the offensive here. You know? Right arm absolutely fucked. Stomach fucked. Chest done for. Chest also done for. We'll wait a little bit. And we'll, we'll run a few circles here and there. Will we regenerate just a tad? Just a little. We'll regenerate what matters, you know? I think there's... Uh and one here that's left. They probably all packed up and left now. And most likely are just hanging out back here. Or died. You know, just outright died. It's one or the other. But like the guys who are just sitting here on the outside. Like we can easily pick them off. Did you... Uh, that hubris. Uh, that hubris of this guy. He really thought he could do something there. Bring change, perhaps. But he doesn't realize who he's up against. <laughs> Guy with sword. Hey, behind you, by the way. Uh, dude with shovel. Trying to cave your skull in. Look, it's, um... It's more healing that they just brought to us. Now stab it in the spine! I want to see his bone marrow everywhere. Yeah, slowly but steadily. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there's another one. Why don't you take care of him? Oh, another one, another one. Yeah, I'll be taking that down. Uh, just real quick. This guy with his little spiky bone there. You know, thinking his tough shit. Which, frankly, he is not. He is still doing some rather damaging attacks. There we go. Come on, one more hit. Impale him. Do the finisher. Do the finisher. Come on. Oh. And there's another one. Just coming out. They're just slowly but surely leaking uh, out of that place, you know. They're slowly growing in numbers here. 
Like one, one notices like a bit of uh, a bit of a ruckus on the outside, or like hmm, wonder what that is. They go to investigate, and then they see us fighting, and then Hanson repeat. Oh no 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 don't 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 don't, don't go and fight. Just this one. Okay, th those those few guys now. All right, and you got them, I'm sure. Deny them their heals. As we keep going. Yeah, some of them are standing up again. We're like awfully close to the uh, to the hot spot too now. And we are rather dented. We might go down here. We may. We may. Just me. But we also may just not. Since they're hurt. And we're, we're stronger than them. By a good bit. One of us is like worth uh, three of them at least. And, and, and then some. What is this climactic fight up through this one guy with a shovel? You see how they... Oh, look, it's that one guy, remember? That one dude? <laughs> who, we, who we absolutely pranked epically? Can I loot him? Ninja loot, ninja loot. There we go. Again, deny them their healing. Alright. You're, you're doing pretty good. You're deny healing. There you go. So again, even if we were to go down, right? Hypothetically. They, they have far less resources to recover. From all of this. But again, we're, we're doing pretty solid. Yeah, like, he, he got this guy most likely on lockdown. Oh. Again, I, I'm the one who rattles. Not you guys. This is my graveyard. And I'll be filling it with you. Not the other way around. Rattle? Exactly, he's being rattled. You know it. You know he is. Gimme. Okay, guys. Let's heal up real quick. Rattle, you say? Exactly, rattle me bones. How you doing? Just in time for some rattling. Because we're a bunch of bones here. A bunch of skeletons fighting other skeletons. Outside of a graveyard. We, we did take out our leader as well, earlier. Who does this guy think he is? You know, so, so we're just taking care of the uh, the remains right now. Because that massive Me Too scythe, that was, that was part of their um, Bone King, who now is most likely very dead. Didn't have anything. Okay, guys, back down, back down. It do be a spooky time, yeah. Spooky old time right now. What better way to do it than to do it with Kenshi? Incinerating. Uh, they just threw a, a corpse inside of the um, of the tombs, the tombstones there. The final rest. How many do we have? Still a good bunch. But we also went through a good bunch ourselves. And they are most likely all dying now. Once we were done with them. What are those stats like? He is really getting up there. He's really good at defending, but not as good at attacking. Strength's gonna eat. Toughness is pretty good. Okay, let's go down here. Loop around there. See if there's any of them. Again, this is my graveyard. <laughs> you must understand. This is my tomb. Just to make it clear. Yeah, like it's it's our it's our three guys here that, that kinda walked around the uh, entirety of the Foglands up until they arrived here in Soap Scamble. We are now like beating up a bunch of these lands. 
Oh look, someone... Someone back there made it back up. Hi, my. Carrying one of their friends who may be just a corpse at this point. Because that's what they do a lot. They just like bury their own, incinerating them in a way. All of those are technically incinerators, all those graves. Come on, boys. There's nothing we can't handle now, is it? Just fucking, uh. Yoink. Let's merge them, right? Let's, let's do some mergers. Do you have some? No, you had some, though. You can merge. So let's do that so we can have some more room. Again, like, the big thing is we, we deny their, their healing. So if we do go down, which is unlikely at this point, we... We won't have to see them heal, right? Like, they're, they're not gonna be doing that. Okay, guys, you're doing good, you're doing good. That, no, don't don't go in there. Don't go in there yet. No, 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 no. We don't wanna have, we don't wanna have to deal with them. Of these guys there. Yeah, yeah, you, you do that, you do that. Must be some reinforcements from where the bats died. Mm-hmm. I see. But how are you doing, man? Welcome to the Kenshi's. Rattle! As he lost his arm? Rattle as he dies? I like how they're pouring out one by one. Like, at this point, whatever's left in there, we can just probably take on. Like, this is arguably equally as many of them. And again, we're just getting stronger, you know, by the kill. Knowing how to defend proper and attack at the same time. Now we're thinking with bone marrow. Oh yeah, we also absolutely pissed off the tag hunters, by the way, by like, killing some of them and like, um... And, and doing all of that stuff. Wait! The Bone King lives? But he's far from his former glory and he, he does only have one martial art. So, um... I'm surprised he made it, actually. Yeah, he actually, he actually lived. As you can tell, I already uh, took a lot of his equipment, but... There he is. The last I saw him, he was dying. I left him for dead. It's just like an anime, you know, where, like, the villain, you know, you leave him to die, maybe. And then he comes back later on. And you're like, what? But I thought you died long ago. With that said, he is getting his ass kicked right now. So, you know. Even if he lives, he's probably not gonna live for too long there. It's back to being critical. Should have, should have double tapped. If only you could do that in Kenshi. If only you could. Oh, down he goes. Down he goes. Yeah, you know. Quite, quite the surprise there. And that's me making sure they're not gonna get any heals up. Double tap that one on the floor. Make sure you won't get anywhere. Uh, I'll yonk that. Want them to have it. Yeah, we, we didn't go down one time. Uh, since we were, like, fighting all of these dudes. I like how it just blocks, like, casually. Like, yeah, right, you're not gonna hit me. How is this guy still alive? There we go. Finally, he took the L. Oh. It's, uh... It's a fleshy. A fleshy known as Plank. What are you doing in the bone zone, buddy? You gotta understand, it's not only damn bones here, it's also us. Who are not really pleased by a fleshy. This is our tomb. Our tomb alone. Get double scythed. Yeah, how is he still kicking? How's this guy doing? How is he doing it? 
You would not dare to. My, my. The fleshies. They, they, they want, they want to go, man. The fleshies want it. Come into my place that I rightfully conquered by trial to, uh, to the death as undead do. Them fleshies, you know, they, they, they really think they're, they're, it's all about them. You know, they, they really think so. It was think it's about them, but it never is. It's what comes after you're done with your life, not what happens during it. Can't you not see? Are you blind to the truth? Fools, all of you. I will take your weapon away, there you go. And and then what? What are you gonna do then? Huh? Flashy? Someone like you should not be in this place. Pathetic. Absolutely pathetic. A spine! Spine driver activated! Okay, that was the lank. You just hit him right in the lank there. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do, most likely. Anyone else? Still kicking? Nope. Doesn't seem to be the case. Let's heal up. Let's make sure we're all good. There we go. So yeah, again, like... Pretty, pretty solid crew here at this point. Look at that guy. Look at, look, look at, look at that one, dude. Still up! You know, Bone King sure does have a few tricks up, but he has been smited with the very scythe he used to wield back there. Yeah, it's, it's, it belongs to my spine now. Let me yoink. Just like that. Where are we going? Who are we killing? Who are we going after? This guy all the way back here? Who can't even use his hands properly? Okay. 61 damage. Nice. 60. And still kicking somehow. Oh, wait. We got, we got a feral skeleton behind us there. Let's quickly deal with this one. Look at this fleshy. Trying to get away. Pathetic, truly. Honestly, that makes me sick to the marrow. Put a stop to this. Absolutely. Destroyed. Yeah, ancient, ancient graveyard turned into um, ancient battlefield at this point. Would you look at that? Are you not feeling too lag with your legs there, buddy? It's okay, it's okay. We can take a bit of a breather. I mean, don't really need to breathe, but still. You get it. Oh, yeah. I mean, if this is all that's left, then it'll be pretty, pretty straightforward. If that's all they got on us, then we're basically done here. I don't want to... What the hell? I don't want to go anywhere up there. What the hell are you faking, man? Let's see. Any... Any final rights for you guys? Yeah, I don't, don't think because he has a bit of a limp that he is not going to be good at fighting. Don't you dare think that for just a moment. Oh, dude, we're... We kind of got stunlocked there, like, rips took a bit of a damage there. A damage, yes. Of a beating, actually, I should say. Uh, I thought as much. More coming out of the buildings. Spawn, I hope, is going to be fine. Where's Rips at? Who? Who are you? Rips, look, I mean, I respect you. I really do. But that, that's not the guy you should be fighting. The guy's up here. He, like, what, what? Like, is, is it gonna, like, maybe laugh tap you a little? And that's it? Yeah, his spine's legs aren't doing too well right now. 
But you should see the others. Oh boy. Also, that's mine. Yeah, I mean, again, absolutely getting beaten up there. Yep. That's good. How are we doing up here? Bonten. Giving him hell? Seems like it. It's rattling! Rips! No! Impossible. How... How would you be able to take out ribs like that? Hey, there's one, Bonetin. There still seems to have some fire left in him. Clearly. Gotta get rid of that now. Yeah, this guy's just trying to get away. With his, like, uh, one destroyed limb. What are you guys? Are you the flashies from earlier? Are you a flashy? No, it's a, it's a sniper bot. <laughs> yeah, that sniper bot kind of like showed up at the worst time. Like, genuinely, like... There's not a good time for a sniper bot to appear. <laughs> a machine in this sacred place! Okay, boys, you know how to deal with them. Let's make him shut down. It's so weird to actually see, like, a mechanical skeleton here, you know? <laughs> After being, like, actual skeletons for, like, this long. Oh. Skeletal reinforcements here. RIPS, NOT AGAIN! Okay, come on. Take take out this little scally boy. This is kind of getting on my nerves. We can renegade sniper bot settling here. Okay, there's, there's his arm crippled. Whoa! He kicked him! It's barely an attack! Spine, come on! There's nothing you can handle. See? You got one down, you didn't even attack him. Another one down, didn't even try. <laughs> There's a lot of limping skeletons out here during like the pursuable ash storm right now. <laughs> you win this side. Yeah. I'm gonna limp back inside then. A bone in. Yeah. <laughs> We're turning this place into a starting area for a RPG right now. That's what's happening here. Hey, that sniper bot. Um, surely must have had some some supplies on him of some sort. That's uh, you know you don't need that. You don't need that if you were to use it, of course. Um. There we go. Bolts? I'll take those. Eagle's Cross? Oh, I mean, that's pretty good, don't get me wrong, but like... Are oh, you gonna be using that now? I don't think so. I remember one time, there was some enemy, I don't know who it was exactly. I thought it was being smart by removing their weapon, right? I thought it was being clever. Like, hi, I can use a weapon. I did not realize they were a god at martial arts. So I got my ass kicked by them. I I don't remember who it was. So like they they wielded some massive sword, right? Like one of those gut swords. And I was like, yeah, dude. Like if I remove this weapon, it'll be it'll be way better. Little realizing that they will beat me up with only their hands. You know? I I did not even realize they were like that good of a martial artist. Come on, someone hit him. Can't be that hard, surely. Okay, that one's down. Gonna be rebooting. Crippled, but rebooted. My graveyard. You understand? Mine. 
guy's just absolutely running away in the distance there. Like, <laughs> I mean, what what's he gonna do? He has one arm absolutely crippled. The other one is um, absolutely missing. Bone man lacking. Okay, so the, the Bone King is still up. And he is still dying. His chest isn't doing too well. But it will be gone soon. Yeah, left arm gone. Like, again, th those those guys, they're... They're, um... Not really gonna be of any issue. To me. They're not really gonna be a thing we need to bother with. Dying. Dying. Sure is gonna be dying soon. Dunk. This guy, everyone! This guy! Pick him off! Mmm. Right on that good old noggin. Alright, yeah, I mean, uh, I think we've done some solid work here. Don't you think, guys? Lots of solid work. How about, we, uh, how about we repair the gates now? Just to all quick like. Gonna be able to claim this place after all, right? And now we close the gates. Gonna be able to, to be in peace after all, right? After doing all of this fighting. Please don't hurt me! Graveyard Keeper. Yo, they have a peeler! A uh, graveyard? What's a <laughs> what's a graveyard? Um, there are these things out there. They're skeletons, well, creaky uh, calcium kind, not the beep poop like uh, you. Oh, my helpers! They seem to be uh, malfunctioning. Malfunctioning. Those bowmen are killing everything inside. Yes, this bone man, as you call them, are my creation. But what about me? I'm also one. Uh, to dig and fill graves and make new corpses for them. Uh, please, you have to help me. Many corpses uh, back to the schedule. Is we were about time to win this. I say as I attack him. I I, I think we just spawned a different instance of him, right now. Yeah, yeah, it's 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 just a different instance of the same guy that just spawned there. Control box. Arm bones? Yo, we got some we got some nasty arm bones back here. Look at that. Yeah, yeah those those arm bones sure are looking looking dangerous there. Skeleton muscles, you know those those things here. You know, severed severed limbs here and there. Control boxes. Oh my god, a man's glitching out of the uh, out of the scene. Impossible. Preposterous. So is he like down? Can someone check up on him? But hey, they do have peelers after all. Where are you going, Rips? Rips, where are you going, Rips? Rips, where are you going, man? Rips, where are you going, dude? Hello? I suppose you, you, you know better than me, right? So you need to go outside to check on him. I like how this guy died leaning against like the wall there. Who this? Oh, is that a sniper bot? Wait, <laughs> the gate got locked again? You know, again, I'd, li I'd like to think of this as my new home. Per se. How about, how about we, 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 like, help pick the slot real quick again? Okay. Now, I know he had a, he had a bit of a special scythe on him. There we go. Uh, control box, a bit of another repair kit. Out of range. Oh, this, uh, who, who, who is not out of range? This guy? This guy? Is everyone out of range? I guess so. I mean, Rip seems to be like the closest one. 
Can move this around there. Out of range. Well, how about we kidnap him? Yeah, that's that that's the idea here. We kidnap so we can take his stuff. Just like that. Alright. And then we put everything here on the side of the bag. So we can simply carry this. Instead of that little thing that we had on us. And it would be also a little more thematic, you see. Shoddy green. I mean, let me hold on to those and, and like, drop them as well. Because why not? And look at this guy with his bad scythe, you know? Oh yeah, put him into the peeler. Oh my god, are you actively repairing this guy? Wait, it's not one of ours, it's, it's someone else. Well, that'll that'll make sure that uh oh sorry, there's just a bit of a uh bit of a rat like out here. Move move one tooth, that'll be gone. Alright, let's let's go go back and close the gate. Everyone's inside, right? I see the Gorilla's healthy again. With his limb trauma. Is he really still trying to fix this guy? A oh, hello, human. <laughs> okay, let's beat him up. Let's beat him up just like we beat up his clone there. Spine? Spine? Spine, you okay, Spine? Spine's fine. But this guy ain't. Ah, poor spine, poor spine. Let's get you this. Let's do the same switcheroo as we did before. Okay. Sure, we can do that. Um, you'll move... Move his stuff around, so... If nothing else, he, he will just be naked. There you go. Ah, nature being nature on the outside, you know. That's that's all there is to it. Well, let's, let's heal up. Keepers are now hostile towards you. Who? Who is? Um, faction. Keepers? Who, who are the keepers, man? Who are those? Well, doesn't matter. Oh, wait. Guys, back up. And it's down. And it's back down. I, I think we've peeled them enough back there. Um... He's very much dead. Well, put in the next one. Make sure that one's gonna be gone too. Uh, it's lovely to have a peeler at your side now, is it not? Well, hello there. You, you, my fellow rattlers. <laughs> now, why hello there? Didn't expect you to be around here. And bombing, and whatever you're doing. Well, let's fast forward that one. Yes, yes, I'll, uh, again. As always, I'll just take those with me. Let's heal up. Just a bit of healing here. Right, next building. Hello, knock knock. Yeah, there's a few guys. Nothing, nothing too crazy though. Ninja blade and ninja swords. Eh. Yeah, we're gonna use our small arms in here. 
You can't can't go big. On these guys necessarily. A little little too tight in those rooms here, you see. Alrighty. And they're down. All of them. Yep, I'll I'll be helping myself to those. Hair urn. Interesting. It's the only one what I'm trying to get. No, I'm not I'm not trying to get the pearls. I'm really not. Right, group heal. Do some group healing again. And we'll be good. Like what is there? Human teeth? Wooden bowls. Got the usual, the usual. Pick them locks. I mean, what could they possibly be hiding in there, right? Oh. <laughs> oh. There's, there's not a lot of them. Surely nothing we can't deal with, right? No, take, taking them hits, taking them hits now. There's quite a lot of them. Quite a lot of them. The, I can't help myself but what was actually inside of the big one. I like the, the big old building there. Yeah, man, they, they, they hurt my arms, you see? The tables, they turned! No! It can't be! The tables turning. Just like that? Man, that... That big gorilla is doing pretty well for the fact that it's not doing pretty well. Its left leg is absolutely abysmal right now. We're at it. Yeah, I mean, he took a bit of a head to the head. These two. Chest, mainly. E. And these guys won't be going anywhere anytime soon. It's just like, by the time they stand up, all hell's gonna break loose here. Dude, what a mad lad. Spine, look at ya. <laughs> I don't know, maybe, maybe ribs? Maybe ribs can go inside? You know, deal some stuff with some stuff in there? Or, you know, we're just gonna keep this place locked. <laughs> we could do that. They don't even notice. Wait, they, they absolutely did notice. What's this like? What's this like? Huh. Well, what's the... What's the last auto save? Surely we'll, fi we'll be fine there. Smarter. You know, about, like, not going in there. But yeah, I mean, I just I just want to look in that place and I think then we'll be good. Because, yeah, we've been going for quite some time and we technically did achieve our goal of, um, what is basically claiming this place here. And, and we all should be able to have those little bone backpacks because apparently when you, like, challenge one dude... When you like tell him to like, oh my god, why is this song so loud? I'm just gonna turn it off. You know, like when, when you challenge the one guy to a fight, uh, he, he basically just keeps dropping backpacks for you. Oh shit. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. That many, eh? Huh. Well, damn. It is sure that I had a little cohort up there waiting for us. Which uh, seems to be giving us quite a bit of trouble. Because I don't know how well our guys are going to be, handle, uh, be able to handle this. Again, he's better at defending than attacking, so maybe that's why he's still standing. And it's fallen. <laughs> and he fell back down there. Hey, going, going. 
Go on, see, see, see what I got, see what I got. Come on, man. Ah, uh, shoot. Can you heal yourself? Well, he can. Oh, this one can, alright. This is just gonna be healing in the back there. Oh, bone ten. Oh, why? Oh, you, you, you poor, poor, innocent fool. You fool of a ten. Hey, spine. Hey, spine. Come, come, come over here, would you? I'll admit it. It kind of caught us by surprise there. I'll be the first one to admit it. Yeah, though, if we were, you know, um, fully well, battle stacked, you know, you know, full health and all that, that, that might, might be different, might be different. Right there. Oh, the bones are going back in there. <laughs> Bone 10 died. That's how badly they got him. That's how badly they did. Okay, uh, honestly, just, just, just kind of go to the next floor. I want to see what's up there. Is it just like this dude's throne room? Is it just that? Let's see. Oh man. Surely would have been able to block that, right? No, it's down. I'm, I'm still surprised on how well he is holding up here. I know. Uh, that, that guy is quite a legend. Good old reps. I'm happy for him, you know, it's just it's doing it's doing solid work here. With that said, it ain't gonna last too long now. It's just gonna go down soon. <laughs> right. Let's fast forward a little, yeah. Still still standing there. What a what a absolute beast of a skeleton rips this. Good god. But yeah, now, now we know that up here is basically only the throne room. And things like that. That's pretty cool. It's also handy to know that, um, you know. Wait. One thing I'd like to see, though. One last thing I'd like to check on. If we do load back here, right? We had three of our... Uh, of our guys, and stuff only two. We reload this, right? I'm not too sure if inside of the room, if there was, um... Like, basically, this is after we've beaten up this one guy, right? Yeah, see that? See this right here? We call it a scout and repair bed. It's... It's pretty handy, actually. Oh, I, I I still have to pay for rentals, though. Well, that's awfully awkward. Yeah, uh, he, he, here I was thinking I don't need to pay for rent. Apparently, I still do, though. So. <laughs> yeah, well, that's um, that's that's mighty awkward, you know. But that's gonna be able to get us to full capacity, like, pretty much immediately. You sure don't. Alright, uh, that's 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 good, that's good. That's really nice. I ignore those terrible sounds. They're, they're just out here. Of, of the big old gorilla. Just gonna hang out in there. Okay, then, then, then we gotta pulverize the bat. No real reason. Simply because we can. Attack this dude. Again, simply because we can. Right? Destroying him. Okay, who has it? Is it Spine? Yeah, Spine has him. Alright, put him in. Uh, keepers are not hostile to you. Which, I, I, I imagine it's like, just that one guy. Imagine that's basically what the keepers mean. Yoink, just to make sure that Gorillo's dead. 
You know, going for good and all. Yeah, like, see, I, I wasn't sure if there would be a skeleton bed. But there is. There actually is. Which I'm really happy about. Because then we can just, like, heal up after every fight in there. Like, like these guys, and it'll, it'll take a little bit of back and forth fighting here, but, um... Like, yeah. They're, they're, they're all gonna go down. And give us some pretty... Pretty neat uh, repair kits, actually. It's a pretty juicy ones. Okay, we're good. Everyone's doing fine. Fine for the most part, yeah. Alright, beat him up. Serve him hell. Get these few skeletons. Those few skeletal remains. And whoever that was down there. And again. Yoink. And uh and a yoink. And a yoink. Um just uh there we go. <laughs> now repair one another if we can. Go in here, um be fairly certain that the peeler killed whoever was in there. This is mine. Oh yeah, because mm, because of the keepers being hostile. That's why we can't do it anymore. Fair enough, fair enough. That's fair, that's fair. Maybe not the best decision there. And then we go in here. Last but not least. Oh, that's... That's not what I wanted. See, that's... They're doing a drastic increase in numbers there. Come on, guys. I want to see you work for that. For this place here. Come on. Give them all. Give them all you got. Yeah, maybe we should have, like, peeled that one guy for last, you know. It would have been better. <laughs> and rips us down. And rips maybe back up. No, rips us back down. Ah, man, you know, you, you shouldn't really fight in here. You're way better when you fight outside, you see. If if we fight inside, if we fight inside, the enemy has the advantage, right? Because we, we use the big weapons that we can't use indoors, right? And we also would get a sizable indoors penalty. So if we do it outside, it'd be better. It'll be better for all of us. All right, Rubs, why don't you... Why don't you just... Nope. <laughs> not, not, not that. Not that. Go in. Spook him. Then we go... Then we go down here. Then we try and stay down here. And now... Now we unleash hell. All right? Now with our actual weapons that we use for mass destruction... Hopefully this will go a little better. I mean, yeah, Rips already hurting in the head. He's hurting in the chest. He is fine. Rips is down. The other one is down. He lost his arm. That's just a tough room. That's just a really tough room there. Hey, guys. <laughs> and still he goes in to fight more. And there they go, repairing one another. Right. There, there might be a better way to go about this, right? Maybe, maybe. Just mayhaps. Yeah, we just aren't the best fighters for, like, indoors. And there's a lot of them. There's a lot of them. So what if... Okay. What if we... We're just gonna fuck off again, right? We oh god, they triggered them. They already triggered. Well shoot. 
I mean, I suppose since that is the case, you know, I mean, uh, you guys, I guess, might as well clean up after yourselves then, yeah? Who knows, maybe, maybe it'll go better this time. It seems like there's far less of them here. So, wishful thinking, yeah? If it's not as many to swarm us, you know, it'll, it'll be better, right? It'll be better. Oh, did he get knocked down? Ugh, terrible. Got knocked down again, I see. How good are these? Eh, if they, they're like in the in the solid 30s there. With their with their attack. Come on, ribs. Come on, ribs. You're the man, ribs. Come on, ribs. Ribs, come on. Ribs, yes. Come on, beat him up. Kill him. <laughs> yes. You guys did it! No, no, don't, don't, don't celebrate too early. Okay. There's, there's still plenty of them, and you, you guys do need to, um, to recover it. You know, from, from your skirmish there. As always, I greatly appreciate anyone denying the healing to the enemy. As they have no right to have it. Rattling them in the process. So, let me take... Let me take this. <clears throat> I said. Let me take this. Guy here is probably gonna be dying just by himself. Yeah, he is. He very much is. Anyone else who may be alive? No, but we, we can have some more repairs done on us. So, you know, there's that, there's that. We, we cleared out some of them. We didn't aggro every single one, at the very least. Wait, uh, uh, I saw one of you go back up. Mm hmm. I see. It also looks like this is made out of bones. Kinda, I don't know if that's intentional or not. So, let's see. Is this guy sitting backwards on it? My god! But it seems like... That's all that's left up there. Uh, it was Max was apparently. They were hiding in the... In the corners. Corners of the eye, couldn't see them, you know? Well, that's just gonna... It's gonna be a rip fight, probably. I know. How tough are they, by the way? 33 toughness? That's... Again, it's not too much. Like, that, that's about, like, what you'd expect, right? But you better keep guarding your chest there. You for a moment, I thought rips went down. The way they hurried over. Mm, big strike on rips. Bone 10. Pull it, pulling his weight down there in this 1v1. Come on, guys. We're gonna help him. Oh, no. Who did that now? Who did... Who did open that now? It was going so well, too, you know? <laughs> it was going so nicely. Who... who Now, who done open that? <laughs> oh, man. And it was going actually well. Until, you know... The door has been opened. Yep. <laughs> yeah, actually, kinda not bad until that happened. I mean, even then, Rips is able to take out a few of them, apparently. By himself here. De dealing, dealing quite the pain here. But also very likely to go down. Ah, uh, what a... What a way to go, huh? Can you heal up? Can you able to do that? They're all gonna notice ya? Nope. No, because they all notice ya. At least you took down one of them. You know? Come on, ribs. <laughs> now you're the one who's gonna be healing up. 
How clumsy, how clumsy of this door to open just like that. If it wouldn't be for the chest damage Bonten has, then, then it'd be fine, that'd be fine. But sadly he is pretty hurting there. Are you trying to stand up? Stop. Okay, hold on. Maybe, maybe if we aggro just a few of them here, you know? With some better odds. Come on, Rips, come on! Come on, Rips! Ah, oh, Rips. Oh, poor Rips. Again, it would have been just fine if it wouldn't be for this door opening there in the end. Just like it did. Even then, this, this guy did some work too. Alright, fast forward a lot. Yeah, they're just kind of healing one another now. Hey, mind giving me a little pick-me-up? Oh. <laughs> I think it is a no. Just gonna be just gonna be camping my body. That it? That all? Yep. But so yeah, it it was good. It really was good. Until Until that one door got opened in the side. Until that side door got opened, it was all fine. But once these guys came out, that is when we just lost, basically. Like we didn't have much of a chance then. It was too many of them at once. Oh, well, I didn't expect we'd just start with this speed, but sure, let's go. Yeah, let's absolutely decimate this one man. Any healing we need? Anything? They're, they're all dying now. Critical rebooting, dying most likely, yeah. Playing dead. Uh, shame, shame our guy's gonna be like, oh, well, it doesn't belong to me, you know, it's not mine, it's not mine, boo-hoo, crying, crying noises. What's in here? What's this little, little box? Uh, a lot of limbs, grave tools, and more repair kits, and nutri rations. Model bone, this weapon is probably a few hundred years old. Uh, it's surprising that the bone hasn't crumbled to dust. I suppose so, yeah. Can't from Scrap Master, yeah. So that's where you get that from, huh? Some guys just meandering. Playing dead, I'm surprised they're able to do that after getting beat up like this. Okay, who's the, who's the fastest? I, I, f I think it's pretty clear it's ribs. Rip's got his arm somewhat damaged, and that's about it. By the way, Gorillo killing a bat. Just so you know, just so you can see it. Okay, so 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 we went in there, dipped our toes in. And anyone take the bait? No. No. Yes. Yeah. Now now they absolutely took the bait. Now we want to be regrouping there. We want to be regrouping. All the way down here. So if if this door was to open. It uh, would be would be fine. We'd be a little further away from, from ground zero. You know. And we can kind of deal with those guys with a bit more ease. Without having to worry about it like skeleton closet. And see we were taking them out. One by one here. Because again, we're, we're better at fighting on the outdoors than in the indoors. No, sadly, Bone Ten got head, got hit in the head. Can't even talk properly. Okay, deal with him. Deal with him. Yes, yes. Getting there. Just a few more of those guys, and we're good. There we go. Yeah, get him. Trying to crawl out of there? Seriously? You think that'll get you anywhere, buddy? I uh, know they wanted to attack someone. 
Don't know who yet. But let's patch ourselves up. Again, let's deny them their healing. Surely don't want them to get back up. So, uh... Take this. Take, take all of their goods. It's fucking here and, 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 and there. There we go. Take this. Take those. And even this. At the very least, I'll be, you know, fully charged in terms of my healing, you know. There we go. That'll, that'll do, I'm sure. That'll do. Right, saving the game yet again. This is my tomb. Right, this is my tomb. Not to be confused with any other old tomb. Yeah, again, I... <laughs> this one door opening really didn't do me any favors there. Alright. Ribs. Yeah, let's take another look in there, yeah? I think the place is empty. I think we can actually sit down here and claim the bone throne. Wouldn't wouldn't wouldn't, wouldn't that be cool? Yeah. And here we go. Claiming the bone throne. Finally returning to the graveyard and defeating the bone king. The bone rattlers. We're back home, and, and, and they, they sure did claim it, alright? That ancient graveyard, and that's theirs now. With all the skulls of their enemies around them. I know we, we started as some um, decent combatants. Who the fuck are you? I'm currently doing the epilogue. Fuck off. Die. <laughs> Anyways, they started as like decent combatants, but they, they, they far, far paced their previous selves, no? But yeah. I think that'll be it. For today's stream for Bone Boys. So, with that said, I'm out of the game. <laughs> I, I I will save it as my tomb. Yeah, there's still that one skeleton closet, honestly, but let, let's let's be honest here. If if my guys are full health, they're gonna beat it. <laughs> let's let's be absolutely honest here. They they would be just fine. So um yeah. Yeah, hope you guys enjoyed what you saw today. If you're new to the channel, do consider dropping a follow. Always appreciate that. And, um, yeah, yeah. Potentially more country to come in the future. As I, I really want to do the, um, the, the, the one run where it's in the Falklands. So, yeah. I'll see you guys around and uh, have a good night. Or morning or afternoon, whichever it is. See you around. Bye-bye. Take care. Bye-bye. See ya.